Hey everybody, welcome to the stream. We got four tournaments ongoing as we speak. A 3,000 guarantee, two hours of late registration, a 2,000 guarantee, Hyper Turbo Super Stack, a 1,000 guarantee, two hour late registration, six max, an 800 guarantee, two hours of late, registra late registration, eight max. So we are in, in it right now. Um, so let's get to the action, shall we? Let's go over to the multi table so you can get a look at everything that's going on. These are the four tournaments we're in. Our buy ins, pro buy ins are $42.40. And we haven't cashed in anything at this time. So I just want to welcome you to the stream. We've got some uh, new things added. Um, be testing one of the things that you can test out is the uh punch feature it's not to do on this page because it won't work but if anytime i'm at a table single table where i'm showing a single table view you can do exclamation point um punch and uh and punch me in the face so just have a little fun um you also can, we got some different features, but we got some things that uh, going on. I hope I'm going to try to make a final table um, because we do have some cool stuff there for the final table to differentiate the final table from the rest of the tables. So this is the early, early morning tournament grind. Um, this is basically, uh, my stream is up, designed, and fixed some tweaks from the last stream and wanted to go live again. Um, let's see, let's go over to board three. We've got pocket queens there. Um, I think in this case, it's fall this. Sometimes fall, sometimes raise. Um, and possibly we should have shoved there because we had um, only about 20 big blinds there. So but we'll see what happens here. A little conservatively, and that is a horrible flop. Game. Horrible flop. Oh, but uh, that helps. But also, it's very dynamic flop, very wet. So I'm gonna go ahead and bet out at this. See if we can get some. Uh... There we go, we take it down. Not bad. Okay. We got ace nine. Go back over to yeah we're all right at ace nine this is the only table that's going right now um this is a six player six max at 26 feet i'm gonna i'm gonna fold on this one it's pretty early i know that there's only six players only five maybe i should have played that one we'll go back over to the multi table here until we get some action here hope you like the new stream setup um I'm doing a lot of work on it. Finally, I think I have it where I like it. Um, and hopefully we'll be adding a mini me soon. Uh, what you ask is a mini me. Uh, well, if you ever seen the Austin Powers movies, um, a mini me, in this case, it's a 3D character that is wearing similar clothes to me with a hat. And, uh, He's going to interact with the stream. At this point, it'll just be one scene, but um, we'll be able to uh, add more scenes if it works. Um, that should be hopefully early this morning, a couple hours maybe, maybe during this stream. I don't know, maybe during the break. I'll check see if it's completed, and uh, we'll have something that we can show you, which would be pretty fun. Um, I'm looking forward to that. Uh, we are. Uh, in this case, we are on a three-minute delay, so um, I haven't been streaming on a delay lately. But I figured we got a, there's a, a limp over here on board. Weird. Um, let's raise this up. But he limped from early position, which, you know, is a little bit you know, kind of shady or sneaky like. And we do have an all-in here, so... Hmm. And this is a 1650 tournament. 
Um, wow, this is a, this is a tough position to be in. Um, I am not sure what to do here. Ah, uh, I guess we're gonna put it all in. We're gonna go for it. See if we can isolate. Wow, this is odd. Ace 10. Ooh, hold, hold, hold. Yes, all right. Booyah. Booyah, booyah. Not bad. And so we'll head back over to the multi table here. Let me know if you're here. Anybody's watching. I'm hoping to pick up some uh, followers tonight. There's some late night players out there who are looking for some action. I'm um, going to call up here, I guess. Um, not good. Hold down here. So let's head over to uh, board two. That's probably going to end up holding that. Check. I've been watching Jonathan stream tonight. He's at a final table right now. Um, I don't know if he's still going or not. It might be over. Hmm. I'll let this I'll let it go. So this is a turbo this one here at the table we're at now. Let me go back to the multi table. But the turbo, the top, this one over here, is a turbo deep stack. Um so that's gonna move really fast. Um there is, and it's a 10.50 tournament. $10.50 enter. There's uh, 85 players in that one. You can see that on there. Um, I'm going to defend the big blind here on table three. And it's not a very good flop for us. We have 22 big blinds here. So, not much we can do. So, we'll be folding that and we'll head over to table four. We have a big flick. Raise that up. It's an 800 guarantee. about this. And we do take it down. You see that? See that gets through. Not bad. Seventeen players, twelve of seventeen in this one. 85 big blinds. The 800 guarantee. There's 14 levels of late registration. Not too many players in this right now. Um, table one. Jack 10 suited. I think it's way too early. I'm suited. I'm gonna let it go. Um, and then on table two, we'll let. We will be holding a 10. 
back to the multi table here. Not much action going on here. There's two. Stream seems to be holding really well. Not any drop uh, frames, so it's looking good. Season 10 off. And I let my time bank get low there. While I was getting ready to stream, I was setting it up. I missed it. So we're gonna, we're gonna raise this up for it. Open it up. Open raise. King 10 off from the cutoff. And take it down. Let's go over to board one where we have uh, pocket seven. Hope you're gonna hear me okay. I've made some changes to the microphone uh, equalizer settings. Hopefully, it's a little bit less like I'm talking in a tin can. Um, my boom should be getting here. Mic boom should be getting here pretty soon. Uh, probably tomorrow or today. It already is tomorrow. As you can see the time there. That's my time. That's my local time up here in Vermont. So we do have pocket sevens. Um, this one here. Oh. There's a limp there. Um, check it. Uh, let's go to board three. Um, oh. Board three, we've got some uh, action going on here. I think I'm going to call this. Two six. Ooh. Okay, come on, we need. Ah. All right. We lost that. That clip. Um, back to table one. Um, we'll check it. One big line. Okay. I mean, for one big line, I think I, I can afford to see another card here. And he's just milking one point five. He must have. Ten, maybe he's got nines. He did limp. Maybe he limp with an eight. He's gonna pull the trigger on us deep here. I don't know. I don't think I'm gonna. I don't think I'm gonna mess around with this anymore. I'm gonna go with the other guy coming along. Let's see what happens here on that one. Queen on the river, that's Yeah, now now look at him. Full pot bet in the river. King Queen maybe. Hit the queen. But he limped. He limped. He limped. Yeah. Are we gonna see it? I don't know. I'm not sure we're gonna see it. Curious, no. Oh, Son of a biscuit eater. Come on. Oh. Just call. Boy, he's time banking. He's just tanking. Called A6. Okay, it was just small. A6. Small A. Ace Ragoff. I had Ace Ragoff. Do the full 
multi table view again. If I had just a little bit wider, if I could put my camera back a little bit wider, I could literally spin around. Can't quite do it though. So if I get too far away from the mic, that's the one thing I don't like. I, I like having a boom because I can kind of pull it with me. When I lean back, I like to lean back when I'm playing, kind of relax, play. But when the mic is sitting here on the desk, it's difficult to uh, to do that. And I like that you normally have the mic out of the scene, but the sound is so bad in the last recording. So we'll defend here with the King Nine. Oh, we only have three. What am I doing? I have to pay attention here. We got really low on that. That should have been probably just out there or cold. And uh, let it go. That was a mistake. mistake on my part. Pay attention how many blinds they got left. This one's a 660. If we do four levels of late registration, I might just jump into that one again. 660. Uh, Ace Deuce. Um, going to go all in Forward three, I'll bring it in. We're all in. We have uh, about four big blinds left, and we're going to jump into this one again if it goes. If uh, we uh, don't make it. Oh, no clubs. Ace. No clubs. Ah. All right. Well, we'll re-enter this one. So that'll add six dollars and sixty cents. Two. Good. Okay. Got the names here. That'll add 660 to the buy ins there. So I'll update that as soon as I can. And we'll, we'll head over to the multi table here for everyone. Um, we do have ace 10. Let's go to board two. Okay. Back in. So ace 10. Ace 10 suited. I'm on the small blind. Tough. All these just limp pot here. I'm afraid. I'm gonna call, but um, I am pretty deep in that. So I don't know. I'll call and see if we can see a flop here. I don't know. Maybe shoving. Somebody else might be limping and uh, hopefully just falling and not shoving on it. And not a good flop for Ace 10. Diamonds. Um, we'll be folding this and we're going to go over to board one. The full day spin off. Queen. We do hit top pair, top kicker. Down. I'm back to uh, let's go over to three. Get Ace Jack. He just got raised. Ace Jack off. Hmm. Unfortunately, probably going to fold this. We just re entered that one. So we'll let it go. So 
over the table uh, to the two. So we get Jack 10 suited. That's a better position for Jack 10 suited. Four big lines up against a couple big stacks here. Man. Okay. All right. Um, call. Decent. Cool. Call here. And now we have a plus draw. And the straight draw. And he has a he has a straight blocker. I mean, we got this. I'm gonna I'm just gonna put it all in up here. And we take it down. That was a good one for us. Hmm. <clears throat> well, I'll defend. I don't think it's a good 9-4. It's one big line. I'll just take a little flop. We had a 9. Back. That's really, really good. That's really dynamic. That's really difficult. Um, check it. Oh, geez. Straight. That sucks. Jack. Split pot. Okay. Let the King Nine go. Hmm. So if you're out in the chat or out out there sitting or watching, uh, you could always do the exclamation point, uh, exclamation point punch, and uh, see what happens. A new feature that was added. Um, I'm gonna raise up back in here and then put this one. Back ten clubs, three. Do we get called? We try flop. And we'll do a bet on this one. end up you have some showdown value now um but uh oh think we're gonna oh we're gonna take this down yeah we got it awesome okay
Let me know what you think in chat. We can get some more followers, so maybe make the final table would be good. There we go. If you're gonna use the exclamation point punch, make sure you use it um, when I'm on a single table. Otherwise, you're gonna just won't work. Well, won't work right. It'll work. It'll, it'll be broken. So, haven't figured out. For the multi table. So I need to add another time to the buy in. Kind of a speculative hand to make a call. Seven suited. Again. Here we go. Not a good flop for seven to eight of hearts. Respect it, give up. Ace. Yeah, we'll check that one, give up. Um, we'll go back to the table there. Um, we'll fold there and the ace jack off. Uh, I'm gonna fold that. Uh, open from early position, most likely your ace is going to be dominated. Uh, ace jack is going to be dominated. Oh, seven. Oh, quad seven. Wow. That's really good fold. But from early position, they're going to be opening up bigger aces, say queen and king. Um, A lot of times folding, I don't know, I, just, I like to fold ace jack off uh, if somebody's opening from under the gun. Um, how about we go to number two? And we'll raise this up. Pocket aces. There we Bring it on. Bring it on. Well, we hit a set of aces. Wow. Well, oh. Geez. And he's betting into it. Uh, I'm raise this up. Oh, wow, what's going on here? Well, I'm just gonna stick it all in, I guess. He's on a plus draw, probably. Oh, two pair. Hold. Yes. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> there we are. Back to the multi table here. That was a good one for us. 151 big lines in the uh, turbo.
<clears throat> Pretty early position for Ace Jack off. Let's hold it. Then Jack Ace here. We hit a seven. And we'll see bet. Get called for a slow down. Um. Hmm. Let this one go. Get the aces. So on the three we on that. So let's see. We'll uh, do just limp here. Limp with the aces and see if we can induce an all-in from the eighteen big blind stack. If I can take this, uh, oh, sorry, you're looking at the aces right now, so we're stuck. We're on that. Okay, we do get, so I'm just going to shovel over the top, the aces. And we, uh, gotta remember you're on that table, so you don't have. Um, 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 um. Okay, let me go back to multi table view for you. I just uh, folded pocket eight to shove there. Might maybe I should call that. I don't know. I don't know. <clears throat> Not a good flop for pocket five. Go over to table one. And 11 big blinds, roughly, here on table one. That's a, that was a $16.50 tournament. Um, let me try to hang in there. Uh, 38 places go in the money, so I'll just be checking this. I'm hoping to bink a five, which we don't. 10 is not good. Um, We'll fold it. Eleven big binds, 
38 places to win the money. So that table one there will be uh, with a 3,000 guarantee. I'll be getting a little tight. See if we can uh, you know, double up. Be nice to double up and uh, try to get closer to uh, cashing in that one. How's everybody out there tonight? Probably all sleeping. Um, let's go into table one here. Do get a raise from under the gun, but in this case, I'm willing to uh, make the call because it's suited. The last time you saw me fold Ace Jack off with when there was a raise from under the gun, this time I am going actually. I got nine big blinds. I think. I think I'm just gonna, gonna put it all in. Seems like a good hand to put it all in. I don't know if it's a good hand to do it on when it's an under the gun raise, but when I look down at that, the number of blinds, it's either it's either fold or shove, and oh, uh, ace. Wow. Uh, wow, we had a, had a lot of outs there. Uh, so we're going to close that table. Whoops, and I just timed out on this one, unfortunately. Um, we'll go back to the multi-table here. And we do have ace-10, and I'm going to fold ace-10. That was unfortunate on that ace-9. I mean, he called me with king-10. You know, he did it to king. I think, it was, I think we got it in good there. Um, could have folded, but oh well. That's the way it goes. I don't know if there's any another tournament we can enter. I will look for one. Um, let's see what we got here. First 20 minutes. There's really nothing going on this early in the morning. Check the medium, see if it's now. There's nothing. Yeah, 35 minutes. That's a $50 buy-in. Uh, and then, yeah, there's really nothing. Wow. Not much going on on America's card room at this time in the morning. Uh, 19 minutes, there is a 350 guarantee. And so that's... Uh, I don't know. Hmm. If anybody has any ideas, let me know. The medium ones, 34 minutes is a thousand guarantee, but it's a $55 entry. So I don't suppose I'll be starting that one. Oh, and there's, oh, there's the 600. I can enter for $630, a 5,000 guarantee. Uh, I don't think I'll be entering that one either. Um, doesn't look good prospect wise for a tournament here. Unless I do enter that smaller one. There's no anything I can jump into here. Hmm. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Hmm. Oh, it's a freeze out. What's this one? Oh, just a freeze out. Last level of late registration. We'll jump in this one at 660. Alright, we'll just jump in this one, see if we can get something going here. Let's see if we can get something going. Shall we? Uh, last level of late registration. I, oh, I have eight big blinds. Wow. Okay, let's see. We're going to have to hopefully catch a hand here and double up rather quickly. That's going to add another $6 to 6 That probably wasn't too wise of a decision. So we'll be at uh, 54 60 now.
<clears throat> well, I think I'll just. Oh, timed out. God damn it. Damn. The time bank get down too low. Um, we'll just put the Ace 8 all in and hope for the best on this one. Gotta get something going. Kings. Give me an ace. Oh. 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 Yes. Yes. All right. We doubled up. That's what we needed. Excellent. Excellent. Huh. That was a that was a gamble. And at least we got uh, close to 20 big blinds now. So we can... Uh, that's the last level of late registration on that as well. Um... Hmm. Queen Jack. Queen Jack. Three. Four, I'm sorry, table four. Uh, this one. Um. Ah. Okay. I'll give it a try. Eh, horrible clock. We'll be letting this go. Probably shouldn't have played it. Uh, hmm. Okay, we do have some showdown, showdown value now. I might have to give this a call. Oh, oh. All right, we're gonna check it. We have kings. We'll let this one go. We have kings on another board here. On board, table two. Oh, we do. Take that one down. Let's go up to table two here where we've got the kings. Um, okay, we're gonna be putting this all in. We're gonna raise this up. Uh, we just shove up here. Jack, first king. Oh my god. Oh, I'm not running too well tonight. Oh, that's. That's just brutal, man. That's just brutal. That is brutal. Wow. Wow. Hmm. All right, stay focused. Stay focused. That hurt. Not good. Uh, multi table here. Let's see the action. That wasn't good. Wow. Oh. Tough, tough, tough. Forty two places fill in the money on uh table three, this one here. I'm going to defend the big line. Nine. But, but, oh, okay. This is looking better. So, hmm. I should 
Jack. I should put a half pop bed out there. Throw out the fold. Okay, we take it down. 34 big blinds now. Queen 10. Um, I'm just going to put an auto fold on that. We'll wait and see what happens. Twenty-five places still in the money up here, and forty places still in the money. Um, in the thousand guarantee, the three thousand guarantee is uh, twenty-five places still in the money. So we have fourteen big lines there, so there's a good possibility that we might be able to min cash in that one, and that might be the goal unless we double up. But we'll play pretty tight and conservatively. Um, this might be good just to, to limp, see if we can see a, and we do get a stop. Strong decision. Hold. Hold. Queen, queen. Suited. Table two, sorry. We will go back to the multi table because we have pocket tens on table one. So we've got some action here on two tables. Oh, let's see here. Um, big lines. All this. Tens. Queens down here. Wow. We've got, we've got all kinds of stuff going on. Um, The tens, I'm going to put it all in. We do hit top. Top pair up here, not top kicker, but we do have the top pair with the diamond. Oh, is that a 10? Hold on. Yes. Oh, wow, that's great. Whew. Yes, that paid off. Um, wow. Oh, and I timed out again on that. Damn it. Uh, wow. This. Is a spot. Uh, what the hell? This is crazy. It's gonna call. Oh, hold. Yes. Hmm. Ooh yeah. Ooh yeah. We'll head back to the multi table. Ooh. All right, table one here. We've got uh, Ace King, and we are, you know, we're up to thirty big blinds on that. We entered that at the last level of late registration, so um, pretty good. We'll raise it up. And we do get a shove, the ace king. We will call. Pocket fours. Oh, he hits a set of fours. Man. Just getting hammered. Set of jack, set of fours. Back to the moment. Twenty places still in the money. We do have twenty-three big blinds. We just lost that all in on table one up here. Um, that was unfortunate. The ace king with a set of set of fours. So, but with twenty places still in the money, I'm gonna hang in there. I'm forty-second out of eighty-three. Um, we can play super tight. We'll try to get there. And try to get there. That's all we can do. 
Checked and suited. Oh, uh, no, I'm not going to call this. Man. Thirty-three places until the money down here. So we have a pretty, pretty, pretty short stack. I mean, we're you know twenty big blinds, twenty big blinds on each table now. Five levels left. We got really killed up here. A set of jack. Um. That set us back in that turbo. So that's going to be hard to cash in. Unless we can double up here pretty soon. Jack fixed off isn't going to do it. 3-4 suited on the, on the button. Uh, I don't think we'll be messing around with that. big blinds left on table two being three off yeah so we're getting really short up here and we got four levels of late registration okay so the break is starting up hope hope you're enjoying the stream hope you're enjoying the action i'm trying to do my best you know i'm i'm an aspiring poker pro i'm not a poker pro so any suggestions you have or things you think i might have made a mistake in definitely let me know in the chat and i hope you're enjoying the stream we're gonna go back over and survey what we've got going on here at the main stage so we have four tournaments um and my current buy-ins are 54 dollars as you can see over here and so we've got buy-ins 54 dollars and 60 cents uh with cash for nothing but we are close on two there's 32 the uh, 3,000 guarantee which you see over there is uh, we're uh, 16 players to win the money. That's the first tournament at the top. And then uh, the third tournament, the 1,000 guarantee, that one is um, 32 places to win the money. And we're pretty short stacked on pretty much every one except for the $800 guarantee. Oh. And that other one is still running. But we're on break. So I'm going to take a break and I will be right back with you. So um, don't go anywhere soon. Stay tuned.
Okay, well, we got one, <clears throat> one started up here, so... Um... We are going to, um, yeah, Jonathan, I can help you in a second. I'm listening to Jonathan Littleson's, um, I'm going to be putting it all in up here with Ace King. Hold, hold. Yes. There we go. That was a nice little double up. And now we pick up Kings. We'll go right back to that board. Jack suited. Um, triple fold. Oh. Well, we're gonna go. We're gonna go the multi, multi way here because we've got uh, kings. Put it all in up here. Okay. Oh, hey! Thanks for the follow. Appreciate it. Right on. Who is that? Who is that? Who is that? <laughs> Into a raid? A raid? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Wow, we got a raid. Who, who, who's raiding me? Alex! Alex! Right on, man. Dude, I appreciate it. Wow. Thank you so much, Alex. Thank you. Thank you so much. I do appreciate it. Wow. Welcome, everybody, to the stream. Alex, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. A um, little overwhelmed here. I was kind of by myself and <laughs> I was just kind of playing. But uh, yeah, now I'm all self-conscious here. Uh, but yeah, I appreciate that. And um, I love everybody coming in. Thanks for uh, watching. We're in four tournaments here. And oh man, this is what the... Oh, this is tough. This is tough. Um... Wow. Um, well, I'm getting raised here with my kings. And uh, five, six, seven, eight, nine got there. Uh, wow. Uh, wow. Wow. This is this is hard. Um, whoa. Let's uh, zoom in on this here. Wow, thanks for the follow. Thank you. Uh, I am not sure what to do on this one here. This is... this uh, uh, 8, 9. Um, uh, I guess... I guess I'm going to fold it. Fold it. Wow. So we are in a three-minute delay. Uh, thank you for following BJT024. And uh, there was someone else... Um, or it was Alex. Appreciate the follows, guys. Thank you so much. 88. Wow, Alex. 88. Thank you so much. That's just <laughs> that's awesome. Um. All right. Well, we hit the ace up. Uh, let me put the multi board so you can see it. We got a lot of action here. We got eights. We got sixes. We got. Uh, Ace three with now we have two pair up there. Call with the sixes. We do have a set of sixes, but with flush out there. Check the eights back. Um, we will uh, do a bet half pot on this one. With the ace three. Um, 
people at the eights go. Thanks, hey, thanks for the follow. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, I got to call the sixes. And now we've got a full house here. So if he does have a flush, we don't have to worry about that. We're just worried about a king. So this is going to be a, like a check call here, I think. Uh, I'm going to have to call this, whatever he does. Uh, now I'm going to value bet this. And he folds. Okay, that was good. So we're at 48 big blinds. 27 till in the money. 9 places till in the money. Um, thanks, thanks for everybody. Wow, thank you. Thank you for the follow. Wow. Holy cow, man. This is overwhelming to me, guys. Uh, <laughs> it's, uh, wow, wow. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, holy crap. Uh, this is, uh, it's overwhelming. Thanks, guys. Um, I try to, uh, play and stream at the same time is hard, especially when all of a sudden people are, uh, coming in. Uh, El Elshmaz, thank you for the follow. Thank you, thank you so much. Hope you like the stream. Hope you like what I got set up here. You're seeing the multi-board set up right now. Um, and I'll be folding the A6 here. Check. Yeah, a little overwhelmed right now, so you know what? <laughs> uh we'll let this one go okay i just gotta breathe now all of you 88 people most people i've had in my stream ever <laughs> so <laughs> uh all right see if i can get myself grounded again and focused and uh see where we're at Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for the thank you for the follow. So we are on a 3 minute delay. Um we are nine places until the in the money up on table 1 here. Um I'm hoping I got you know 23 big blinds. I'm hoping to at least min cash in that one. Earlier today, we did make a final table um, in my last stream, which was nice. So I've been having a pretty decent run, but uh, this session has been rather tough. I've run into a set of sixes, a set of jacks. Uh, my kings just got, you know, uh, shoved on on the river. So it's been a little bit tough. But this uh, hyper turbo is that's the one where I ran into the set of jacks, which took most of my chip. Um, at Queens. All right, I gotta calm down and breathe here with everybody new here. Surely a call with the draws out there? Huh. Ah, yeah, let me know. Oh, uh, okay, when I'm on one table, guys, uh, you guys can, uh, so you can punch me in the face. Uh, it's uh, a new feature I added, uh, but I have to be at a single table, not, not the multi table. Uh, it's ex exclamation point um, punch. So wait till I get to a, a single when I when I zoom in on a table here, and then some. You guys can give it a test. So I'll just I'll just uh, I'll just put. If anybody wants to give it a try, um, I don't know. It's on a delay. I don't know how it's gonna work, but uh, when you do, just make when you see me on a single table, go ahead and use the exclamation point uh, punch, and uh, and you know. Watch what happens. I gotta close Jonathan. He's rambling in my ears. <laughs> or I just mute him. Uh, he's at a final table right now. He just needed some help with the stream, so I was, uh, he wanted to cover up his cards. I don't know. I guess he's gonna go live or something. Um, or maybe he didn't have the delay on. I don't know. <laughs> he had a bad session all day. And maybe he just discovered that he forgot to put the delay on. And he's been getting clobbered. All right. Uh, we got the deuces here with 20 big blinds. Six places still in the money. I think I'll just... Uh, I'm just going to give them up. Thanks. Uh, we'll go with the back to the multi-board here. Appreciate it. Move time 99. 
And if I don't get a chance to thank all of you for following, I'm thanking you now. I really appreciate it. Um, let's see. We'll raise up the pocket fives. And again, you always make suggestions. Uh, I, again, again, remember I'm the aspiring poker pro, right? In other words, aspiring is want to be poker pro. So yeah, I have a lot to learn. Um, last level of late registration in the uh, the hyper hyper turbo. Oh wow! Thank you, thank you for the follow. AK Jordan, appreciate it. Uh, we get raised with the pocket fives. God, man. Huh. Um, out of position. Um, Thirty-nine big blinds. I'm gonna let it go. I probably shouldn't have just. I should have just folded in the first place. Thirty-nine big blinds. I need to be able to be able to shove on someone. Um, we'll raise this one up. All right, I could. All right, I gotta get to thinking again. But with everybody here, I'm all nervous now. So, <laughs> so uh, we'll fold. So again, when I, when I get to a single table, uh, just make sure you give me uh, do explanation point punch. And when I'm when I'm at a single table, and you can punch me in the face. Uh, like that. Let's see here. Uh, there's nothing nothing to focus on. It's all pretty much not too much going on card wise. But if anybody wants to try it, explanation point punch. I'll put myself over there. And so give it a try if anybody wants to give it a try. Explanation point punch. Oh, oh Jesus. That hurt. <laughs> awesome. We'll go back to the multi table. Hey, thanks for the follow. Hi, Tower. Thank you, thank you so much. So we're four places still in the money up here on the, the first table. I'm, I'm just hoping to min cash in this one. My total buy-in is $54. I haven't cashed yet, so I'm hoping to min cash uh, four places. So I got 17 big blinds. I'm just going to be trying to hold... Hey, thanks. Thanks, Hightower. Appreciate it. Glad you, uh, I should be kind of following that. Yeah, appreciate it. Appreciate it. Okay. Try to follow the chat, guys. I'm a little overwhelmed right now with everybody here. Now I see what it's like when you guys have people in your stream. <laughs> a little, a little, uh, a little overwhelming. Ooh, ace nine, 16 big blinds. Oh, that's a tough one. Um, I'm going to try to go for the money, guys. I'm going to let it go. I mean, he raised under the gun. He got re raised. So um, we'll let that one go. Uh, ace 10 with 10 big blinds. I'm going to put this all in on um, table two. We only have 10 big blinds. Ace 10 off. Let's, let's, let's see what happens. Anybody new here, don't forget, explanation point punch. That's the latest feature I added. When I'm at a single table, uh, it works. If you do it when I'm at the multi-table, it, it's not it's not working yet. So, I mean, it'll show up, but I chose to put my camera in the middle, and I kind of like being in the middle there. Ace-10, are we going to hold? Yes. Yes. All right. We needed that one. Perfect. Okay. Four places. All right. And we're 20 places still in the money uh, on this table here, table two, table three, I mean. Oh, yeah, you got me. <laughs> you got to be at a single table for it to work. I have not figured out how to. Ah, let, let me get a single table, guys. Got to be at a single table for it to work. 
So let me uh, let me let me go over to one here. Um, I'll just I'll just uh, oh, I'll go down here to table three. So now's the time to do it. Uh, we're on a delay, so uh, it's I don't know how it's working with the delay. Uh, I don't know how that works. It might be. Uh, I probably should have left the camera up there at the same place, and there wouldn't have been a problem. But uh, I really like when I do the multi table. I could not keep myself from keeping that camera in the center. It just looks so good. And so I was like, okay, I have to figure out the punch thing later. Uh, not sure what I'm gonna do. Yeah, exactly, Alex. Yeah, I just, I, yeah. I just couldn't resist putting that camera down there in the middle. And I said, ah, I'll figure it out later. Um, but you're right. All right, well, let's uh, go down to table four because we actually have a nice hand here and we're going to be uh, raising that up. Uh, uh, no, we'll go to eight on that. Uh, maybe I should have gone ten. Or I could have just shoved on him. I don't know. All right, so. All in up from the uh, the other table, so we got we got some hands here. Ooh. We're all in on table two. We got ace queen down on table four. Table three, we've got tens, and we're going to as well put this all in and hold. Oh. Yeah. Okay. So the tens hold. Awesome. 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 Woo. Booyah. All right. Needed that one. Needed that one. Uh, I'm going to limp four five. Or just limp behind. See. You can't see a flop. If I get raised, I'll already have to let it in. We'll defend on table two, and we'll fold that four. Oh, man. Oh, that would have been a good flop for us. That would have been a good flop. <laughs> All right. We'll, we'll let this go. Okay. Um... Pocket fives on table three. This one's going all in. And we do take it down. Over to table one, we have ace queen. So it's the 14 big blinds. All in, maybe, maybe not. No, we're two places still in the money. I'm just gonna raise it up. Raise it up. Uh, man, yeah, I'll just raise it up. See what happens. And I can't be playing any speculative hands here. So, doing short stack. Two places still in the money. Um, I could have shoved that ace queen, but I kind of want to cash, so I'm that's why I just raised it up. Uh, maybe not the right decision, I don't know. Oh, we take it down, that's good. Now we can, okay, all right, gonna that helps. Eleven big blinds. On table two. Oh, I should get back to the multiplayer. Sorry about that, guys.
pocket fours under the gun will be a fold. Wow, okay, so we got 56, so we're out of late registration. I, I do like it when we finally get out of late registration on, on the uh, 2000 guarantee. We are out of late registration, 53 places until the money. I don't know if you can see that. I'm kind of covering it up there uh, on that board. Um, nine big blinds left. Oh. Yeah, the first night I, uh, Alex, the first night I didn't go, uh, I went with the, this is the first night I went with the delay in a long time. I've been just streaming live, but, um, tonight is like, ah, oh, better I'll put a delay on it. Okay. Um, this is interesting with the ace nine, um, being that we're so close to being in the money. I know I'm being conservative here but we got a limper there under the gun and I'm not sure what he's gonna do and ace night off I'm just gonna let it go I'm not gonna defend 10-5 pocket nines and table four Okay, nines, we're going to raise that up. Son of a biscuit eater. Damn it. Ugh. Okay. Wow. Oh, I'm gonna go. Ace King. Hold. Oh, God. <laughs> That's been happening. It's been rough. It's been really rough. Ace King and he flops quad king. <laughs> I've hit a set of six set of jacks with my queens. Uh, yeah, it's been rough. This has been a rough session. Really rough. Wow. Yeah, so it's a little weird being uh, the, the, the delay. I'm used to talking to people in real time. So I, I'm not that comfortable with that yet. Um, it's a little, um, a, little, a little strange. We're, we're one, yeah, one. We're right on the bubble of the money in the, on table one in the uh, 3,000 guarantee. We're in hand-for-hand -hand play. Let me go back to the multi table again. Whoa. Oh, wow, that took a while to load. What's going on here? Okay. Almost in the money. In the 3,000 guarantee. That'll, that'll help.
Wow, we're getting really, really low on blinds here. So, I don't know how much longer we're going to last here. We got 17 till in the money. We got nine big blinds on table three here. I'm going to need to double up something to happen so we can run a little deeper. Glad everybody came in to check it out tonight. I, I, again, Alex, I, I thank you so much, man. It's, uh, it's nice to have some people come in and take a look at my poker room. Okay, we're all in with the ace jack on table three. And then on that. use a double up right now no we take it down that's nice that that's okay these are 14 tool in the money I'll, I'll go with that i like that hmm. i'll let it go is free could it i don't know this might think i'm a little tight but um i like the cash i'm getting so close Go all in with the seven. I'm gonna put it all in with ace five as well. Let's rock and roll. Man. Ace king. Give me a seven. Okay, I, I did cash. I'm in the money up there and I'm out here. I was unfortunate that I ran into ace king uh, and got killed. Oh well. Oh, I can re enter that. All right, I'll re-enter. Back. Whew. All right, we'll re-enter, reset. Yes, I'm, so I'm in the money up there. Um, on in the three thousand guarantee. Let's see what the min cash was on that. Uh. God, four big blinds left over here. Um, and the min cat was 1350. So, yeah, I'm in the money for 1350. So, I gotta update that. All right. Oh, let me move that over. Trying to move that 
up on the top there. It's a little bit off. And doing OBS stuff. At the same time. It's a little bit difficult. There we go. I should do it. And we'll fold. Okay. Good. No, oh, I can move it over. All right, guys, I'm messing with this. Try to get that moved over so you can see it okay. Huh. Well, I'm going to have to rip this in here. Down to, well, I don't know. I'm just going to let this 5.7 go. What the heck? Can't hang on forever. Hmm. Okay, we're just going to throw this in and see if we can double up up here. And it's not going to happen with a set of eight. All right. Well, we're out of that one. We're down to three. I don't know if there's any other ones I can join. Um, we're going to fold here. See if we can level up. Hmm. I'll just put it all in. Well. Oh. That was a bad one. And we're out there too. All right. Hmm. Wow, a lot of you still here. Appreciate it. Wow, look at everybody in that. I've never seen so so many people watching the stream. Crazy. Let's see if there's anything else I can join. Hmm. Guys, all these limpers. 
Oh, the heck. Went behind. I don't, I don't understand why people limp. I mean, I can see if you're trying to trap or something, but you know, limp, limp, limp. A lot of limpers. Open ended here for the back door flush draw. I'm going to call this. See what develops on the turn. I just entered another one, and I'm going to pull up another one because I'm going to go for it, man. If you guys are here and you're sticking around, um, you know, I'm not, not the best poker player but I do love to play and we do hit but flush comes in at the same time wow with that many players you know the, yeah that's I'm not very too excited about my straight right here with uh, four other players so what is this Wow. I'm going to raise him. Not, he's going to have to pay to, uh, if he's going after a club, he's going to have to pay. He's trying to see another card, get it through cheaply. I don't know what, I don't know what, what the meaning of that little tiny. Ooh, okay. But, yeah, this could, uh, what? Wow. One of them has to have a flush. Ah, oh, this is horrible. Oh, we leveled up up there. Uh, probably the wrong call. Come on, don't have the flush. Somebody. Oh, uh, God damn it. Oh. oh, shit. All right, we're going to go all in with the eights, uh, board one. I don't know, bad call, guys. Come on, hold. Eights, hold, hold. Yeah, oh, what? God, can you believe that? Uh, if, if that wasn't a bad run tonight, I mean, I don't know what was, but. All right, well, we got one. Uh, we're still here, guys. We're still going to go. I'm going to enter some more. Um, so just stay with me here. If uh, you want to continue watching, I'm going to jump into some more tournaments here. Um, but it's been a pretty bad run tonight. Um. So, let me see if there's some, some other stuff I can uh, search up and jump into. That's yeah, 20 minutes. The micro. No, there's nothing. Something's about 20 minutes. So, there really isn't anything to get in. But this is going to be it. Um, and we do hit top here on that. Thanks for the follow. Thank you. Thank you, G Baby Poker. Uh, wow. Come on. <laughs> this, this is crazy. What? Okay, fine. Whatever. Oh, yes. There we go. Finally. Oh. Whew. 
Alright, 60 big blinds. Wow. Uh, Oh, no, sh what? Still in the tournament? No, it's... It closed it. I only have one table. I, I didn't close it. I'm looking for some other tournaments I can join right now, guys. Um, I'd like to get three more going, but I'm not seeing too much. Activity, 18 minutes. There's a thousand guarantee. I'm going to jump into that one. You guys want to stick around? That starts in 18 minutes. I'm going to register for that one. So that'll give us two... Uh, let's see what else is up there. Up there. And it's going to change. My buy-ins are going to be all messed up now. So uh, I have no idea. I'm jumping in. Kind of going all over the place. There In 32 minutes, there's a 600 guarantee mega stack. So I'll jump into that one too. So we'll have... I'll be in that one. During the break, I'll have to dig out what my buy-ins were. Yeah, but I've only cashed for the 1350 or a little more, I think, in that last tournament. Might have been like 15 or something like that. Um, so that let's see, I've got uh, one, two. I'm in three now. So, but they're starting uh, in 17 minutes and 32 minutes. Um, so I'll be bringing that up, and then I'll take a breather here when the break comes. And uh, let's see, Let me hold that. Um, that's an hour and 37 minutes away. Oh, that's a good one. Five dollars and fifty cents. 2500 guarantee but that's an hour and 36 minutes away so i'll wait and see on that one i don't see any micros there is a micro that's an hour and there's really nothing going on at this time in the morning that i can see um i could jump in oh that starts in 36 minutes yeah okay there's a thousand guarantee two dollars there we go that's a good one i'll jump in on that one so that'll give us four tables again and then i'll have to uh recompile my buy-ins and uh, see what happens there. So I got four coming up, guys. If you want to stick around, I'm going to play all night. Oh. I've been working hard on the stream for about, I would say, a good... Uh, months um when i first started streaming i was just streaming i just throw up a camera and start streaming and then then i got into the whole design phase aspect of it and uh then um thought i was at a point where i was just, i was happy with everything yeah i remember i remember that but it I thought it popped up and uh, told me I was out of the tournament. Um, so I'm not sure what happened there. Yeah. Yeah, I was a little uh, overwhelmed when, when uh, uh, Alex raided me with uh, all everyone. And I, I was a little caught off guard. And I appreciated Alex. Uh, so I got a little nervous and a little worked up. And uh, kind of just kind of lost my focus a little bit. And yeah, got a little nervous. So. But I'm glad everybody's here, and I'm going to let's see if everybody's sticking around here, because uh, I'm going to enter some more. So, um, yeah, we still got some people here watching. Wow, this is cool. So I'll, uh, I got, you know, we'll have 
total of four here within about a half hour, I think. Uh, there's some stuff starting up, so I've entered. I don't know if there's any. So we'll have we'll have uh, four more uh, tables up here again, um, and uh, we'll go from there. For th uh, this one, we're three levels away uh, from late. The late registration being over, and we pick up Ace King. That's good. Let's see if we can make something happen. But it's been tough. To, it's been tough tonight. Um, like I said, ran into stats. Um, you can see by just what happened here that uh, it's been a little bit rough for me. Uh, we're going to be raising up Ace King or open raising here for sure. Oh, all right. Okay, we're just gonna put it all in then. We are all in with Ace King. Oh, wow. Three way all in. Ace King, Ace King, Jax, Ace Jack. Oh, man. Club. Club. Mm. <laughs> Damn. Wow. Got it in good. <laughs> wow, I did not expect that. Three way or four way, I don't know. Um all right, we'll defend. And we'll oh oh boy hey thanks G baby poker I uh, appreciate it and have a good night and uh, we'll keep as many people around if you're willing to continue to watch um, I'm, I'll stick around and, and keep going Put it all in. Okay. Three levels of late registration on this. Take it down. Okay, good. Good. We got it through. We got it through. Oh. Hey, thanks for the follow. The Selassie Bin Trip. Selassie Bin Trip. Selassie Bin Trip. Thank you for the follow. I don't know how to say that. I don't know if I said it right. Appreciate the follow. Welcome to the poker room, the aspiring poker pro poker room. Now that I'm just sitting at one table, if you guys just hit the explanation point uh, punch, uh, it will do this. So you guys can punch me in the face. So all you have to do if I'm sitting at a table, but there is a delay, so it's kind of uh, kind of odd. Um, because and if I'm at the Malta, thank you, thank you for the follow. Appreciate it, uh, Zen Osi. Thank you. Um, if uh, if I'm at the multi table, but with the with the stream delay, oh, well, right now I'm just at one table, so you guys can hit that punch anytime you want. Give it a try, because I don't have four tables up now until we get more. Hey, how's it going? Thank you. Uh, doing my best. I keep working on it, trying to improve it every day. 
so much so I spend like uh, like 10, 12 hours a day with about four or five hours of sleep. It's been driving my wife crazy. Uh, I've been putting so much work into the stream. She's been great though. Uh, she's a poker player as well. Um, and so the only thing she doesn't appreciate is the amount of hours that I've spent working on the stream. I, I literally have been like not playing. I, I used to play every day poker, every day. Uh, like America's Card Room, I play every day. And then lately I've been just like streaming and working on my stream, but not streaming, but I mean working on my stream. Streaming when I when I first started, I was just, I threw up a camera and just started streaming. But but then I got into the whole creative side of it and started designing and putting together and working at it and just going from there and making it better and kind of got a little bit to the point where I wasn't playing poker. I was just waking up and, stream, and working on my stream and this, to a certain extent that's still happening right now so there's there's a lot of stuff that still needs to be done um, and things. I, I have a, uh, what's cool is that I'm hoping as soon as it breaks, I'm going to check to see if it's, uh, it's ready yet. But I have uh, a mini version of myself that's going to be a 3D character that's going to interact. So at one at this point, he'll just come up and say one thing to me uh, and turn around and walk off. But as, as I uh, can do it, I'm going to add more. And when I get an idea, I'll have uh, animation artists... Uh, Put in that 3D animation for me, or I'm going to try to figure it out myself because I, I did get the source files, so um, uh, I found I know the program he's using, so I might mess around with seeing if I can create the animations and then put in some. I don't know if you know what I'm talking about, but but this 3D character that's got the same hat as me, got the black jacket with the firing poker pro professional logo, he's going to be coming out onto this, walking out into the scene, and. Uh, here oh, oh wow uh, geez fold a hit but yeah he'd be walking on the scene like the first one he's gonna come from over there and he's gonna walk to me and he's gonna say something like uh, dude I told you not to call in that position why why don't you listen to me and then he's gonna walk off the scene and then if that works and it doesn't uh, bog down the stream and it's not you know causing frame rendering issues then I'm gonna add additional scenes uh, and then uh, my big thing is allowing chat to actually control part of the scenes like I don't know I just added this uh, check this out guys I added this um, this is the uh, the light effect um, which you guys will be able to control soon um, but I can turn the lights on basically it dims the background and turns on the table lights kind of like you turned off the lights and it's getting ready to clean the poker room I don't know it's not that great of an effect but it kind of you know the, the little things like that so that you guys will be able to the listeners or the people who are viewing are going to be able to do things like you might be able to change the, the poker board back there to different stuff um, uh, just by push of a button like I don't know just I have so many ideas that I, I can't sleep at night. I've got all these ideas, but I uh, sometimes lack the knowledge to do it. Sometimes don't have the energy or I, I, the time. I mean, I'm putting a lot of time into it, but it's, it's, uh, this has become like my canvas, man. I mean, and if, if some of you haven't seen, but this guy uh, called uh, Sushi Dragon, if you guys check out his stream, he's not a poker streamer, but he... he Man, oh my god, if you haven't seen this guy's stream, okay, we're on break. Uh, I'm going to take a break here, uh, and I'll check on that 3D character, see if it's done. But um, the Sushi Dragon, if you get a chance to look at his stream, the guy is phenomenal with using just OBS and creating all these special effects. It's like totally inspired me to do all these tools. If you check him out, this is Sushi Dragon. I'm going to take a break. Uh, we're going to go to the uh, so this effect, which I need to add a puff of smoke, but... For now, it's just a... Don't go anywhere. I'll be right back.
Oh, uh, uh, you, sorry guys. Uh, I'm not actually back. Whoops. <laughs> I just thought of how to fix the punch thing. Uh, so I'm trying to fix that right now with the minute I have left. I don't know if I'll get to it, but, uh, just hold tight. Okay, I'm back. Um, I know how to fix the, the punch now uh, with the delay. Uh, I just don't have the time to fix it uh, with the time that I have left here. So I'm not going to mess with it right now, but uh, when I do go offline, uh, when I go off in the stream, that's the first thing I'm going to do is fix that so that uh, on the multi-board, basically all I have to do now, I just realized all I have to do is turn off the camera and reposition my camera up above I'll turn off that one, turn on the other one when the punch is coming in. It'll do it automatically. It'll bring me up and place me there ready for the punch. So I figured it out. I just have to implement it um, in, in the stream. Um, so, um, wow. Um, oh, shoot. Let me go to the board here. Um, we got some action. I have ace, eight of hearts with nine big blinds. I think I'm going to fold... It's a, that's a raise from under the gun. I, I don't know, right? But we got nine big blinds. The other tournament should be starting up soon. So hopefully some of you are sticking around. Um, you have a few. Yeah, you're, a lot of you are still here, man. That's great. Um, so I do appreciate you sticking around. Um like I said, these ideas keep coming in my head all the time. So when, as soon as I finish a stream, I usually, the next day, sometimes I'll work on it all day and I, and I won't, and I'm not, I haven't been able to consistently stream because I'm constantly having new ideas and adding new things. So I'll just kind of disappear for like a week and I haven't been able to set up a schedule. So uh, I'm getting to, I'm getting there to the point where it's going to be where I want it. And I'll be there soon so that I can set up a schedule so everybody will know consistently when I'm going to be online and what times I'll be streaming. And my wife wants a schedule really bad so that I can get things under control time-wise. Uh, but, I mean, literally, I've, I've been, like, staying up all night long. Because um, during the day, it, it became difficult to work because there's just distractions all the time so i just kind of kept pushing things later and later and finally it just was so i was sleeping till like one o'clock in the afternoon wake up and then go to work on the stream and stay up all night and then crash the next morning and that's what i've been doing um so but nor what i used to do is just play poker and i would wake up in the morning you know watch jonathan little cut coffee with jonathan little things like that i'd go to my red chip poker which i haven't been in about two months now do my lessons, review my games, play everything in the Poker Snowy. If you don't know Poker Snowy, definitely should get Poker Snowy to review your games. Um, and if you look back to some of my older streams, um, you know, I was really, you know, I, was, I had I had a rhythm and routine. And then I got into streaming, got into Twitch, and got into designing this thing. And I'm, my rhythm and routine is completely shot to shit. And uh, like I said, literally four or five hours of sleep for the last two months. And just been like balls to the wall, just completely pushing to get this out um, and build it up. And if you look at the progression of, if you go back to the older streams, you'll see it when I started with just the webcam and the headphone with the thing. But uh, I've got a, I got a boom coming uh, hopefully tomorrow so that I can get this thing off the desk. I don't like it like in the scene at all. Um, and, and I have to be right up on it. I kind of like to be able to lean back, but when I lean back, of course, this mic doesn't pick up as well. I did make some adjustments to it, but I don't know if it sounds, I'm not really satisfied with the sound, um, at this point. 
Um, but there's just so much to this streaming. It's just crazy. Like, you know, I went through multiple uh, green screens until uh, I finally got this set up behind me, the green screen working. Um, I don't know if you've seen Grips, uh, uh, his, his stream, but uh, he's moved to a green screen as well. But he's using the same one that I used to use. It's that round circle thing that goes in the back of your chair. And that thing is the, the just too, the, the fabric's too thin, you know. Anyway, I'm t talking about, should be talking about poker and focus on poker. But at this point in my life, um, I've been just obsessed with the streaming side and the design of it. So I hope you guys enjoy it. And I do want to make it better. And I want to make it so that, you know, everybody who is in the chat can actually start controlling aspects of the stream. Which I think is the most interesting, fun part about um, the whole thing, and I want to make it more like interactive, like also teaching-wise, because uh, you know, uh, I used to play chess. I had a 150 chess books. I was, you know, I'm not, I wasn't a great chess player, but I was above average, and I used to teach it to elementary students, and then I, I let the passion of chess lead me to. Uh, I always just let my passion. I go with my passion and it usually leads me to finding some kind of an income stream from it. But what I did find with chess is I ended up building a chess website, which became like one of the top five chess websites in the, the world for about five years before chess.com opened. And that's a long story because uh, I was this close to having chess.com. Actually, what the owner of chess.com played in one of my chess tournaments in California. And I tried to convince him move chess maniac create a partnership and so that we could we could uh put because they were just selling software at the time on uh, chess chess.com and he did not understand where this whole thing was going i did he didn't and then he had a partner with the software uh and it, the person he was in charge of maintaining the domain and somehow he let it expire and he didn't even know and it went up for sale and then Eric Alabas, who I knew from WholesaleChess.com, and I dealt with him. Believe it or not, this is a whole weird story. Weird story. Long story, but I don't know if you're interested in it. But so, it, all right, I'll start. So, so I created. I actually looked up the domain WholesaleChess.com, and then also thought of Chess Maniac at the same time. It was, it was a weird thing that happened. So I chose Chess Maniac, and I didn't get. I didn't buy Wholesale Chess. Well. Later that week, I went back and I was like, man, I should have bought Wholesale Chess. And I looked it up and it had been sold. And so I looked it up and this guy, Eric Alabas, had created Wholesale Chess. Now, when I was teaching chess to elementary students, there were no websites where you could buy chess, like real chess pieces. They all had those glass chess pieces. They weren't tournament chess pieces. They were, they were just, just junk. And you couldn't find anything. And you'd find these sites that were just kind of like halfway put together you know you could tell they were just packed together with some kind of html thing it wasn't well designed and and there was just like a whole niche there well i chose to go the chess playing route eric chose to go with a wholesale chess website importing stuff from china having having products designed for like elementary schools and tournaments and things that were going on in the school system and he chose that route and he ended up selling wholesale chess but in the meantime, when, when I had met the, the original owner of Chess.com when he played in my tournament and he wasn't interested in creating a partnership and bringing my, because I had a large number of users at that time, bringing them over and, create, and creating a, a partnership to move my chess site to Chess.com, my playing chess site. And um, he wasn't interested in doing that. And then his partner let the domain expire. It went up for auction and guess who bought it? Eric Alabama. Now I was in the middle of building my chess website and trying to keep the database from crashing all the time because we had so many people playing chess on it. It was just overloaded. Ooh, pocket rockets. Yes, here's a double up right here. Um, I hope we get a double up. But yeah, so, and so what happened was Eric got a hold of chess.com and then he offered. Then he comes snooping around my site and offers to buy uh, my site, um, and I just I wasn't interested in selling. I mean, chess, chessmaniac.com became kind of like my art 
It was my art. It was my creation. It was. Um, here we go. We got a call. Let's hope we can double up. See if I. Oh wow, we can triple up right now. How about a triple up? Nines. Come on. Come on. Hold. 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 Ooh yeah. Yes. Okay, we got a triple up. We got 20 big blinds now. Last level of late registration. That helps. The other tournaments should be starting hopefully pretty soon. Hope you stick around. But uh, yeah, so anyway, uh, I don't know where I left off, but uh, chess.com, Eric Alabes, the original owner of wholesalechess.com, got a hold of it through an auction for $50,000. My heart sunk because I was in the top five chess playing websites at the time. And it was like when he decided to go with chess.com, I, I knew right then and there I was done. And... But I wasn't done. The, in fact, it still exists today. I don't develop it or do that much with it anymore. But the, the original core group of chess players is still playing on my chess website. And I, I maintain the servers. And, and it doesn't make anywhere near as much money as it used to. Um, in fact, I didn't make much money in the very beginning. It was like, it was just a passion. I was just, I wanted to be able to play chess. And I developed the chess website. And... It became popular and then um it stayed popular for until about five years ago but i was surprised it lasted that long it was about four years ago when it really started to die off um but i ran the thing by myself i would hire some programmers when i would get to a point when i couldn't figure something out and uh it just uh there was a point there where i was i put it on ebay it was like two years in um because i started in 2004 and two years in 2006 m my uh my wife was my ex-wife was pregnant with our our first child and um i decided to sell it because it was like i was just barely paying for the servers i was working on it all night long it just became too overwhelming and so i put it up for sale on ebay for five thousand dollars and got one bid and then the guy backed out on the sale, and I was like, fine, you don't want it? That's fine. That's fine. I really didn't want to sell it anyway. So he backed out on the sale. And then not literally less, not more than like two weeks later, I worked on it all night long. I go to bed. I'm sleeping during the day. And uh, my wife at the time comes in uh, and the next, when I wake up, and she's like, oh, um, Google called you. And I was like, what? Google called me? I was like, what the hell? And because uh, I had AdSense on there, I was like one of the first sites to have AdSense. And back then, the keyword chess was only five cents a click. That was, it was easy to get people to my site, drive them to my site when uh, Google Ads came out and I was the only one buying the keyword chess. Um, but uh, so anyway, long story short, Google calls me. I call them back and they, they said, hey, we want to put you in a pilot program. We know you, you have of ad views on your site but there's not many clicks so what we're going to do is give you the uh ability to change the keywords so you can just test certain keywords for whatever you want to put so i kept messing with keywords and so finally i hit something and then i put online investing and it was just like boom and i went from like not making any money to making money it turned into a business and what it what the whole thing was strange because we're living in california didn't know what to do, new baby, and we had a house. So the California real estate market took off, but it was at its peak. And I had sold real estate in Hawaii when I was living over there. And I, I told her, I said, listen, we got, it's this market peaking right now. So we have to do something. You know, I'm not, you know, I wasn't making any money with Chess Manic at the time. And I said, we got to sell it. We got to sell it. We got to, you know, come, go back to where I'm from, Vermont originally. We can buy it really inexpensive house there get actually have a bigger house than than we did in california so sold it put it on the market and then google called me and then it was like while it was in escrow all of a sudden it went from you know a, a business that didn't make any money to a business that was making money crazy how it all happened <clears throat> and then it just went went from there and uh, and that, and that was about 2008 when then eric contacted me at about chess.com and he had bought chess.com and then i didn't think it would last that much longer in fact i moved on to another project another passion and 
in uh, a charter program. Yeah. Long story. I hope I'm not rambling. But, uh, I uh, started uh, used to radio hosting, but I originally started a passion of promoting Vermont made music because there's a lot of really fantastic music that's made up here in Vermont. Because Vermont tends to attract. The oh, here we go. There's another one coming up. So we'll put it on the multi table now. Um, Vermont attracts a lot of artists. So, um, anyway, uh, I was promoting Vermont made music. I created an online radio station called the Radio Free Vermont, and I was promoting uh, Vermont made music. But then I got tired of paying three hundred dollars a month in streaming fees. Um, so I was like, you know, I know how to, I can, I know enough about servers and stuff. So I figured I would just create my own, uh, um, my own streaming server so I did and that led me to the next venture which was used to radio hosting which then has gone for about 10 10 more years so it just keeps going I just follow my passion and, and poker is a passion so I I stick with it and I don't I don't like uh look for ways that you can make money on it but I I just figured okay I'm I'm loving poker and I'm just gonna sit back until something falls, something comes in. And then, so not that Twitch is going to be anything that way, but it's just the way that I run. I just kind of just go with my passion and follow it. I don't care if, it makes, if there's any money involved in it, um, but I follow my passion. And right now this is my passion. So this, the point of the story is that this is my passion. This is what I want to build up. I want to make this the most fucking badass freaking Twitch poker streaming site there is. I'm not that great of a poker player, but I hope I can get better. So if you stick with me, hopefully we can make a difference. Uh, I can get better at poker and deliver you guys a fucking awesome product. Uh, and it'll raise the bar for everybody, all the other poker streamers out there. So we raise the bar, and then these guys are going to come up. And then it's just going to create this, this... I think it'll be good for everyone. I mean, because you see what, what's his name, uh, Fin Fintan, I think it is, that's his name. Um, he's getting kind of, he's doing some interesting things now. I saw, I saw his stream the other day and he had like a backdrop of like a DJ scene with the chess board in, or the poker board in the back, poker table in the back. So he, he's kind of messing with it now, but it's going to, I'm hoping that I can, you know, with what I want to do over here, like I've got Ace Queen now, so I better focus on this. But I want to, like, in that staging room, if you haven't seen it, I'll show it to you. But I want to create, like, a tra let, like training room. That's going to be, like, you know, where I can review games. Like, during the break, if I could get some stuff queued up in there um, and just go over it. And, and, and not to say that I'm, like, you know, like I said, I'm not the greatest uh, poker player. But it um, doesn't mean I can't learn. And that's and part of how I learn is by teaching. So I think I would like to like to teach poker, uh, teach people what I've learned. Um, if you haven't, you know, there's a good book by, I don't know if you guys, you know, Blitzsuit is like one of my favorite teachers. I think he's really like, I just understand the way he teaches for some reason. Um, there's certain styles of teachers um, that, that, but Blitzsuit, the way he presents it, and he's so clear and brings everything. And so Red Chip Poker uh, is a really good site to check out. Um, I enjoy that. And then, of course, Run It Once, the videos, I learn a lot from them as well. And this is back when I was studying poker. Now I'm not studying poker. I'm watching freaking streaming videos all the time. How to stream, how to put your OBS, how to, you know, looking up all the open source plugins for OBS. That, you know, that's what I found this this chat control here so that you guys... So why didn't somebody punch me, man? Somebody's in the chat. Give it a try. I'm at a single table now. So uh, give me a punch. So, so anyway, this is what it's looked like. So if just so you know, if you do explanation point punch, you can punch me. So this is what happens. So, oh, yeah. so that's just one of the aspects of the stream. So have at it. Punch me in the face. As long as I'm sitting at a single table, you can do it. Um, if I'm on the multi-table, and like I said, I know how to fix that now. I'm going to fix that in when this stream is over today, or probably tomorrow when I wake up, or whenever I wake up today, after I go to bed. Uh, anyway, why is anybody chatting? You guys are still here, right? Are we still here? 
Yeah, maybe maybe I'm too much into streaming. You guys are just looking for some poker. I'm sorry. I hope uh, I hope I can give you something here. I did make. Uh, it was yesterday, I think. I streamed. I made a final table. Yesterday was good. At, oh, here we go. Here we go. I have some more coming up here. Let me fix this. Uh, start tap the grid. I had this guy design me a program that puts all the table names out there for me, so I don't have to manually do it anymore. And I have no idea how many buy-ins I got now. That's not even up to date because I, I got a little overwhelmed when Alex uh, raided me. And so I want to give you guys a show. So we're gonna keep we're gonna keep streaming as long as I can here. I definitely have the energy and the drive and the passion for it. Let's go to the multi-table. You can't punch me there, but you will be able to. Uh, is, like I said, soon I will fix that. But I, I couldn't resist. I like this camera in the middle. It just looks the best. If I move it up, it doesn't look the same. I like the camera in the middle. And as soon as I can get this camera pushed back a little bit, then I'll be able to spin around in my chair all the way without going off the scene. You see, now I kind of go off the scene, but I'll be able to spin around. Yeah, I'm not going off the scene right now. Oh, that's cool. Okay. So, and I, I didn't want to move away from the 3D effect. That was really hard for me on the multi-table, but the multi-table tends to be really small with the 3D effect. I can show you guys that. Um, yeah, I'll just put you over to the original multi-table. So this is the original multi-table, and you can see these, it's too small. You can't see anything, so that's why I didn't, that's why I had to move away from that particular one and move to this. So this is the only way really to uh, get the multi-table um, to be able to be you know, clear so you guys can see it. And I, But I like the chair in the middle rather than having my camera up at the top. But with the punch, I can fix that. So when you guys want to punch me, um, I'll turn off the center camera and it'll light up the camera above me in time, just in time for the punch. Nobody's chatting. Nobody got any questions? I've been talking a million miles a minute here. Hit up my Discord. If any of you are streamers and you got questions, you want to know how to do it, let me know. Let's help each other out. Let's make, let's make uh, poker streaming fucking awesome, shall we? In fact, I was just watching Jonathan tonight. And he was saying, he was saying uh, that if you're, if you're thinking about streaming, or you should stream, because it makes you, like, you know, learn faster. And you know, Jonathan is, a, is the guy's got an amazing mind. Um, uh, I kind of, uh, he's a little, his personality's a little different, but but the guy, you can tell he, he he's, he's thinking a million miles a minute, and it's hard for him to it. it Sometimes he comes off as a little uh, rough, but tonight he was actually drinking wine on the stream. And I was like, okay, He's, he was just really loosening it up. And uh, he kind of showed a different side. You know, uh, yeah, he'd be a really cool person to hang out with. Definitely, definitely got a mind that's amazing. Yeah, and he's just an awesome poker player. I don't know. Like for me, like teaching styles, for me, it's a, it. His teaching style isn't as good for me. It doesn't fit me. But that's where split suit. That his teaching style fits me. My type of learning better. But Jonathan definitely knows his stuff. That's for sure. And I do like watching his stream. I like to help him out. I mean, he's like tonight. Just uh, when I first saw him come up on Twitch, I was like, "What? Jonathan's here? All right." Because you know, I used to watch you know his YouTube coffee with Jonathan. And, um, and, um, yeah, he was, he was lagging and stuff. I think he got it fixed now, but, uh, yeah, it's, it's interesting to see him come up here. Uh, that's definitely, definitely interesting that some of these 
these bigger poker players haven't latched on to Twitch yet. Um, I'm pretty surprised. But I think there's probably a wave coming. I mean, especially now while we're seeing this, these additional outbreaks and stuff. I mean, this kind of crappy what's happening. But I think it's going to be a good thing for online poker. I think it's going to continue growing and getting bigger. In fact, uh, in the state of Vermont, I just made, I just um, called my legislator. I'm trying to get them to go with, uh, to get uh, poker stars to come into uh, into Vermont. Um, because right now, of course, Vermont is starving for revenue. Like, big time starving for revenue. I mean, you know, it's, it's just what it is. They tax us like crazy. Over tax us. Ah, just, yeah. And um, so they're starving for revenue. And uh, so I called them up and I said, listen, you want to make some revenue? I mean, it's like, you got to got to get po contact poker stars start write a bill get it through the state legislature um and and let's get let's get some poker in vermont online and i told him it was booming right now online poker is booming um and i don't know if you listen to me but they have enough on their play right now but shoot man pennsylvania i mean they, they set record revenues uh for what they're bringing in but the problem is is vermont probably would try to overtax the goddamn thing and then nobody will go to poker stars they'll just they'll just stay playing with their favorite card rooms that they have now america's card room um and or ignition or whatever they're playing on uh i just gotta fold the deuces here can't do anything with that uh I have 14, so let's see 11 big blinds there I think there's one more tournament starting up, so we'll have that empty space filled over there. Oh, hey, man. Well, Ghost, yeah. Yeah, thanks. I'm glad you're listening. I'm glad somebody's listening. I wasn't sure. Um, yeah, it's, it's just uh, it's good to have you all here. Finally, uh, you know, take a look. And I'm glad that somebody's actually seeing what I've, what I've been doing. Appreciate it. And you guys can definitely, you know, hound me because... Uh, like I said, I need help with my poker playing. I can always learn more. Um, I know I'm probably... And, it, and, and this is a three-minute delay, so I normally don't... I haven't been streaming with a delay. I don't know why I decided to go with a delay tonight. It's a good thing I did, I guess. This many people watching. Um, I don't know if I, the, the delay thing is kind of strange. I, I, I don't... I mean, Alex thinks that definitely need to do a delay. But how many people are actually on here, like, trying to snipe you in these micro tournaments? I mean, do you think that happens very often? Because I was thinking I'd just, like, go freaking live and, like, if somebody snipes, you know, fine. But, it, you know, I guess when you get the final table, maybe it might happen a little more there. Um, I already got pocket kings here. Let's, let's zoom in on board one. Uh, we'll raise that up. Oh, no action. Yeah, I, I don't know. I'm just trying to figure it out. I mean, I think it's... I like the whole live interaction thing better. And, and I don't know if I like putting the card covers over. I'm like, if somebody wants to cheat and freaking look at my cards, whatever. I just don't know if that would happen now. And let's go to board uh, three. Yeah. Queen. Um... Facing a limp from hijack. Top pair, top kicker now. So, so I don't know. I don't know um, the drawbacks from going live versus a delay. Um, I was chatting with a poker star pro that was streaming here. She. Uh, I said, do you really need a delay? And she's like, looked at me like I was freaking crazy on the stream. And I was like, I asked, like I asked a dumb question. But she's like, well, I'm a, I'm a pro. I'm, I'm sponsored, you know, poker stars or whatever to sponsor. And I was like, okay, sorry. Uh, but I mean, I just like, I don't know if I'm playing poker and I'm playing in four tournaments or something. 
am I really gonna be like opening everybody's Twitch stream to see what what they got for cards? I mean, maybe maybe if you're playing some of the top, maybe there's some of the top players. I don't I don't know. I mean, am I really gonna be like snooping around Twitch streams to see if I can cheat? I, I don't know. It just seems like a waste of time. <laughs> you know, you know, especially if, like I mean, I can see if you're playing for some big money tournaments, but I mean, you know, it's the micros, man. I, I don't just don't know if it's completely necessary to be on a delay so i don't know it's still debatable and it's like maybe if you make the final table or you get closer you're running deeper then you could either you know put the card protectors on or whatever cover your cards something like that i don't know ah, shit. oh i don't know what to do with this one that he's for i can't remember i need to hit i need to do some Oh, okay. Well, it's an okay flop. Not a great flop. Uh. Well, I'm going to fall. Uh. Yeah. Okay. Probably over for me. <laughs> wow. Ace high. <laughs> three way three way split. Unless somebody's got a king. Right? The only thing that what? Bigger full house. He's got a full bag, right? I, mean, I don't know. Um, but even the in the in the low stakes, they'll be sniping. I think so. I, I guess yeah. I mean, I really want to call this guy, but. I don't know. I think it's full house probably. Yeah, I mean, but really, do you think they'll, they'll, uh, I mean, is there that, is there enough people streaming? Like, okay, so if I'm, if I'm live and, and, and you know, you know, you know, I you know how many people watching your stream, but I don't know. I don't know. I'm not sure. Because it's so much better to interact with the chat live. I see why Grips does what he does, just the card protectors. He, uh, <clears throat> excuse me, I think that kind of makes more sense. Oh, oh I only got eight big blinds. Oh, 38 places. Cool. Cool. Oh, shoot. I gotta put you guys on the multi table at least so you can see something. Should be another tournament coming in. Soon, starting out. Let me just check that. See when it's coming. So we'll have four tournaments, I think. Oh, one of them got canceled. Damn it! That happened like twice tonight that they canceled the tournament. I entered a. It was a ten thousand guarantee that was going to start up, and it it disappeared. Um, see if I can find something else to join here. Oh, we got a late registration, four hundred guarantee. Just pop in that one. Get that way and get that up running. Maybe I can get something going here. All right, hold on. Let me get this fixed up. Uh, start. That's good. Okay. Is anybody else that's uh, watching the stream? Do you guys stream? Anybody stream? Got a stream? Let me know in chat. Um, I'll make sure I like it. So you, you can people get sniped and play okay play money game in play money games seriously wow wow i have no idea no idea
and we get shoved on with Ace King. Uh, I mean, with King Jack here. Um, I don't. I don't know why. I probably should just shove this in the first place. But pocket fours. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Nope. We don't hit. All right. So we're out of that one. Let's look for a different one. Where's that table? Hmm. 45 minutes, 2,500 guarantee for only five bucks. Do I have you, have you guys on the multi table? Yeah, yeah. You can see the action. Uh, that's a good flop for us. Um, I'll check. Oh. I need a dot. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Um, I'll value bet this now. So he doesn't have time as well. That would suck. But I wouldn't. The way my night's been going, it seems like uh, there's definitely a possibility of that. Ah, take it down. All right. Uh, I'm looking for something else to join here. There's one that starts in 44 minutes. Well, I got this new feature. But I, I don't know if I can implement it. But, uh, let me see. Um, hold on. Four, four minutes. Oh, there's a 500 guarantee. Oh, that's PLL. I don't understand that thing. Okay. Um, 500 guarantee that starts in four. No, that's PLL. There's a 250 guarantee. That's an hour. Let's see some other stuff starting. Thousand guarantee. That's thirty dollars. That's a medium level tournament. We gotta pull something else up here. Uh, oh, there's one. There's a four hundred. Am I in that one? Oh yeah, I'm already in that one. Okay. I'm gonna. I'm gonna jump into this. Uh, well, I'll just wait here. And see. Hold on. Let me. Need to get one more. An eight max, that's an hour and eight minutes. Let me look at the micro, see if there's anything there. 250. 51 hour, that's no three minutes PLL. Definitely don't want to do PLL. So the the next this one is gonna be in 43 minutes. There's no I can't nothing I, I can enter late. to get one more table open. Hmm. How many of you stick around? So if I do it in 42 minutes, there's a 2,500 guarantee. That's in 42 minutes. That means it'll be after 5 o'clock. I'm feeling the energy from you guys, so I'm thinking I'll stick around. But I'll I'll uh I'll give myself a little time here to think about this 41 minutes, or I could put up a poll. Try this. This is the feature I want to test. There it is. Okay, let's give this a try. All right. Uh, quick map, and it's gonna be. Start, click map. Uh, wait, how do I do it? Does it work? Oh, hold on. How do I set this thing? Ah. Um, I'll raise this up. How do I do this? Um, I think I messed it up. Um, 
see about this one. We can take it down. And no. Okay, so we check holding or checking it down. And yeah, I'm out of that one. Okay, let's see here. Um, I've got this new feature that allows me to put up a poll. Yeah, everybody is pretty quiet, I thought. Um, well, they're probably just getting used to me. I mean, they're, you know, they don't know me. They don't know my stream, so they're just kind of trying to figure me out. Who the fuck is this guy, you know? He's fucking crazy. <laughs> you know? So, oh shit, gotta change the battery. Yeah, so the, I've got this thing here, um, trying to set up the whole thing, see, it's a test. Oh, here it is. This map, the pole. No, yeah. No, 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 that. You want to click that. Cool. Okay, so what do we do here? Start clicking. Had it working. Uh, I'll just show you guys what I got here. I think I have to activate it. I don't know if I made a, a button for it or not. I don't think I did. But it's similar to what Tintan does on his site. Sometimes he'll ask, like, oh, should I call or fold? Or should I shove or fold? And let me see if I can activate it. We're on the multi board. Uh, yeah, I was going to make a button for it, but I didn't. I guess I didn't. Okay, we'll raise this up. We'll raise the deuces up. Where did I put that? It's so hard when you're streaming to try to look at OBS and try to figure out what the hell you, you know. If you're trying to look up something and um, it's really difficult and playing poker at the same time. Well, I wish we had the top flop with the bottom one. Would that be cool? But instead, we got that. So, all right, I can't find it right now, but it actually puts up a clickable. So I'll be able to put up like questions up here, and they'll be. I I, I gotta figure it out, but um, let's see if I can make it work. Wow. We could just change flop. We take this flop, put it up here, and then take this flop, and bring it down here. That would be really good, but that's not the case. So check it. Uh, uh, I'm not gonna call you. It, you're good. You're good, man. You're good. I'm just gonna punch myself in the face. Oh, I can't do it. Oh shit. Ah, come on. <laughs> Messed up. All right, let's bring. Let's see. Here. 
I'm gonna, I'm gonna I gotta turn the lights on. I can't, I can't see. Uh, oh yeah, that's better. I think. Oh yeah. Oh, let me turn them off. Works better on the multi-board. So, oh come on, what's going on with this guy? What's happening? Son of a biscuit eater. Taking a while. Okay, we take it down there. Let me go back to go to board one. And so I, I got this light effect. I don't know if you were here earlier. I don't know if I showed it yet, but I can turn the lights on. So it kind of like, it's like, it's like, you know, you're closing the casino or you're closing the poker room and then I can turn the lights off. Um, so I'm messing around with that to allow the users in chat kind of be able to control certain aspects of the stream. I can't wait till I get that all set up. Like there's one problem over there that drives me crazy. Over there where the last person who liked it, look at the name is shifted down. I have no idea where that happens. I have to look into that and try to figure that out. I don't like that at all. It takes away from the whole. And then I've got the 1350 that it's hard, it's too hard to fix anything in the stream. It's like, I was, oh wow, the 1350 is off the screen there. So I have to fix that. And I'm not going to call the trees. Let's pull the trees in. Let's see here. I can get that. And I can't, I can't change without messing things up here. It's hard, it's hard to edit, edit while you're uh, streaming and playing poker at the same time. King seven, I don't know. I don't know if that's worth a defend or not. An open from the under the gun. I, I, defend this or not. I'm gonna let it go. He's ten. Wow. How wide he's open. I and then see I used to use HUDs. I gotta get my HUD back up too. So right now I can tell he he's opening a lot here. And I'll just call. Oh, he bluffed the flush. I have a note on him. Bluff, bluff the flush on the river with bottom pair. Uh, okay, yeah, now I'll fold. Yeah, so you know I got to get back in the swing, um, but you know of playing poker and. Um, really studying and, and like I don't know I can recommend some books if anybody wants to know about any I mean probably already know more than I do um, but um, turn it off the right here. so one of the well Footsuit Sweeney has a really good book out uh, it's, uh, it's called Optimizing Ace King I got it right up there um, if you ever read that one Optimizing Ace King is a really, really, really good book. Anybody got any poker book suggestions? Because um, eventually I want to be able to, like, right here on this math board, right here on this math board back here, I want to be able to uh, change that to where it has other math, poker math formulas going up there. Um, and also some different books um, that we can put up there. Um, in fact, it would be cool because I could actually set it up so that I could put a list of books and then you guys could like find a book in the list that you like and put a command in the chat and you could show it up on that board. I, I got so many ideas that I want to make it like an interactive training teaching uh, place where people can kind of like for the users in chat and can share. And um, and if you got any suggestions for poker players over there, I just kind of picked the top 20 and some of my favorite ones. Um, I really, really like Alex Foxen. Uh, I, I I so enjoy watching him play and to see how far this last year he's come like so far and it's like he's just annihilating on the boards um, and he just he's been working in the lab I guess uh, with with GTO but but the last tournament I saw him play and it was just amazing how many how many uh, people he got off of like small one pair of hands and and it was just because of the board texture and the GTO training that he had done. Um, let me think, let me think, let me think. Um, yeah, if you got any suggestions, 
uh, about any poker players, uh, but it's got to be uh, a picture that's in the Creative Commons, otherwise you can't use it uh, unless I pay for it. So, And uh, I looked up, it was, uh, I think, Danny Negrano's photo or Phil Hellmuth. And luckily I found a couple of them in the Creative Commons, but the one that I really wanted was you had to pay like 600 bucks to be able to use it. And I was like, yeah, forget that. And this, uh, if you look back at my stream history, you'll see that you can tell exactly where I realized that you couldn't play uh, copyrighted music on your stream. It was a while back, but actually Grips helped me out. I went over to the chat and just said, hey man, uh, where can I get non-copyrighted music, you know, and, and um, Epidemic Sound, that's what's playing now. I love these kind of soundtracks like this with this kind of intense music, especially for tournament poker. It's just, just way cool. Hold here. I don't know what I'm going to do with that. I did see that, I guess. I don't even know how I get in there. Can I raise it up? Yeah, I got to pay attention more. It's too busy. It's exciting to talk about the stream. I'm hoping to get some ideas. If anybody has any ideas about what direction we should go with the stream, let me know. Again, I want to keep it, like I said, if you got ideas about how to make it more interactive as far as like teaching, um, you know, reviewing games. Um, like if you go back to some of my older streams, you could see that um, I, I actually was teaching kind of like, or quote, not teaching, but it was kind of teaching, I guess. You know, I was pulling up poker snowy, so I'd, I'd get in a hand and I'd be like, oh man, I don't know if I should have called there. And then I can like put it into poker snowy and then pull it up, put it in front of the screen and everybody could see it. And they could say, oh, well, poker snowy says I should have called here. Or poker snowy says I should have folded here. It was a bad call. Um, so diff different things like that. Anything that, uh, but anyway, we can share later. If you guys have any ideas. Huh. I think I'll defend here. Okay. Uh, Ace, uh, I, I, I've read um, uh, Optimizing Ace King. Um, I've got Ed Miller's books. I like Ed Miller's books a lot. He, uh, he's got, you know, the, the, an essential poker map. It's a, that's a good one. It's a real good one for basic, the basics. Uh, he breaks it down really well. I can't remember the author's name, but I got a whole, I got a whole stack of them up here on my poker book list. Uh, but the ones that I like, uh, the best would be Ed Miller's books. The course is one. That's a really good book. Um, There, Caro's Book of Tells, Poker Tells. I got, oh, one of the uh, Professional No Limit Hold'em. Uh, that's where you go into Stack the Pot Ratio. SPR, that was a good one. That's also by Ed uh, Miller, I believe, believe, or Sonny. Sonny and Matt Lynn. That was a really good book. And then, of course, the, I guess it segues into uh, the course. Would have been um, the next one. Um, the Theory of Poker, Applied to No Limit. See what else I got here. Um, yeah, I could let's see if I can stand up there and pull a few of them down. But uh, for math, man, the mathematics of poker that's a good one that shows you the whole backbone of math. That it's like a complete mathematical everything in poker is math and it's describing everything. Pocket aces, uh, it's it, 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 it that's like a, it's like a textbook for poker map and I'm like three quarters of the way through that one uh, that's like reading a math math book uh, that deep with probabilities and all of that stuff 
that's a that's a good one um if you really like math um it's something that, but it's very it's a, it's a hard read it's a slow read but it just it's just fascinating just the whole thing um uh, i've got uh the workbooks also okay we got the aces here so we're gonna we're gonna be raising this up to nine I got the Super System, no Gordon book. Yeah, Ed Miller's book, if you get a chance, is a, is a really good. Uh, Ed Miller, the Poker's 1%, you know, that's a good one. Um, playing the Player, again, that's another Ed Miller book. Do that. That's a good one. Oh, we're on break. All right, cool. All right, I gotta take a break, guys. Um, but yeah, I've got I got a bunch of I I've been meaning to put my list of poker books, uh, down in the bottom, and uh, it'll there'll be a oh we got the aces. Hold on, All right, you have bought. I almost forgot. Wow, I got called with this, huh? The nine big ones, two calls. Oh, that's cool. Okay, Let's see if we can. Okay. Oh, come on. Seriously. All right, we take that down. All right, I'm going to go on break, guys. Stay tuned. Uh, I'm really enjoying chatting. I'm hoping we can get a few more players. Ghost, thanks for chatting with me. Uh, I want to continue the want to continue the chat um, and uh, I want to share everything and uh, hopefully you guys can share back with me i appreciate it so um i'm gonna take a break i'm gonna go to the uh staging room here first so this is the tournaments that we're currently in and i'm gonna look into that other tournament uh, i'll take a look and see how many people we got in the chat figure out how i can maybe put that poll up but uh again don't pay attention to the buy-ins there because they're totally off because i got kind of excited when you all came in and uh and i joined more tournaments so um anyway it doesn't matter man we're having fun Having fun playing poker, and um, you're you're enjoying the, the setup. I appreciate everything you guys have said. So I'm gonna take a break. Um, just...
Shoot. He's back. Shoot. What happened there? How did I get back so quick? Holy crap. I have five minutes. Huh. But I, I dug out my books here. So I haven't read this one yet. This is recommended by Cash Player that I met on uh, Twitch. Um, I saw his chart and it was unbelievable. He chart was like up to $300,000 in cash. And he recommended this book. So if you quit, if you want to play cash, this guy, I, I got to read this one when I get a chance. Um, we got pocket jack here. So yeah. I don't know what, I thought I had more time than that. Um, this one by Doug Hall, who's, who's with, uh, um, uh, the red chip poker site, uh, really, uh, excellent. It's just a workbook on, you know, like if you're learning the basics of outs and stuff, basic, basic, like just little, like the Sudoku of, uh, of, of poker. You just pull it out. And, um, it will. Uh, I'm gonna raise it up. Probably should have gone eight on that. Um, yeah, this this is a good one. It's got, you know, like I said, a whole flop. But it's got like the little workbook stuff. So you just fill in the little things there. Um, we got raised with ace nine. That's a fold. That's a fold. Uh, and this is a split suit uh, book. This is another good one. I'm about uh, halfway. This is I was going through this one when I got sidetracked and got into streaming. But this is another good, good workbook. Let's see if I can get that through. Um, we take it down. Um, so this one's again. This is like math, just just basic math and outs and combinations and stuff. I'd say that this book right here to to get started is probably what everybody, in my opinion. If you're playing poker or you're starting, this is the book you want to get because it gets you through the basic poker math, which still I'm trying to, you know, um, trying to figure out. I don't have it all in my head, but, you know, with poker, you want to, the math is it's the backbone of, of poker. So you want to definitely want to get the math down. Super, super important to get the math down. And this book will help you get the math down. Um, like I said, Split Suit is an excellent, he knows he only plays cash. Split suit only plays cash. He's not a tournament poker player. So if you're looking for tournament training, definitely not this. But this, because if you play cash, cash, cash shows you, uh, cash is gives you a deeper understanding of the game. Uh, tournament poker is something totally different. And so I've mainly been playing cash on on America's Card Room. I played turn. I do play tournaments, but when since I've been streaming, I think I think streaming tournaments is a lot more fun. But it's a totally different game and it's difficult to figure out you know what uh you have to switch gears uh i've been playing cash strictly for the last year straight cash i'm not playing many tournaments i kind of just stopped with the tournaments i play live tournaments like poker play, poker playground lebanon poker room <clears throat> and uh wow okay um definitely ace was beat um and um but uh, so online, I was playing strictly cash, and I and I did a couple coaching sessions with uh, Brad Wilson, who runs. If you haven't listened to this poker podcast, it's uh, Chasing Poker Greatness by Brad Wilson. Definitely, he is uh, you know does some great interviews with poker players. Um, really enjoy his poker, his uh, his podcast, and he coaches as well. So I did a couple sessions with him. Um, but he he believes that. Uh, poker online poker is going to be dead in five years because of the in fact there was just a there was just a it was just released recently on solve for why if you watch the, there's a podcast just on on the youtube channel like the second one if you go there and you see the most recent ones the second one and it's about 12 minutes in and they show a guy that's using a solver next to his poker table he's playing like 10 cent 25 cent and there's a whole discussion there about solvers and people using solvers playing poker so there's there's that whole aspect, um, what, which is, which one is it? Oh, three books, Secrets of Professional Tournament Poker. Okay, cool. I'll look into that. Um, 
see what else I got. I do have the system or whatever the, the one by um, uh, Joel Brunson. Um, but I, let me see, I guess I'll see that that. But I haven't read it yet. Um, this is another good one. Um, this is another Ed Miller book. Um, you can see that. Small Stakes Poker, No Limit. This one, that's another really good book. This one, did I read this one? I think I read parts of this one. I don't know if I got through it all. I'm getting raised here. What the hell? I think hit a set. Huh? Okay, I'll poke. Um, the Theory of Poker. <laughs> Wow, that's weird. Going, not focusing on it. Okay, there we go. Strange. Okay, um, and then of course this optimizing ace king. Now I'm getting raised again. Read that. Hmm. Ace king, optimizing ace king. Really good book on. Oh, let me hold it back here. That way. Uh, optimizing it. it doesn't get the chroma key comes in and, and get black in it. Um, so optimizing Ace King, excellent book uh, by Split Suit, and again Red Chip Poker, great great site. And of course the classic Poker Tells. I know this is all backwards flipped, mirrored or something. Um, then there is uh, this one, Professional No Limit Hold'em. That is. Again, written by Ed Miller. This is this is like if you're look, trying to figure out stack to pot ratio, this is the book you need. This is like uh, the book for examples on stack to pot ratio, which I still have trouble implementing in my game. Um, then Essential Poker Math. Now this guy, uh, he does micro stakes training uh, on a website. I think it's micro stakes poker or something like that. But Alton Harden. Uh, this this book has been really great. It, it breaks down the math in very readable, understandable. So if you're struggling with the math side of it, you definitely he does a really good job of breaking down the math side of it. He's on the floor here, and of course this. Now there's hardly any math in this, but this book is just written very well by Ed Miller called The Force. Uh, Mainly, like if you're playing cash, you, look, you know you definitely want to read this book. Um, and this one here, Ed Miller's uh, "How to Read Hands No Limit." I need to reread that one again. But definitely, this is another good one. I've read them, but this one is something I definitely need to go back to um, because I still need to develop my hand reading skills. Um, I need to improve those. Playing the player, which I just showed you, and the focus one percent. Um, Told you that, but if somebody else can see it, that those are good books to have that in your arsenal. I would definitely recommend that you anything by Ed Miller you want to have, you want to have in your poker toolbox, um, for sure. Uh, small stakes, yeah. I think I showed you all the all the ones. Yeah, that's all of them. I just throw them on the floor here. But um, yeah, so you know, it's uh, it, those are the books I want to get up. You know, that'll be coming on that uh, up there. And this is this is a good song for uh, chase, chasing the dream, right? Isn't that what we're all doing? We're chasing the poker dream. Poker dream. Such a fascinating game. The math aspect to it, the psychological aspect, the intuition side of it. You know, your gut feeling. Sometimes I guess you could call that would be more like you know the psychological side of it. But sometimes you just get this gut feeling things just doesn't seem right, especially when you're playing live. The Cowboys came for a visit. Okay, so we're gonna raise this up. So, so uh, I'll go nine.
Okay, we take that down. Secrets of professional tournament poker. I gotta look that up. No, I haven't. It, the thing is, I haven't studied much about tur playing tournaments. Um, I haven't read much about tournaments. I kind of, uh, when I started playing online, I mean, I played tournaments live, but um, when I, I haven't really focused on tournaments. I, I got, I started playing online and I was playing cash. Then I started playing a little few tournaments and I went back to cash. So I've been playing a lot of cash. So tournaments is an aspect of poker that I have not completely delved into. Yet. So um, definitely that's somewhere, especially now that I'm on Twitch and I'm doing a lot more tournaments, I need to, because it's a totally different game with ICM and all that stuff. Um, but I uh, playing live uh, at the Poker Playground and here locally, I've been doing that. Um so, but I definitely do need to do so. Those, those are good for um, secrets of professional tournament poker. Um, I've you know, I've read some of Jonathan Little's books. Uh, I don't even know where those are. They're up here somewhere. Um, and uh, his books are okay. Um, um, but uh, I haven't done enough tournament poker study. You can probably tell one that play. I definitely was really focused on playing cash. And then, if you'll notice my first earlier stream, it's mostly streaming cash from Poker Bros. Poker Bros was a site that opened up when, uh, when, uh, uh, when the whole COVID thing came down, um, like our whole people who played poker in this area went on to like a club on poker bros so that those are my first some of my first streams of the poker bro site um and that's where i again i was i totally focused mainly on poker but now as i developed the stream i was like man i think i'm gonna have to focus on tournaments i think that's that's a lot more fun aspect for uh uh people to watch and um, watching a tournament poker on twitch but I do occasionally will, will stream. I want to stream um, cash. Um, uh, if you look back at one of my um, one of my streams, there, I designed a, a hacked together a you know in the staging room where I go, uh, you, you see the table there. Well, I actually hacked together a way of playing on that table. If you look back, you'll see it. It's got the cards on the table, and and it just Kind of cool but it, it was just really clunky and it, it wasn't going to work for a stream i mean i could do it if i was just relaxing and playing cash that would be uh i could use that i still have that i still have it all put together so i can i can use it um but i don't know when i'll get back to, to that because i'm moving forward with it with this but it's pretty cool it's like if i just want to hang out play some cash um i i can i can just you know go to that table and sit and play one game one on one table of cash one two or something but yeah I, I played on american card room cash up there quite a bit um uh 
needless to say, I'm not a winning poker player, so uh, it's a work in progress. And so I, I, I think by putting myself out here like this, uh, and, and I recommend that everybody should do it, you know, just because it's not hard to, you know, you get your webcam, you get, it's not hard to stream, you can get things, you can get something basic set up and you can start getting feedback from people right away about, you know, poker and stuff. So I'm just, I'm glad to be here. I'm glad to be able to do this and uh, I enjoy the hell out of it. So, and I want to get on, like I said, I want to get a schedule set up, uh, basically just to balance my life. Um, too much, uh, I'm pushing too hard. I'm, 53 years old so it's like uh, I can't keep pushing like this anymore I'm not I'm not young enough to, um, but I'm in this major I get into these major creation times like when I created Chess Maniac and I created used to radio hosting and I knew there was another one coming I just didn't know when and it's here and so I, I, I push myself but I, as I get older it becomes harder and harder to, to do that takes a lot of energy and you know i have i have two young kids so uh i need to you know i need to balance my life again and, and my wife too i gotta gotta balance that you know, about halfway through there was a discussion so it was like oh hey yeah you know i gotta because i was just you know up all night sleeping all day and it was just like i'd wake up and be on it so i had to make some time to try to balance there like, you know, just making sure to try to keep things balanced. So it's hard. It's hard when I get in the creative mode and, and start start building something. Um, and I'm still not done with this. So you got to stay tuned. You got to stay tuned. King Donk. Chase. I'm not gonna chase, but I gotta get I gotta get my HUDs back active again. I just haven't. You know, I have Holden Manager Three, which is one of the best I think poker HUDs out there. At least that's what I found. I've used Poker Tracker, I've used Drive HUD, but Holden Manager Three is by far I think the best. Um, and if you look again back to my older screens there, I had it all set up so you could see what I was doing and stuff and what I what my session was like. But it's difficult. I mean, you you're gonna stream and and play poker at the same time, man. It's not it's fucking hard, especially if you're learning all this shit and all this new stuff. And it's like, oh my god, changing scenes and doing all this stuff. Like, so it just it just becomes difficult. And it's like the managing, like I think it's like a whole learning curve there. Like when all you guys came into the stream, it was just like, oh my god, whoa, whoa shit. It, you can I can get flustered so easily, and then you lose track of everything. I kind of feel I lost, kind of lost a little focus uh, tonight. But it was good. It was good. It was good. It was good to have you guys in here. I'm, I'm, I'm super happy that, super stoked. And happy that Alex uh, rated me. Uh. I slow him down though. Alright. Where's everybody from? Where are you from, ghost?
I don't think I can defend. We got people watching, man. Appreciate that. Thank you so much for watching. So cool. See all of you out there. Love it. Deep enough here, maybe to go with a speculative hand. Nine eight. Pretty early though. But maybe I should see what happens. I get raised. And an all in here. It's not here. I mean, on this, not on this table. Another table. Um. Oh wow! All hearts. Wow. It's like this all night, man. What the hell? Um. Gosh. Uh, I'm gonna go back over to board one here. Yeah. I don't know if I should defend with that. I wanted to show this. Like. It's like six. You know, set. Three level. I don't know. When in doubt, I guess fold, right? Oh yeah, and I can't, I can't do this one here. Man. I mean, shoot, that's going nowhere. That's going nowhere. Oh, okay. I'm up in Vermont, so. How are things down there, man? Is it, uh, I mean, you know, we're kind of isolated up here in Vermont. Which is, I'm lucky to live up in the northeast part of Vermont, which is like the most rural part of Vermont. Little small, small hill farms and stuff. And uh, so we still got local food here, and still got a lot of water. Uh, like that's what I, I don't know. The way I look at it, if everything goes to hell in a handbasket out there, Vermont's probably one of the best places to live, just because we have sort of the the local food structure still in place here, it's not completely annihilated by the industrial food system. So it's it's uh, kind of unique. I mean, I just picked up a cow. Farmer Brown, believe it or not, his name is actually Farmer Brown on Mount Hunger Road. So I've been dealing with him. I buy raw milk from him for years. So I just like pick up the phone after when all this shit was going down. And I'm like, uh, yeah, you got any cows coming up that are going to be, you know, ready? He's like, as a matter of fact, I got lucky. I called and I, he had one. I was like, I'll take it. I'll take it. You know, so I have a full like freezer full of uh, meat. Basically, mostly hamburger, but it's, the price of meat seems to be going up. It's, it's kind of scary, man. You, you pump that much money into the, the freaking—I uh, don't want to get all political. Anymore, but you pump that kind of money into the into the 
into the system and you're gonna see hyperinflation and that means things are gonna start costing more money uh, quickly and I hope it doesn't happen I don't hope we don't have hyperinflation I hope it just you know, a little bit of inflation to absorb the devaluing of our currency that they just did um, but if it starts to kick into high gear, that's when you're going to like go to the store one week and pound hamburger is going to be five bucks or whatever it is. And then you're going to go the next week and it's going to be 10 bucks a pound and then 15 bucks a pound the next week. And it's like a loaf of bread continue raising, rising price. That's what scares me the most about this whole thing. I, I thought I was, well, I, I don't want to get the whole thing. I mean, you got, we're a little bit isolated up here. I mean, we don't have as many COVID cases, but um, so I, I, I can't view it from your perspective. Um, I don't think I can. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I'm still up here. I grew up here. I'm actually uh, um, Abenaki Indian. Uh, so my family goes way back to the native families around here the native generations back up in northern northern Canada you know northern Vermont and Canada and so yeah it's uh you know Vermont's a unique place uh I don't really like the politics of it but uh the whole thing but it's uh definitely definitely uh when, when I was out in California um I really wanted to bring i mean i call it the shire because that's what it feels like to me it's like it's like the shire man there's like i have not except for i have not found a place that and, and you know i've been on you know all across the united states and i have not found a place that is unique as vermont is and, and, and especially the northeast kingdom the northeast kingdom is a, i mean the only way i can describe the northeast kingdom a lot of people think of vermont they think of bernie sanders they think of they think of uh you know, liberals, and, and uh, they think of, I don't know, they think, they think something different. They think like Burlington, but the Northeast Kingdom is a totally different place. It's like the little Texas of Vermont, I would you say. Um, a lot of little hill farms, um, a lot of hunters, you know, big, you know, it's a geographical mountainous, hilly area, and it's spread out. 40,000 people up in this area, but it's spread out over a large, a large area, uh, and a lot of, a lot of wilderness, a lot of, a lot of, uh, a lot of land, empty land, um, you know, that's, that's difficult to live on, because, you know, it's, it's, um, in, in some places, but, um, but there's a lot of beauty, uh, in all of that, and, just unique uh, in that sense. Um, now, the only other place that I found that reminded me of Vermont, this is going to sound interesting to you, but my my wife is from Bosnia. And when I visited Bosnia, it was weird because we like went there and I was like, it was like very similar to Vermont in that particular area. Now, it's interesting about Bosnia is that you can move from one side one side of the of the country to another and it's drastically different uh as, as you move within four hours it's different but the area that she's from is a, a mountainous area that has ski resorts which is like you know, vermont and they they have they're really like all of them are like planting gardens little small villages and it, it even the landscape in that particular area looked like vermont and i felt totally at home when I went there, I went to our home village. Just the people were amazing. The communities are still tight knit. I would say it was what just surprised me when um, when I saw Bosnia, um, Bovici is where she's from. Little little village about the size of East St. Johnsbury, just out here where I kind of grew up as a kid. Um, but. Uh, yeah, beautiful, beautiful country. I'm sure there's other places, but I haven't run into anything similar to like what what we have up here. It's just um, very unique, very unique. 
I mean, you could literally. There's enough game up here. You could hunt, hunt for your food if you wanted to. And plant a garden, and you know it, it would be a tough life. It's tough if you have to totally rely on a garden and and, and some farm animals and stuff. But it's doable. That's the thing. It's doable, but it's not easy. Though. The winter's up here. The winter's a hard, as my friend, as my friend said. Oh yeah, I, I I don't like I don't like the humidity either. Uh, the humidity. Uh, yeah, definitely. I prefer the West when it comes to that. Arizona, New Mexico, Nevada, totally could live out there. I mean, I lived out there. I lived in California for 20 years. So I, you know, I loved it. I was in, uh, I was in the Central Coast out there. Um, beautiful. In fact, I went to Cal Poly. Uh, that's why I graduated um, from college, Cal Poly. So. Um, but yeah, it's a beautiful, beautiful country out there, and I love the weather. I can stand, I can stand the heat. Um, I can stand the heat out there because it's the dry, heat. The dry. Heat, definitely. I used to. Have you ever seen Storage Wars? I used to buy storage units out in California, and then I take them to the swap meet out there. I, I traveled to Bakersfield, sold the Bakersfield <coughs> swap meet. I've sold down in um, Lum. Uh, um, Umpok, uh, and uh, Umpok, where else? Napomo, um, Pomo Squat Me. Yeah, so the Central Coast in general. I lived out in Paso Robles. That's where I really got interested in wine. In fact, Jonathan Little on his stream I, was drinking wine, and I was trying to get the name of it from him because I was just wondering if it was from the Central Coast. I also lived in Hawaii, and when I joined the army, I left home when I was 17 and joined the army, and ended up in Hawaii of all places. What a great place to be stationed, Hawaii. 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 Well, I'm gonna defend up here. Yeah, Hawaii was beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. I used to sell real estate out there. I mean, I was in the army and I got out and I stayed there. I can't even steal the fucking line. Man. What the hell? Definitely not my night tonight. Just getting hammered every time I turn around. Huh. I don't see it. I just don't see it. All right. Man, okay, this is the last level of late registration. I've been hanging on with like a tiny amount of blinds here. Crazy. Hey, pocket nines, I'm in on that one. I got three colors. Wow. chose not to see bad, and the reason I didn't see bad is Jonathan Little said you should probably never see bad on kind of high flop. I'll call.
Ooh. Ooh, yeah, I'm liking that. Okay. I think I'm gonna have to value this. Okay. Okay. That's too much. He was betting the whole time. No, it's cold. Ooh, get a call. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Whew. That's what I'm talking about. We needed that one. Oh, I can check about that other tournament. 2500 guarantee. Oh yeah, it's from level three. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna jump in that one too. That way we got four tables. Alright, here we go. We got four tables. Very good. Reset the names of the tables here. Oh, start. That's good. Great. Good. Names are all good. Sometimes it's hard to pay attention to the number of blinds you have when you got four tables. I can't even imagine what some of the, like I was watching this uh this lady stream a pro. Um I can't remember what her name was. But really good, really good player. And you know, eleven tournaments. Jonathan Little with his twenty tournament tables open. I just don't even know how they keep it all together. I don't even understand how they keep it all together. Oh, oh, they're asking me to prove that I'm a human here on America's Card Room. Shit, I got... Holy crap, I have to do that while I'm streaming N? What the hell? Okay. Uh, hold, hold. I gotta pick all the traffic lights here. Okay, good. Now they want me to pick all the vehicles. Alright, here we go. I pick all the vehicles. Make sure that I am a human. I am human. Let me continue. Okay, I passed the human verification test. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, you gotta give America's card room credit. They're, they're they're doing the best they can to try to keep the bots off the fucking site. I mean, that's, that's, I like that. All right, so we got we got four here. Let me go back to the multiplayer table here. I had, got interrupted with uh, had to verify that I was a human on uh, on America's card room. So I verified that I am indeed human. Lots of folding, lots of folding. Man, I need a double up over there on that four hundred guarantee. Good morning, everybody. How is everybody? Almost 6 a.m. Hope you're getting your coffee and waking up and joining my stream. Welcome. Currently in four tournaments. Um, let's see. No, can't. Currently, this is what we have going on. We have four tournaments, a 400 guarantee, a 1,000 guarantee, a 600 guarantee, and a 2,500 guarantee. Don't pay attention to the buy-ins. They're a lot higher, and I've only cashed for about 15 bucks. So I think I'm upwards of probably $100 buy-in. So. so that's where I'm at. Uh, if anybody's just getting in, I just wanted to let you know. So back to the multi-table here. Stop in and say hello to us in the chat. Oh, why did see that? I completely like didn't pay attention I, when I did eight nine, right? 
Well, maybe it'll look fishy. It'll look like I'm, uh, I don't know. That was ridiculous. I should, if I was going to go with it, I should have just put it in. But I'm streaming. I'm looking at different things. And I didn't even. Damn it. That was dumb. I don't know what I did that for. Uh, yeah, it's difficult. It's difficult sometimes to stream and, and play at the same time. But that was a that was a lame move right there. Although I did that once uh, in a stream previously. It was, it was funny because it, it, it looked really fishy and everybody just like they folded it. <laughs> I think I limped or something. I don't know. Yeah, I'm going to be out here pretty soon on this one. Well, let's look for a different one. Okay, we have Ace King here. So we are definitely going to raise this up. Uh, that up. So we're going to zoom in on that one. Oh, we get folk. They folk. All right, so let's see. Four, three. We have Ace Jack. We're going to be raising that up. And um, looks like I'll be all in with 7-8 up on that other board there. So. Okay, so I'm gonna be all in on this board here, so we gotta get it in. So there's nothing else I can do there. Um, we're going pit. Okay, we're out of that one. So we're back down to three tournaments. I will need to look for another one to join. I don't think I. Oh, it was only 23 into the money there. I guess I could have doubled up on that one. Go back to the multi here. And we'll look for another tournament to join. Oh, starts in one minute. 500 guarantee. Here we go. We're joining that. So we got another one coming right up. So we'll, I'm going to keep it rocking and rolling here as long as I can stay awake. I'm excited to have uh, as many viewers as we do, so I am pleased to stream for you as long as I can. And if you would, just give me some, you can give me some feedback. I mean, I'm not, uh, I'm an inspiring poker pro, which means I kind of want to be poker pro, so I'm still learning. Good mo hey, good morning, darling. Hey, you're never going to guess what happened. Alex. Uh, Alex uh, Optimal, one of the streamers, completely raided my stream with like uh, I don't know how many, like 80 people. So we've been I've been streaming all night long. <laughs> it's been cool. You can come in. If you want? Put your head in in the green screen. In between the green screens or the green whatever these things are. Yeah, it's been the most people I've ever had on my stream. It's just it's, it's cool. I don't know how many left here, but uh, I know some of them are still hanging around, so I'm glad to keep going.
I cashed in one, uh, I think for like $15. Um, but it's been kind of a rough night, a rough session here. I'm going to have to go back and dig out how much I've actually, uh, my buy-ins actually were. Because I did not keep up with that. I was actually trying to see if there was a way that someone could write a program so that when I opened and registered for a tournament, it would automatically dump it into a text file and, or calculate it and keep track of it for me automatically so I wouldn't have to worry about it. Rather than have to open up a text file and calculate it so that it, so it's OBS, you know, to put it in OBS. But uh, it seems like it's a difficult thing to do. But I'm going to have him keep trying and see if he can figure it out because it'll just make things easier. Then it'll automatically update when I join a tournament. It'll know exactly. And I can just, be able to. just like the, the, the names now. I don't have to worry about the table names. That automatically gets dumped into OBS for me into a text file. And OBS picks up the text file from there. I got that idea from uh, Imagine Cat. If you, ever, if you haven't his, seen his stream, Ghost, you should check that out. He's a... Uh, you know, unbelievable streamer with uh, so many like cool special effects he's he inspired me to do what you know, to create what i've created right now Probably should just fold this thing, but these are too thick. We have a backdoor flush drop. Hmm. All right. Everybody just check. Okay. Okay. Ooh. Okay, that's even better. We got pocket nines on table four. Well, I'm gonna rip it. And then pocket nines definitely gonna raise this up. Oh, what? He's straight? Did he straight on the river? I totally missed that. No way. Wow. Wow. Not a good session. I need another tournament. Oh. Hmm. Forty minutes, ten minutes. Check, 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 check all the way and then shoves in the river. That didn't make any sense. That's not making sense. I'm 
not go. Gotta find another one to get into, guys. 38 minutes, that's a 5,000 guarantee. Wow. Relatively aggressive players here tonight. This session. A lot of shoves. Thirty-seven minutes. There's a five thousand guarantee. What do you guys think? You think we should do the five thousand guarantee? Let's see. Thirty-seven minutes. Seven minutes is a fur ball. That's an early bird special. Let's see if the mic that. Hyper Turbo. That's in seven minutes. That might be kind of fun. I don't know. It looks crazy. Survival mode. Uh, six minutes. Eh? Well, Hyper Turbo might be kind of fun. Let's try that one. In like three minutes or something. That'd be fun. Alright, pocket jack on the uh, board three. If I call and he shoves, I'm going to be getting it in with Jack, so I can just put it in right now. I'm just going to put it in right now. I've been wasting my time. Six, seven? Oh, and he hit. I'm good. Yes! Wow, okay, I'll take it. All right, um, I'm going to take a break here. So I'm going to say good morning to my darling wife here, and I'll be back in just a few minutes here. So if you would, stay tuned because I'm having fun, guys. I'm glad you're here. I'll be right back. I didn't do that right. Hold on. Uh, okay, ready? We was reaping what we sold, yeah. 
I guess we was unequally young. Guess that we was putting on the show. Guess we should have tried to take it slow. Guess I let my feelings take control. Guess I let my demon take the wheel. Used to think that we'd be growing old. Now I can't believe that it was real. It was back in late December when I did it. I just wish I could forget it. Cause I hate how much I love it. Oh, I hate how I just love it. Don't you feel it? Yeah. And you told me that you understood depravity, but now I know you didn't. I guess it's better just to live it and forget it than to live it. Uh, ghost, uh, go, ghost, uh, no, it's just, this, this is not really normal for me to be streaming, um, like this. Um, I just, you happen to catch me like I've been working on my stream and I just kind of, uh, been staying up really late. And so I don't normally stream this late, to be honest with you. Um, uh, I would prefer, well, actually, I would prefer to be waking up about four or five and starting a stream now. So maybe, yeah, it's kind of at this time would be kind of technically my stream time. Um, but I prefer, but sometimes, well, I'm going to set up a schedule. I have to set up a schedule sooner or later. But when I would play cash and stuff, yeah, I would play to like midnight or so. But uh, um, no, this is... This definitely, but yeah, if I wake up early, I'd rather, I prefer to wake up early and do the stream. Let me go back to the multi-board because we're, we got four tournaments going on now. So, we're four and how many do we got? We still got people hanging out, watching. Cool. Right on. I just uh, hope more of them want to chat a little bit.
wow, there's this weird effect now on my stream. So, uh, Ghost, in my stream, I'm looking at it now, and I'm seeing like this weird blinking effect going on. That's so weird. I'm not sure what is causing that. It's very strange. Is, is that is that showing up like that? That's so weird. Very strange. Hmm. I get squeezed here from the small blind. Please from the small blind. Very strange effect. Alright, so eight levels of late registration, thirty-four levels of late registration, twenty-nine levels of late wow, there's a lot of late registration that can happen here. But we are three of nine in this two hundred guaranteed. Three of nine. This is basically a final table. Oh, how's that? Huh. We got Queen from board one. Queen, 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 Queen. Get some good hands. We're going back to the multi table. So we get, oh, well, seven six. Good in. Uh, no, I'll fold. Oh. Okay. We hit a set of queens on board one. How about that? Whew.
We get raised. What value bet this? Come on me. Let me take it down. Um, I'll get that top pair. I hope he doesn't have ace clean. Oh, sorry. Uh, it, the, the screen was like blinking on and off. It looked like the stream had this weird glow effect to it. And uh, I wasn't sure what was going on with it. And I was wondering if it was coming through. Hmm. This is a definitely interesting. Uh, let me get... Sorry. You guys can't see that. Uh, two. Report two. This is definitely interesting here. Um... Uh, he's shoving on me. Really? Man. Oh. Jack, Queen. Jack. He's there. To the multi table. Paul. King. Um, let the pocket fours go and we'll focus on board uh, three. Jack. Hmm. Let me bet this for value. He did not look like he was going to be one and done there. Thought maybe you could take it down. It calls. Yes. All right. Four pen. Early, early, early position for um, King Jack of Hearts. I'll just open it. Jack Hughes. Hmm. Got pocket queens. I'll open up the multi table. We've got two, bo two action boards now. Queens down here. King Jack, I'm in on this one. Um, he's all in, so we'll call that the queen. Hold. Yes. All right. Good there with the queens. King Jack. That didn't do us any good. Uh, check that. Getting anywhere with this King Jack of Hearts. Thank you. Where? Oh. Palapuno. Oh, yes, please. Oh. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh. All right, guys, I'm having breakfast right now. Oh. Okay, we hit a six. Okay. Okay. All right, all right. Huh. Crap. Okay. Um, 
Where's Jack off? Ah, uh, let's hold it. Oh, let's get up here. I need some breakfast, guys. Sorry. Hope you don't mind. Hmm. What's that? My dad cup. Hmm. What got here? Hmm. Nines versus A7. Okay, we pick up Ace King. Mm -hmm. Um. If we can take down the blinds here. We get two callers on that ten five trying to steal a blind. So I'm not going to see that there. Mm-hmm. Okay. How's everybody doing this morning? Thanks for sticking with me this long. I appreciate it. Okay, we don't hit anything with King Queen over there. Get there. 
we get there. Oh wow. Seriously? Whoops. Yeah, that's good. Um, yeah. Uh yeah, we call. There we go. Take it down. Whoop. Nine eight. Uh we will raise that up. Uh hold on, we'll go back to multi. Fucking nines, board one. Oh wow, we have an all in. Oh. Okay. Queen. Queen of nine. Queen of nine. Well, we lose that flip. Oh, and we pick up aces. How about that? Wow, they're folded.
Hmm. Oh. Yeah, maybe I should put it all in. Only eight, 18 big blinds. I think a shove would have been better on the eighth four. Hmm. I'm just gonna let it go. I think the right play there would have been to shove. Go for me to squeeze. Man. Pocket tens. And whoa, tens again. We got tens up there again. We got queens down here. Call this tens and uh, I'm shove the queens in. Yeah, we're pretty deep stacked. That probably yeah, it worked. We got it done, but but that I just, I just shoved the 200, 220 big blind. In that one it might not have been the right play. It would have worked. Raise up pocket eight. Uh, I don't think he just called. I don't think you could have a piece of that with a set of sevens and maybe have to get a set of fours, even a set of deuces. I don't know. Oh, wow. Shit. That's too care what? Okay. Ah. 
time. Get a short stack here. And big blinds. And big blinds. Six levels of late registration left here. Five levels here. And this one's 30. Like I'm already behind. Down to 10 big lines. Alright, new table up at the, up here. Sorry about that. Let me get that back over. We've got a new table over here. Uh, let's see what we got. 27 big lines, 154. We got a big stack over here. What a big stack. The rest of us are kind of even. I mean, meet, medium stack. So I'm going to get small, small here. Uh, yeah, let's pull that. How's everybody doing this morning? Everybody either staying up all night or uh, just waking up. Looks like we lost a few of you. Hopefully we'll pick up some new viewers soon. It's uh, 6.31. Uh, Alright, you can see that on the board. There's 6.31 on the East Coast. Good morning. Good morning, Twitch! Oh, sorry. We have, uh, let's see. Oh, yeah, it is. Pocket Jack. Uh, we're ripping this one. Uh, board four. Let's get a nice little double up right here. I need it. Pocket threes. Hold. Come on, hold, hold, hold. Yes, all right. Nice. That brings it back up to 21 big blinds. We got pocket sixes here with 12 big blinds. Oh, I don't know about that, that limp over there, though. Ah, let's go. So, over here on uh, board one, we got pocket sixes and we do take it down we shoved on them all right guys I gotta remember to go back and forth on the switching See if I can get that reposition so it makes it a little easier
Let me buy a candle. around look at this table and over here look at this table Let's see. Oh, right. nine. and pull the price thing. Stay in the scene. Oh, cool. I don't think I, I couldn't tell if I stayed in the scene the whole time. When I review the video, I'll, I'll check. Oh. Oh, wow. That would have been a decent flop for us. Seems like that's the way it's happening today. I. I'm folding and hitting and calling and not hitting and but we would have been with a lot anyway. That's okay. So fucking fives. Uh man, is that really early? Yeah, we're deep. I'm gonna play it. Jack deuce, we will fold. We got a set of five. We have a set of fives. And, and he's betting into me. Uh, we're going to go pot on this. Pocket fives again on board one. Pocket fives on the big line. everything. I fold. That was the max pressure he could put on me. 
pretty much would have had maybe like what one big line left. Hmm. Kings versus Queens. Eight. Hmm. Oh. A limp from the small blind, right? I have Ace Eight off. Well, not gonna happen. Jack 5 off, going down the drain. 9-6, fold. 9-4, fold. And I think I can actually see how some of those pros play like 11, 10, 15 tables because they have such tight ranges, they're just folding mostly everything. They don't get themselves into weird, awkward spots. Weird, awkward, awkward spots. Because they know when to fold. It's like they know precisely most of the time in their ranges what they can fold so they're, they're they're very very tight and they with their ranges and i can see how you could work yourself up to 11 12 15 uh, tournament tables and then pull them in over to share with people they know exactly precisely which ones to share now this is uh man this is close here this is real close Ah. Hmm. I think I probably should have called them. I'm not sure. That's some of the things that I need to become clearer on. I'm going to do a battery change. big blinds. Let me just put this one in here on board one. Oh, get called. All right. So I get against the bigger ace. I'm hoping or hoping not. Oh, ten. Jack ten. Ace nine. And he gets a nine and an ace. And okay. Well, I'm still in. Still in. That was a bummer. Oh, no problem, Ghost. That's okay.
Big blinds. That's gonna make it difficult. We'll see what we can do. Probably should have looked for a different one. re-entered. Man, I'm going crazy just because I, it, it's cool that I have actually people watching the stream, so I'm just like, you know, I'll just re-enter, re-enter, and uh, see what we can do. Only cash one. I could use the cash the one here. Let's see. our way through this. This is risky, I think. I don't know if I should have done this. I'm worried mostly about Nick Cave. The yeah, other fuck with you will probably fold, but well, this big line is thinking about it. Hmm. Will it go through? Will we get this through? Uh, yes! 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 Woo! There we are. All right. Nice. We needed that one. Finally, a flip went our way. It's been a while. How's everybody out there? What are you multitasking with, Ghost? Are you, you uh, playing? And... I 
actually think that maybe I could steal this. I don't know, I think I needed to steal it on the turn. Ah, shit. Find out. Damn it. I forgot to change it to the blue, the blue grayish color. That's what looks best with my colors. So it's better, it's easier on the eye. Okay, we'll raise up the sevens. Hold the seven dudes suited. I don't know if we're gonna defend. I don't know if we're gonna defend. Uh, Try to get you guys a current total. You can tell how many buy ins I've got in total. Just give me a minute here so I can multitask this. Pretty deep, I think.
Yeah, that's what I figured, figured here. So I'm gonna put that up. break here so this give me perfect time here 2060. okay yeah all right so I'm correct with this Got the new numbers up and we're in 10325 with cash for 4360. If I got that right, I will double check it. Um, so we're down about 40 or 50 bucks, a little over. Um, let me see if I can get that move. stage here I'm glad a lot of you are sticking with me uh, I do appreciate it um, and uh, I hope you're enjoying uh, watching me stream and hanging out in my poker room and uh, hope you support us and follow it follow me if you can I really would appreciate it and uh, it'll encourage me to add more cool things to the stream to help you have fun and interact with it my goal is to have people interact with from the chat directly into my streaming control different elements and uh you've already seen parts of that so you'll be able to control different parts of the stream so if you can follow me just so you can come back and check me out and say hey what let's see what the let's see what dennis is up let's see what the aspiring poker pro is up to let's see what dennis is up to my real name's dennis steel um i'm the aspiring poker pro and uh, i would love to hear your suggestions i would love to you know uh build something that would be cool and different something that hasn't been done on twitch before something that is different in the poker community um something totally unique and uh would you know looking forward to uh all of you just give me a follow if you can all right i'm gonna take a break um appreciate you tuning in here so
And we're back. Oh, wait. Why am I not in the camera? There we go. Oh. I'm in the wrong spot. <laughs> Alright. We're back. Ace 10 suited. 27 big blind. Alright, so basically I have to be willing to rip it if. Alright, we're gonna. We'll raise it up. And if somebody comes over the top of me, I have to be... So, I'm in the 20 to 30 blind mark. And um, actually, when I read Jonathan Little's book... So, if somebody comes over the top, i got to be willing to just put it all in. At this uh, epic here. Okay, well... So... I'm not going to open raise any hands that I'm not willing to shove over the top of a re-raise or three back. So if I can keep that in my head. Yeah, it does, huh? Ghost, it, 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 much better. I'd forgotten to change the color. Um... It gives that, I don't know, I love the, the whole four board display with me in the center. Um, and I'm going to fix that punch thing so that I can get punched anywhere. Any screen I'm on will work. Yeah, so I probably won't be entering any more tournaments after these because uh, I feel my body starting to crash after being up all night. I got really super excited with everybody coming in, and uh, I'm, I'm just glad that I could stream with uh, more people in the chat than ever has been in the chat before. And we'll open up the sixes, and we've got Ace King on board four, on table four. Uh, so we'll open up the king. We'll fold 10, 8, and... Oh, wow. Oh, a, re, a three bet, a four bet, and a fold for me. With my sixes down the drain. Um, in this, uh, ace king is definitely a... Definitely a three bet. On that um, it's a gutter ball but uh, definitely see that definitely see that according to optimizing ace king okay we got ace 10 on two ace 10 Ooh, and an ace 10 up here on the flop how weird is that Oh, uh, uh, wow, 11 levels of late registration. I think, I think this is a call. All right, we're calling, we're going. Ace eight, we're, we've got him dominated right now. We're good, we're good, we hold, we hold. Yes. Ace ten holds. Nine eight suited on the small blind. Hmm. Very low interesting. No, I mean very interesting. I think I'm just gonna I'm just gonna limp this. Like we got a limper back there. I'll limp it. Maybe the, com the big blind will complete. And I get to see a flop, and I do get to see a flop, but it's all the wrong freaking suit. I mean, I got I got top pair, but you know, with two other players in now, that's not good. So I don't know. It's kind of. I mean, I'll, I'm gonna call probably once. We'll call. Cause they could, you know. Oh, yeah. Now that's pretty much done. Yeah, it's pretty much done. Oh, we check. Uh, that's gonna be a check. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna continue if he if he. Uh, oh, 
He had a bigger nine. Oh. I bet there would have taken it down. Oh, well. Um, fold. Fold. How many folds does it take to get to a final table? A one, a two, a three. A three folds to get to the final table. Many, many folds to get, off, get to a final table. It takes many, many, many folds. Incredible amount of folds. Folding makes you more money, I think someone said at one time. Folding always makes you more money than calling. Who was it that said that? I can't remember it. Someone that somebody in the Poker Coaching community online. Is that was Jonathan Little or not? Uh I'll raise up the King Queen here. It's a little bit early. I think it's worth coming in. And if we get three bet, ah, uh, he shoved on. What the hell? Okay, I'll fold. Deuces versus ah. Uh. Oh, instead of deuces, wow! Oh my god! Wow, there are some gamblers here. There's some gamblers. Gamblers in this tournament. The early morning gambler scene is on. Yes, it is. Hmm. 14 of 21. 21 players left in this, but there are 10 levels of late registration. Which means we could be at 20 players for quite some time. Three levels of late registration here. We are sitting on 27 big blinds. And 51 of 54, we're pretty much in, almost in last place in the 2500 guarantee. A7 suited. Um, let's see. What are we going to do here? Hmm. I, know, I think I just see if I can complete and see a flop on this, I guess, or maybe I should. 14 big blinds. I'm putting it all in. Let's go for it. I think that's a better move than just calling in this position. I don't know if it's the best. Tens. Oh, set of tens. Oh, that's it for us in that one. Wow. Um. Folded that one. Yeah, yeah, that was a good fold. Okay. Um. Okay, let's change the number. Oh, we only we got 22 big lines. Yeah, maybe that wasn't such a good free entry there. I'm making some bad decisions here regarding free entries. I think. Um. Probably because of lack of sleep. So I need to change my number back to 550. That's when. Save. Okay. All right. Okay. Uh, fold by three op. King nine. Well, it looks like we're gonna get to see a flop. King nine. We do it the nine. Hmm. 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 Okay. That's five. I think I'm probably gonna take a little stab at this. See what happens. Uh, we get called, so it's possible that, uh, let's see, what did he have? I don't think a deuce helped him. Um, I think we'll put in a little bet here. I don't know. I gotta, I'm gonna barrel it again. If we get called, we get called. And we fold, he folds. He must have been a flush draw or something. 
Okay. Um. Thirteen to twenty-three, nine levels of late registration. This one's only got two levels of late registration. I'm hanging in with twenty-four big blinds. You can get past. But one of the, the the hardest things to do to do is get past this late registration level because then it becomes like a new tournament. Then it's like everybody tightens up, um, <clears throat> and they know they can't re-enter, so they tighten up and they play differently and it's like just like a brand new tournament almost so everybody just just starts to play differently so i i like it when it gets to that point it just i don't know it just feels different it feels more like a real live tournament um people aren't running around re-entering all the time although that happens in some live tournaments but it, where where we're from up here and uh the little tournaments that run here are all freeze outs so you're out you're out so people play wicked tight. They play totally different. Um, there is sometimes a lot of uh, ace jack, ace jack off. I don't think this is a call from the early open. I think I pulled that. Um, so there's yeah, there's a there's interesting dynamic when you have a freeze out um, because they I mean at the playground when I play up there, the poker playground, you can play, uh, you can re-enter to a certain amount of time, but with this little freeze out that play in our local area it, it does change things people either bluff a lot more or they're a lot more they're a lot tighter uh they play differently differently for sure hmm uh Ace King, we pick up Ace King on table four. Raise that up. Bring it on. Bring it on. Bring it on. Come on, let's go. Let's go. Come on. You're waiting for five, six, and kings. Oh man, I need an ace. Ah, peace. All right, we're gonna let that one go. I think, or what is it? Five, six, yeah, here's the five, six. Damn it. Okay, another one. Here we go. Can't believe I'm doing. This. All right, whatever. We'll re-enter. Running, running, running bad. I'm running bad. Another five. Another five up there.
Oh, I'm gonna rip this one in. Um, squeeze. Oh wait, uh, this would be on table two. Oh wow, I have. I, I'll just go multi. -day. I have ace, eight of diamonds on the both top two tables. That's weird. That's very strange. Uh, but on this one's a different scenario. I don't think. I don't think. Oh, he's all in. All right. I'm going to. I'm gonna rip it and isolate. And raise up to seven. See if I can isolate just five big blinds over here. I think I have a good shot at, at this here. It's worth the risk if I can get them isolated. Let's open this guy fold, 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 fold. Fold, fold, fold. I need to fold. Let me take him on. Alright. Alright, come on. Damn it! Come on, diamond! Oh man! Peace! Okay, I think it was the right play. Um, and uh, this one, I'm gonna check it. Could have maybe put a C bet, but uh, I'm not sure it was wise. Sevens. And so yeah, there's someone. Um, yeah, we'll fold the sevens. Um, and now with 16 big lines, uh, we're just gonna rip this. I'm gonna rip the ace nine off. All right, take that down a little bit. A little bit. Two levels. Two levels of late registration left in that tournament. There's 26 to 32 players. It was unfortunate that I couldn't get that uh, six lines. I was ahead, but uh, he caught the queen. So, that's the way it goes. All right, we're gonna fold the seven nine nine seven suited. Um, we have Twenty big blinds here, thirty big blinds here, nine, twenty big blinds. Just trying to talk to myself. Keep two levels of late registration here as well, which is good. Um, and two levels of late registration here. Here we got twenty three levels of late registration. So. Uh, very interesting. Very interesting. Um, old. Run into some pretty bad, bad beats uh, this session. Um, it's been tough. It has been tough. Sets of Jack first, first. Queens, you know, I had queens and somebody hit a set of jacks on me. Jack versus queens, a set of jacks. Then another, I ran into like two sets with big hands tonight. And here we got ace king on board three. We'll zoom in on that. Um, so let's see. Yep. This one's going all in. Ish King. Let's see if this other guy comes along. And yes. I'll just put it all in. And he calls. Oh, Jax King. There it is. Oh, my God. Another set of Jax? How many set of Jax can I lose? What the? That's the second time tonight I've lost to a set of jacks. How how many people, you know how hard it is to win fucking jacks when you can, Jesus Christ. Ah, uh, but, fuck, uh, how much is it to enter this? Three fucking, I'm going back in. God damn it, that was crazy. Ah. Uh, Set freaking jack. Ah, hold it. That's twice, twice tonight that I've lost to a set of jack with a good hand. Twice. Bad. It's, I'm running pretty bad. Pretty bad. Uh, the deuces. Okay, I'll let him go. Nines versus eights. 
Deus. Um, That cost three fifteen. So I have to add three fifteen to the one fourteen. Yeah. Okay. It's not going too well. All right. So let's see here. Three fifteen. Oh, Seven thirty. That's what we're in. Um, okay. Uh, call. Clean six. Hold. Oh, clean. Oh. Oh, we got the straight. Yes. Okay, it's about time. Oh, we got pocket aces here. Hold on, let me get the multi board. Uh, I hope you guys saw that. Sorry, I was busy updating what I had done. We got pocket aces on board three. Um, I want to time out here. Hold, hold. That's uh, hot. Okay. King 10. Ten suited, we'll raise that. Oh man, looking big blind this might have been. There. Maybe I should have folded that. But I don't think I should have opened King Ten. Maybe I was a mistake with the amount of blinds I got. But yeah, I could, I could easily get shoved on here, and I don't know if King Ten is callable. Hmm. Might have to, I don't know. He shoved. Alright, we got queens over here on board four. Um seventeen big blinds, we're putting that all in. Can we take that down? Not gonna mess around. Last level of late registration here. We are holding with 17 big blinds. If we can make it through that uh, through that late registration. There's two levels over here. 22 levels on this one. Yikes. What am I doing in that tournament? Four hours of late registration. Four hours. Oh, we do it. We got the kings, so uh, hold this and uh, call. Hmm. 
Okay, we take that that down. Oh, all right. I didn't even see that one. Uh, okay. Yeah, we're hanging in there. Yeah. And Ace Jack. I'm going to pass on that under the gun. Okay. Oh. Just check. Okay. I'm going to go for half pot here. I mean, a small bet. We can take down, and we do. Good. Okay. Uh, King 8. Hard. Do I want to call that? Uh, no. A pass. Okay. Four. Hmm. Oh, new table up here on table two. Let's see. 60 big blinds, 105 big blinds, 42. Got some smallies here. Um, can defend between 10. No, not with a open raise in the three bet. Uh, in six suited will fold. Jack deuce fold. Okay. Nine five of heart. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna fold that. Pocket five. Definitely gonna. Pocket five. Hmm. I'm gonna rip this? Alright, I'm gonna rip this. I don't know if that's the best play. Uh, fold two, two, ten off. And we get the pocket fives through. Right, five suited is a fold. We are we need another cash. We need another cash. Two five. Nope, no diamond. It's jack. 13 to 27. There's only three levels of late registration. So this is a good one. This is a good one to hang in because there's only 27 players left. And there's three, three levels of late registration. Then we're talking about a really good tight you know, tournament. If I can hold on here, um, it's, it's going to be a good chance on that one. And, you know, it just makes the odds a lot different. There's no more late levels of registration. Only three left and only 27 players left of it. I'm sure that'll go up a little bit before it ends here, but um, hey, we get to check and see a free flop here with uh, Jack Four off, and we don't hit anything. Um, for a backdoor straight draw, um, and I don't see how I can continue with that. Okay, we got pocket sixes. Pocket sixes on board three. We'll bring you that action. Close up. Pocket sixes. And that's a limp. Huh. And then squeeze. Okay, I'll just call. I'm gonna play it conservative. I'm not gonna shove it. And we do not hit a set at 50. Unfortunately, we are going to have full. Okay, that only cost us an extra. Oh no! Seriously. Oh. 
Okay. Well, uh, yeah, would have been a good pot. But, uh, all right, 17 big blinds. With, uh, let's go back. Small play. We have, let's see, 17. Where are we at here? Okay. 76. Um, oh, man, there's a lot going on here. Um, I'm going to fold this. And I'm going to shove this. And I'm going to call this one. Ten. I mean ace. I need an ace. Ace. Yes. All right. That's good. All right. Uh, yeah, I should get that too. Oh. Hmm. Oh, what do we do? Uh, flat. I'm gonna flat. Maybe we should have raised. I am not sure. Oh, and we get raised. See, I think it would have been better to raise there. So I'm holding. Pocket sixes, 17 big blinds, last level of late registration. Uh, okay, we'll raise it. Probably should shove there, maybe, I don't know. Raise, sometimes, shove, sometimes. Pocket fives here. Again, this is a good one. Uh, no set there for us. And, like that. Queen jack. And we'll fold here the sixes. This jack king. Fold king jack up. Oh, here we go. Jack. Jack. We have it all in. Okay, I'm gonna reshove over the top here and. Try to isolate, keep anybody else uh, from coming in here. A four, oh, an ace on the flop. A four. Well, I can't win with Jack, but everybody else can win with Jack. Tonight, against me. Wow, that's crazy. Right, we'll fold this one, and we're gonna, we're gonna put this all in. I gotta get, I'm, I feel like I'm getting a little feisty, aggressive thing here going on, and just like, you know, Get it in and get tired of getting beat here. Okay, well, pocket sevens will just open. Oh, gotta get the music back on. All right, um, let's see. Hold. Uh, we're gonna raise this. Fox sevens gets through to catch the king. And I'll raise up to ace five. I probably should just put that all in. And let's go this way. Um all right. Deuces. Oh, too early for deuces. Probably should have put this ace five all in. One swoop here. Oh, go back here.
Uh, which overlay? The one... Uh, the back wall? Uh, let's see here. Oh, I think I need... Not sure what I need to do with that. Uh, this is a big, big raise here. Why didn't he shove? Alright, let's put it in. And we get called. Oh, let's see what we're up against here. I have a feeling it's a big race. I hope it's not a big race. Uh, oh, wow, he re. Wow, we could be up against kings. Kings here. Or a big ace king. Um, I think our ace 10 is probably not. Oh, ace 9. Oh, we hit the fucking 9. What? Oh, 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 yes. All right. Okay. <clears throat> okay. Um. All right, we'll call. Uh. And. Fold. And fold. And. Fold. Oh, okay. We, we, we got some traction back. Um, we need some down here, though. We got 19 places till we're in the money. And, uh, well, that's, it's a small payout, but still, it's, it's, it's a payout. Take what you can get, right? Especially when you're trying to take this bankroll, uh, and get it. I'd like to get it up, but just at this point, it looks like breaking even is going to be the goal here. Um, Hold. All it takes though is one good, good uh, final table, making it to the final table of one of these, and uh, it can set you right up, pull you out, pull you ahead. Uh, hold this. I should have just flatted, you know, limp. Nine ten with a limp from the early position is definitely a fold. Uh, we have kings with fourteen big lines. We'll just put it all in. Aces, all in. All right, maybe I should have done something weird there. Like limp on the button. But we didn't. All right, we got a call it with the kings. So let me uh, take you down there. Hold. Yes. All right. We needed that. It's going to help us. It's going to push, propel us further into that one uh, for a possible cash. Okay. Awesome. Okay. It seems like maybe we're picking up some momentum here. I don't know what it is. Maybe it's uh, me talking through things. I don't know. Sometimes that does seem to help. Um. Uh, ghost, you mean the back wall? The overlay on the back wall? The overlay on the back wall is pretty much put together. Uh, the, the only part... Oh, you mean like the, this? No, I just went to Shutterstock for the back part. The brick and the this poker room thing. And then I just added on to it. I added the Aspiring Poker Pro. Then I added the study board. And uh, hold on. Let me pull this. And these 10. I'm going to pull that. And... I'm gonna raise this one up. Um, so uh, the the back the back room, uh, the poker sign. If you, I can't point. Um, but the poker sign on the back, that and the brick. I got from. Uh, I bought the rights to the to use the image uh, from 
but now I know I could I could make my own if I wanted to. It's, um, I did. So I yeah, okay. So there's different parts and pieces that uh, are all on there, um, and some of them okay. Shutterstock is one you can get images from. So I purchased the back, the brick, and the poker room sign uh, from Shutterstock to be able to use that. Then um, the the study board, the little neon things um, with the little thing. Those I hired a uh, Fiverr.com person to make for me, um, and uh, and then I bought pieces like I bought like the chalkboard and then uh, I added the that poker mask to it and some other stuff I'm going to add as well uh, then um, of course then I had to make uh, so I had the frames that I had got from Shutterstock for the frame I used the frame and then I just put the images of the poker players in there in a slideshow so um, yeah it's just kind of kind of pieced together um, and then the uh, uh, you know a lot of a lot of different people I, I uh, hired out to do different parts and pieces, and then I just kind of as I understood say like for instance when I had those little uh, study board outline thing done the little neon thing I had to make sure that I just kind of told them what I oh damn it I just pulled it ace queen shit. <laughs> uh, uh, I, I I knew what exactly what I wanted to do so I could get creative. So I had all kinds of different parts and pieces designed with PGN files so that I could get creative and put the pieces and the parts together and create. So what I did is I basically had this designer create parts and pieces for me that I could mix match and build different things with. Um, so I have, you know, like, you know, when you see it in the main the main hall, you see it's all linked together. So I specifically had her design it that way so that it was like more like puzzles so that it, it could be put together differently in different ways and I could I could uh, change it if I wanted to so yeah it, it, at first uh, it was difficult when you try to explain to a designer oh, I want it this way I want it this way and it's like you know what just have them design the parts and pieces for you know that you can get to where you want to go but you're not sure how you want to do it what colors you want to interact with you give them a have them design little bits and stuff for you which makes it easier because then you can it's more flexible for you as, as a designer or the decorator i should say i guess i'm i was the decorator and i had people design parts and pieces and then i just kind of went in and decorated the room with those parts and pieces and then of course learning the obs with the you know the trying to match the neon colors that was that takes some time using the color correction and all that different stuff and it's rather difficult uh to match it and make it look you know, it doesn't have to match perfectly but to make it look so that it kind of blends in and i'm not sure why that sent why that the latest follower name drops down um, I, I think that has something to do with stream elements um so i gotta check that one but this was a long process. This didn't. This started back in May. Real long process. I went uh, originally. I was using OBS. Oh hey, Uncle Slacker. <laughs> wow. I, I, I gotta read this, uh, but I have to hold on. I gotta check the chat, but I have to um, figure out what I'm gonna do here. Uh, oh, it will show up under the dashboard affiliate? Oh, okay. Oh, apply for the affiliate? Um, I gotta take a look. Uh, oops, check. Apply for affiliate. Shows up in the dashboard. 
Um, let's see here. Whoop. Uh, I guess. I, oh, all right. Um, maybe not. Good call there. Ah, yes. Take that down. Excellent. Where would it show up if I'm the affiliate? I have to go to. Let me see. Uh, uh, community content activity. Oh, oh, Kings. Kings, Kings, Kings. All right. Uh, it's eight. Uh, too early. I think I'll let that go. Um, let's see. Preferences, insights, achievements. Let's see what we got. Um, 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 um. Path, path. Oh, yeah, I am an affiliate. <gasps> Holy shit. I made affiliate. Ah, yeah. Unless you've got time machine. Wait, hold on. What? Why is it? It says I'm an affiliate. Uh, I'm not sure uh, if there's something I need to do. It says path to affiliate completed to achieve invitation to the affiliate program. You must simultaneously meet all four, which I have. And then I it says click to get started. And wow, that's cool. Uh, I made it. <laughs> yes. Wow. And then when I click on get started and it says, sorry, unless you've got a time machine, that content's unavailable. I don't know what. Huh. Uh, so let me see. Path to affiliate complete two hours ago. Wow. That's very cool. Wow. I, I got to thank Alex for that. Uh, and for everybody for sticking around. You just helped me make affiliate, man. That is just cool. Thank you so much. Thank you, everybody. Thank you so much. That's great. Uh, I really appreciate it. Um, I, I I don't know what I have to do now. I, I, I wasn't expecting to make affiliate for uh, at least another month, but I I knew I only needed to have an average of three viewers and I was getting close, but tonight I didn't even think that that would, that would do it, and it did. Very cool, um, but I'm, I'm looking at everything now, so I'm, I'm sorry I'm not reading the chat, so I'm kind of trying to figure out what happens on the back end. I'm just seeing... Path to affiliate completed, but I don't know. Whoop! Uh, I gotta pay attention here. Um, oh, I just pulled it. Okay. All right, that's fine. Um, let's see. Uh, yeah, it says I'm completed, so I don't know. It doesn't show up automatically or not. I mean, it did. I am an affiliate. Uh. Yeah, Uncle Slacker. So I am an affiliate now. Uh, I don't know where it if it shows anywhere to you or, or to anybody. I'm not sure what happens. Um, wow. I have God. Okay, I'm gonna pull. Yeah, it it says I'm an affiliate, Uncle Slacker. I just took a look. Uh, it says achievement complete two hours ago. Uh, but I don't know what I need to do after that, uh, if there's anything I have to do. So, uh, maybe I have to set something up. So let's see, let me see when this next break is here. Click the bell for the notification in the upper right. Of uh, my... Okay, so on my page then, right? The bell? Oh, okay. Yeah, it says complete. Uh, you completed three achievements. People know more. Uh, unless you got enough. Yeah, it shows I'm um, completed, but I don't know what I need to do. I click on the get started and it just says, sorry, unless you've got a time machine, that content is unavailable. 
So I don't know what the deal is with that. Um, and it says, hmm, not sure. Let's see. Uh, fold. Wow, it's very cool that I made affiliate. I just don't know what to do. <laughs> uh, you've completed three achievements. You may know. Recently completed. Um, okay, we got pocket nines here. Did I leave you guys on multi just in case? I'm going to push that button because I'm behind the scenes looking at the... I'm going to call this all in. Probably should have shoved over the top but that leaves me with eight big blinds if i lose uh hold hold yes okay we hold there okay uh let's see here um yeah i'm not sure what path to affiliate click huh i don't know what's going on back here on the back end there's greater complete instant emote oh got it thanks okay twitch studio i might have to turn some stuff on i'm not sure let me see here uh twitch studio beta comes to mic uh these are creator updates they okay, got it okay hmm insights Manager. Uh, I'm not sure. I am. It says that I'm an affiliate, but I don't know what I'm supposed to do after that. Uh, let me go back to chat so I can see what you guys are saying. Uh, fill out your tax info and how they pay stuff. Oh, okay. Uh, they will also ask for bank info. You have to actually go to preference uh, under creator dashboard. Oh, I got pocket aces here. All right. Um, okay. Creator dashboard. Okay, let me take a look. I am on the creator dashboard. Yep. Oh, we got an all in here. With the aces. Uh, oh. Ace king. Hold. Yeah, we're going to hold. We're good. We're good. Yes. Oh my god, yes. All right. Uh, let's see here. How long to the break? 33 minutes. My dog is. My dog wants to go out. <laughs> Hold on, Sophie. Okay. Uh, I might have to sit out. She's going to sit there and bark the whole time. All right. Uh, let's see here. I am going to have to sit out to let my dog outside. So, uh,. Okay. Oh, I got queens here, man. I'm in some good hands. Put queens all in. Oh, break. Break. I made it to break. Okay, good. All right, break. Just in time. Just in time. All right, guys. Um, I'm going to take a look at this, and i got to let my dog out. And, uh, again, I appreciate everybody for helping me make it to affiliate. That's it's so cool. Thank you. Uh, and I'll try to get this filled out here. So give me a minute. I'm going to go back to the stage here, and uh, I will be back shortly. See you in a bit.
the sound be the renovation.
tour back, and I am filling out that form right now as we speak. I did find it. Do it. Warm. Have you good? Loyalty pack interview. Oh, yeah, completed. Okay, set payout method. Okay. Back. Hold. Hold. To sit out here because I need to go pull that. Oh, I got a skiing here. Oh, I'll raise that up. All right, uh, I will be, I will be right back, guys. I'm going to go fill out. I'm gonna, I need to go grab my uh, checking account information for that form. Um, so I'm gonna sit out here, and uh, I'll just be right back. So uh, let me. Let me try. Okay, just got to fill out the last step. Uh, nothing like, this is definitely major multitasking.
Okay, I think I think I'm done. Now I'm not sure what the next step is, but I think I think uh, I think I filled everything out. Okay, I think I got it all set up. Uh, does something change on the page now? All right, so I'm down to five big blinds over here, uh, five places to in the money. Uh, so I've got to, let's see, figure something out here. Um, to make something happen, only five big blinds left. Wow, nine away from partner, that's amazing. Okay, so let's see. There's the name of uh, Queen Jack. Okay, I'll take a look. Uh, All right, we do hit the 10. All right. I'll go for this. Oh, ace king. Give me a jack. Nope. All right, we're out of... Uh, we still got a little bit left. Okay. Nope. Uh, well, we might as well just put it all in now on this table here two till the money oh my god no, I'm gonna fold this two to, well I'll be all in next hand but I think I have a better chance oh wow uh wow this is tough okay I'm going all in I don't know if it's the right thing to do but ace king uh whoa yes whoo Whoa, whoa, whoa. That helped. That helped a lot. Okay. Um, whoa, whoa. Hey, whoa, somebody just followed. Hey, thank you for the follow. Well, that's two in a row. Two in a row. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for the follow. 
<laughs> wow, that's great. Thank you so much. Ali. Ali Q. Oh, hold on. Oh, oh, I got out of one tournament. Ali Q. Oh. Ali Quad 2. Ali Quad. I think that's how you said. Ali Quad 2. Thank you for the follow. All right, let me uh, look at that page. One more time here. Uh, congrats, you are a Twitch affiliate. Oh, go to, okay, we're still tinkering behind the scenes and getting things ready for you. Your affiliate tools will be available soonish. As Twitch affiliate, you have new actions on the stream manager, such as bits, subs, emotes. Okay. So I go here now, and I've got... Uh, so I think it's it's good. Yeah, thank you, Ali Quad. Appreciate it. Um, uh, so I... I think it's all set up. I don't know. There's additional stuff here now that I can do. Um, oh, let's pull this. And this. Caller only chat. Use a gift. Uh, okay. I don't know if there's anything I need to do back here just yet without hard to focus when I'm like uh, playing but uh, let me see here and it's oh they said it, it, it might not all be set up yet we've got follower chat I don't know is it showing up any different yet okay here we go uh, we're putting it all in with ace jack suited I don't know what to do with Queen 7 off. I don't know. If, yeah. I'll just. 7 of 19, 4 till in the money. Um. Oh, there's another follower. Thank you. Oh, wait. Oh, that's. I'm oh, sorry. That was. That was Ali Quad. I was just. I'm in the stream manager now, so it's delayed a little bit. Uh. Let's see here. Did I. Miss what happened there. I guess I got that through. All right. Got kings here. Let's see. Do I have? Do I have you guys. You guys can see everything, right? Okay. Good. 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 I got kings on board. Uh, four. So, sound alert. Ah. Let's see. No, I actually completed it. It congratulated me uh, and said that it is setting it up in the background now. But uh, I, I don't know if it's been... Oh, okay. Wow, did this guy hit a sat? Uh, I'll just I'll just put it all... I'll just put it all in. See if we can isolate here. Just... Oh, oh. Come on! Oh my god! Ugh. I had him! I had him! He had two pair. Two pair on the turn. Okay, um... Let me take a look. Am I in there now? Okay, I'm, I'm in the... I'm in there. What? Oh, oh, really? Oh, cool! Wow! But not the sub button. Okay. Uh, I don't know if there's something I need to turn on back here. Uh, 
Yeah, I'm looking around back here. I don't see anything that I need to turn on. There's no... Oh, wait. Screen manager. Content. Clip preferences. Affiliate. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What is that noise? I never heard that before. What was that? Oh, wow. 100 bits. Wow, <laughs> thanks. That, wow. That's cool. I did, right on. Thank you. This is so freaking awesome. Okay. Um, I'm going to raise this up here. Uh, okay. Okay. Uh, I don't know if I have to do something on the sub button. Uh, there is, it says affiliate. Uh, affiliate onboarding payment. Okay, I got that. Set the num the minimum number of bits. Okay. Hype train. All kinds of different stuff in here now. Keep pre-roll ads to my channel. Disable pre-roll ads. I don't know what that means either. Um. Let's see here. Hype train leaderboards. Uh, oh, that's tough. Clean Jack, raise from there. see anything just the affiliate thing um that uh, yeah everything's complete i think whoop what? oh th let's see i can't see uh who ah uncle slacker thank oh wow oh wow cool first subscriber wow thank you uncle slacker right on wow i have a subscriber now okay Wow, that's cool. I, I'm gonna have to put that up top, uh, in up above, because I I didn't over here. I gotta put that in. I didn't expect to be uh, doing that anytime soon. I thought it was gonna be about uh, about a month away. Right on. Thank you. Wow, very cool. And now there's different alerts showing up, so I gotta customize those too. Uh, okay, I got a lot more work to do now. <laughs> it's cool. This is really cool. I actually feel like um really a part of Twitch now. It's it's it, there's all these different things. It's cool. Very cool. Thank you, everyone. Thank you so much. It means a lot to me. I've been working really hard at this. It's been a long two months. Appreciate it. Oh, wow. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Focus. Focus. 
All right, we got tens here. Um, let's see. I'll definitely raise it up. I have pretty big blinds, so let's see. I can I can raise it. I don't need to shove it. Unless someone comes over the top. Okay. Yeah. Um. Uh, I'm not sure. I'm not sure, Uncle Slacker, how it works. I guess everything just seems to be coming slowly online. I don't know. Won't let you give subs yet. Um, I don't know if there's a setting for that. Okay, so he's raising me. I'll call. not be a very good flop for ace queen or ace king uh ooh, that's not good and we're four till the money wait check check i might value bet in here yes yes Take it down Whew. well when he called I thought he was surely gonna have the uh, uh, big bigger pocket pair than mine or something bigger than tens so I won't let if I'm not sure if there's a setting or something I have to change Four to win the money here. Ah. Thank you, thank you, Uncle Slacker. Uh, I really appreciate it. Um, I I don't know I don't know what I ha would have to do to to do the settings. Uh, I don't know if there's a setting thing. I look. I don't see it, um, but I appreciate. It. Thanks, thanks for the subscription. Thanks for the bits, everybody. Thanks for all your help and everything. Appreciate it. Uh, maybe when you come back the next time, uh, there might be a way to uh, to do that. Ace King. Okay. All right. Ah, oh, we're hanging in there. Yeah. So we'll check back. Um. Hold that. And I will check it down. 
Fuck, of course. Too bad. Thanks, King. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah, that sounds about, that sounds right. The sinking of servers, because it seems like it's slowly popping in. It did allude to that when it said I made affiliate, that they were working behind the scenes, which that would make sense that they would verbalize it that way. It's really cool, though. It opens up, like, a whole new level of, of Twitch. It just, it just seems feels different. Now I have all this new programming to do uh, to set up the subscribers, followers. I just didn't think I'd be there uh, this fast. I mean, I was expecting maybe to set a goal for for uh, the end of the month, and I had no idea that I would make it uh, tonight <laughs> or this morning. Set that right on the poker table, that'd be pretty cool. <laughs> okay, uh, Ace Jack raised from early position. I, uh, I need to let that go. Ace Six is a fold. Two Five is a fold. Oh, oh, I'm sorry, guys. God, I, I, I'm sorry. Got too busy with the affiliate thing. Pocket fours. Uh, we'll raise up pocket fours. All right, four to win the money over there, and it's taking a while. I gotta text my wife and tell her I made affiliate. Uh, okay, I'll raise up ace three suited. Oh, wow, why didn't I shove that? I didn't realize I was that low in blinds right there. Six places still in the money. I, I just got uh, I got to roll with it now. Um, wow. Why didn't I just put it all in? It wasn't very smart. It wasn't paying attention to how many blinds I had. So we'll just stick it in and we'll roll with it and we'll see what happens. Clubs, clubs, clubs. All clubs. Ace, yes, 
Yes, hold, 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 hold. Yes, all right. Whew. Ah. At uh, six places on the money here, four places on the money. Ooh. This right here gives me a little breathing room to possibly make it. guy worries me limping here. Ooh, 20 big blinds, why wouldn't he put it... Why would he just limp right there? Hmm. Wow, that would have been a decent swap for me. Too bad. Huh. But this one's taking a while. Board uh, table one, four places still in the money. People are just holding on and holding on there. Okay, we got queens. Queens on board four. Thank you! Ghost, thank you! Thank you for uh, uh, for gifting a subscription. Oh, check. Uh, I'm going to call this. I'm going to be all in. Ace King, hold, hold. Come on, hold. Yes! Whoa! 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 whoa, whoa. whoa. All right. All right. Uh, I guess I gotta let go of this one. I'll limp behind with the deuces. Maybe we can see a flop and flop the set. Uh, not gonna happen. <laughs> uh, we'll fold here. Check. And we give up. Man, still four till in the money in this tournament. They're just hanging on. Okay, uh, emotes. Okay, uh, that's another thing I gotta work on. Alright, I'll have some design. Uh, I'll hire uh, my designer there. I'll get that going right away. <laughs> I'm gonna have some cool ones, man. I'm I I, I thought about I, I'm thinking uh, some poker stuff uh, would be cool. 
something poker related for sure. Oh, oh, uh, uh, I'm, yeah, I got pocket sevens on board one and, uh, wow, I have to make a decision quick. Uh, I'll have, I'll have, uh, I think I'm going to. I'm gonna fold, man. I'm gonna fold. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna fold. Um. Ah. Uh, not sure if I should have folded that. What are you gonna do? Uh. I'm free to win the money, and I really want to get in the money, and so it's ICM pressure, I guess, is what he used against me. Um. Now we have a stack. Uh, and let's see, we got a 16. This guy's a threat to, to shove. Um, wait, wait a minute. What is this? Okay, I'll open it. I'll open it. I'll open it. Yeah, because this guy looks like he just came in, so it's only. I only have to go through here. This, not this guy who had 16 lines, but here and here. Um,. See. Ooh, that's not a good flop. Okay, we're on the bubble, uh, money bubble over here on uh, board uh, on table two. Uh, and I'm going to let Ace Jack off go. Uh, a donk bet from the big blind. Okay. And we're three. Three till the money here. Oh, he had two pair. Nice hand. Nice hand, Albatross five. Okay, uh, but we are hand for hand play. One till in the money here. I don't know. This is a thousand dollar guarantee. I wonder what the minimum payout or the min cash is on that. Uh, min cash is five dollars and fifty cents. All right, every every little bit helps. So five fifty. Uh, is the min cash on on the thousand dollar guarantee? So we will just hang in and be patient and uh, see if we can uh, ladder up with the uh, with the uh, uh, pay jumps. So ten levels. Oops, need to do a battery change. Ten levels of uh, late registration on this last last one here. All right, um, Ace 10, huh? I'm not sure what to do with Ace 10. Uh, I have 90 big blinds. Okay, I'm gonna fold it. I don't know, might not be thinking clearly. Okay, we did the nine here. Um, Call. Got an ace. Got an ace. Uh, okay, he's just checking. So, I think I'll just check back and hopefully, <clears throat> hopefully we'll take this down. No, he's gonna put me all in. All right, fine. Take it. I should have never called. I should have never continued on that. Oh my god, what am I doing? It's yeah, that was you know, five point three big blinds. I should have called right there. I should have just I don't know had the nine, but hoping to get the showdown. Ooh. <clears throat> Oh, 
shoot, let me get the multi board up. One till in the money up here on this one board. If you can see that one till in the money. in the money here I'm gonna let that go Twenty-one fifteen. okay I can cash in this one this one that'll give me another yeah it's about 60 and I got 90 big blinds down here but there's still 10 levels of late registration this will be a late one still 91 players in boy hope the bubble burst soon here Looking for them coins to pop up on that table right there. That would be really cool. Cha-ching. Cha-ching. Come on, right there, right there. Ching. Let the bubble burst. Okay, it did not burst yet. Damn. Alright, well I still got four blinds. If I can if we can burst in the next couple of hands here. I should have never made that call there with the nine um hmm. we got two till in the money here. I can hold on with uh, 20 big blinds here. Definitely shouldn't have any trouble making it in the money here unless I do happen to run into Ace King into Queen's Jack or something like that. Excuse me. So I'm 53 out of 55, so there's two players with smaller amount of blinds than, than me. So th I'm hoping it goes soon. And we're down to one. We're on the bubble over here as well. Wow, close. Close to min caching.
one of them's got a burst. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Yes. That's it. Okay. I cash for $22.95. Okay, add that. Okay. $22.95. So we're up to sixty six fifty five. Okay. okay. All right, now this bubble over here has got a burst that'll bring me up a little bit more. This is the one we're waiting to for the bubble to burst right here. Right here. We need the bubble to burst to be in the money. I have three point about four big blinds left. To make it around orbit time. And hopefully it bursts soon. Would be nice. Oh, wait, there it is. Hi. Right on. Okay, in the money, in the money. Uh, and two ta two tournaments now. We have pocket sevens over here um, on board, board one. Um. No, we got. Mm, yeah, I think. Rip it. Put it in. Okay, we take that down. All right. Um, let's see. What am I in the money for over here? Okay. Uh. Five fifty. So I gotta add five fifty to my tally. Twelve of fifteen here. Okay, 
and aces versus nines. Set of aces. Okay. What is the next hand? Oh, break, break. Um, let me get to that first. Oh, it's a call. Why would this call? Oh, why did he call? Oh, queens down here. Okay, we take that down. Awesome. And we got queens on board four. Oh, that is a very interesting flop for queens. All right, we take that down and we are on break. Let me go over the staging room. I want to thank everybody. Thanks for uh, helping me make affiliate. It was, it's, it's beautiful, guys. Thank you so much. Um, and I appreciate everybody tuning in. And, uh, and, and I had no idea that I was, that it was going to happen tonight. And I appreciate everybody who subscribed and everything. I'm going to take a break. I'll be right back. Thank you so much. Uh, let's see. Let me get my.
All right, we're back. Uh, we're back. So 117 buy-ins, 72 caches so far. Uh, go over to the multi-board. Excuse me. Um, let's see what we can do. See if we can ladder up. Ah, uh, ah, uh, 2.3 big blinds, I gotta go through the small blind and then, I'm gonna be, I just, uh, I'm, I'm, uh, this, I think this needs to just go in, and I need to just let it, let it go and, uh, see what happens, um, I think that's uh, pretty much all I can do with this. It's a decent enough hand, I think, to, to roll with with this. Um, and I could try to ladder up, but ladder up would be like a buck, maybe. Um, so I think I think uh, just putting it all in right here uh, is the best play. So I'm just uh, I'm just gonna do it. See what happens. And we hope for some hearts here. Oh, all clubs. Huh, that's not good. All right, so six, and 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 they don't have any clubs to be good. But it looks like we're pretty much dead here. Uh, unfortunately. Uh, pocket four, set of fours. Oh wow! <laughs> oh wow, we hit we hit the straight. <laughs> yes. Okay. All right. That gives me some breathing room here. We are uh, 5 of 14 on table 1. This is uh, pretty interesting. 600 guarantee. We could make the final table here. Now that would be killer. Because then I can unleash my flames around the final table. I have a button right here, ready to go. Ready to go. Yeah, so that's going to be my goal. I'm going to make the final table. I'm making the final table on this one. I'm just going to fold, 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 fold. I don't care what it takes. I'm making the final table. I am I am waiting, waiting, waiting. <clears throat> of course, unless I get a hand and I lose. But for the most part, I'm going to be folding pretty much everything here. Um and trying to make this final table. And we have Ace King uh, down below. We got uh, King Jack. So let's see. Uh, we will be raising this up for sure. Now we'll go four big blinds here. Um. Wow, I think. Uh, I think a shove here. I think a shove is good here. Uh, we will raise this up. Oh, he hits it. Uh, I hit the jack. Yes. Oh, oh, damn. All right, but I still am all right. They hit another nine on the river. Uh, all right, so we're going to be all in with, uh, wow. All right, uh. Oh, this is an interesting spot on board four. Um, definitely interesting. Um, uh, do we shove? Try to get him off. I think that's what we're gonna do here. We're gonna we're gonna put this all in. I don't know if this is the best play. But maybe we can get him off the hand and we'll only be dealing with this guy. We can isolate. Um, he's, he didn't insta call me. That's good. Okay, seven nine. Oh, hold. Yes. Okay, it worked. All right. Whew. Okay. Back to the multi board. 
right, pocket fives. Um, pocket fives, uh, that, uh, looks to me like, uh, we're headed all in unless... 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 Well, I, I, I just think that's the play here. I think... King nine, king nine, um, I'm gonna fold it. Oh, we, okay, we laddered up here. Okay, okay, um... Ah, <clears throat> five big blinds here. Five big blinds here. Yikes. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna fold this. Uh, I, I know this doesn't, I, I think, uh, well, uh, no, I'm gonna, I'm gonna put it all in. We're gonna go all in. We, it, it, uh, <clears throat> I think we have to take the risk in this spot here. <clears throat> um, we've got nines, uh, Nines down below, then all in here. <clears throat> We're calling that. I think we have to take the risk with the fives. We have to put the pressure on them. Okay, we get it through. Excellent. Excellent. All right. Okay, so we did ladder up another dollar. So make a change there 73 uh in the nines we'll uh oh shoot maybe i should have no nah. we should have checked that but uh dude, are we holding oh shit what did he get two pair Huh. You hit the pair on the river there. That was a bummer. But we're still good. We got 99 big blinds. We're in sixth place out of 91 in that one. Seven levels of late registration remaining. <clears throat> All right, we've got Ace Queen over here on board one. Zoom in on that. We'll raise that up. Maybe should have gone 2.5 or 3 there from early position. Um, he might could face a shove from the big blind if he has anything. Oh, we get a raise from, from the small blind. Okay, we'll, we'll look at a flop. We do hit top pair. Uh, I guess this is a check call mode. If he puts it in, we'll have to call. Uh, looks like we're calling. Kings. Uh, okay. Well, my plan there didn't go as well as I thought it would. I should have known that there was something big there. Huh. All right. All right. Well, that's a learning experience now. Um, it's going to be difficult to make the final table now with four big blinds. That was, that hurt. I hurt. I hurt a lot. Um, that's unfortunate. Uh, that was a mistake on my part, I think. The top pair, top kicker. Um, would have been nice to have him wake up with King Queen. So yeah, um, if I was going to play that conservatively, I should have probably folded uh, when he raised. Mm. Okay. Ah, uh, yeah. All right, this is going to be tough, uh, but we'll see what happens. Yeah, I probably should have reconsidered that. <clears throat> All right, looks like he is going to be out. There's a ladder up. Okay, yeah, I think I definitely think that uh, that ace queen was a big mistake. I know too bad that I hit top pair on that. Uh, 
All right. Well, we did ladder up again, which is good. Uh, I'm not sure what 25, 50. Um, might have to put it all in here with the A6. It's 14 and 10. Um, I think we're going to put the A6 all in. Three big, big lines. Question is, will we get called or will it go through? Uh, and Ace 10 is going to go. Oh, okay. Let me go back to the multi table here. We're going to put this all in as well. We do hit an Ace. No, 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 Dime. Oh. Okay. 25.50, 12th place. We didn't make the final table on that. Um, over here. Yeah, that was probably the one that we had. Uh, we were closest to making the final table, and um, I kind of screwed that up. Like, that ace queen. All right, we're going to let that go. Close that table. Um, let me see if I can bring up the two table. Yeah, I think I can bring up the two table now. I have a two table board scene. Let's, I might have to change something here. Um, I'm going to fold here. And fold here, and I'm see if I can get the two board scene up. I'm not sure. Okay, I gotta change my settings here. Stop and let's see here. Uh, columns are two rows are one. And start and snap the grid. Okay. And I think I can go to two board scene now. Okay, so now we've got the two board scene. Okay, because these will be the last two. I'm not going to enter any more after this. Yeah, it's unfortunate with that ace queen to hit the top pair there. That uh, uh, that yeah, if I was stuck to my plan when he raised me, gosh, I should have known that he had something. He had something there. Um, you know, my intuition was telling me that he had something, but um. That was, that was my best chance of a final table for this section. Kind of neat, you know, because as I'm playing more of these tournaments now, um, since I've been uh, streaming on Twitch, <clears throat> just, I'm starting to develop that. I think it's almost like a third sense, or not, not, not an intuitive sense. Like it's like what I'm doing now is I I can I can tell that I'm beat, and it's like, but I'm still making the call. But it's like um, I'm getting that feeling now. So now I just need to learn. To trust that feeling um and you know, as as the more spots that i get into when um in that like that one that will be like you know it'll make an impression on me and when the next time i'm in a spot like that it'll be easier to fold and i think that's part of the whole process of developing that intuitive sense when you know like you know i've like i've watched trips stream you know and, and he'll be like that's aces or kings right there and he just knows because he's been in that position multiple times he's seen that multiple times and he, and so he knows when to make those correct folds which is, is uh 
it's amazing to see how you could develop that uh, over what I think he's been streaming up here for five, six years. Um, to develop that 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 sort of uh, intuitive sense is to know when you're actually beat, even if you have top paired top picker. Um, and we got pocket nines here. We'll open that up, open raise. And so I think that's just part of uh, part of the whole experience of learning to be a good online tournament poker player. Oh, this one, is that, yeah, maybe I should have just folded or put it all in. I think, I think the thing to do in here with this might have been to fold or to shove instead of just open raising the two big lines. Um, okay, so we had two callers here with my nines. Um, so I'm going to dab at this. I have to. I think it makes sense. And if I get called, then I'm going to have to slow down. Okay, we get it. We get it through. We are in eighth place out of 102 on the 2500 guarantee, um, and we're in 37th out of 39 over here. And it's interesting because this is the one I thought I would have been out of, been out quicker than the other one, and the other one we ended up getting out. We were closer to the final table. Another one. I just think I, yeah. Anyway, I gotta gotta let it go. Move on. Stop thinking about it. Talk it up to learning and go on to the next. Might be able to see a flop with the, the limp here, some purple bite. all in. I guess I'm not going to see a flop.
Ready to fold. <coughs> oh, there's a ladder up. Okay. Woo! Right on. And here. Hmm. I think that's good. Ah. Oh, I got lucky on that one. Pocket jacks. That was a good run out for me. Uh, okay. Here we go. Jax versus Jack. Okay. Split. Laddered up another two fifty. Change that. When we pick up pocket rockets over here. That's a pocket rocket. Cool, huh? Yeah. Alright, let's just shove it all in. Another set of jacks tonight, that would have been crazy. 
I was in three sets of Jack that I went into it, and I didn't. I got, and now we got Queens. Yes. Oh, I've had this happen before, though. Aces, and then you get another good hand, and you get it out. <laughs> you know, it's like, I don't know, probably some of you have had that happen before. It's like, double up, great hand, you get another good hand, and you're all in again, and you lose, and you're out. And it's like, oh my god, oh, oh my god. I'm gonna... Wow, but that's a that's that's dynamic and wet. Uh, Jack ten gets there. Um, there. There's a flush draw. There's a straight draw. Uh, so okay, we take it down. Ooh. Ooh. All right, twenty six big blinds now here. This is shaping up to maybe uh, look like we might have a shot here if we can hang in there. I pick up a few more blinds, maybe another double up, um, or just you know keep chipping up. Then it's a possibility that there could be a contender for the final table uh, as well, and I'll try to navigate getting there a little bit better if I can. So I I really would like to make a final table. Um, yeah, I should have. Yeah, not going back. Not going back here. Not gonna. Not gonna talk about that one. That's. That's water under the bridge. Focus on this here. Yes, focus. That same hand, same hand, Oops. same hand. And same fold. Not in the same position though. Yeah, we were down to like, well, like three or four big blinds in this one, and now we're up to 17th place out of 32. It just goes to show you that you can you can just sit back and wait and be patient. And sometimes you're gonna creep down to like where you almost have nothing, but you it is possible to come back. I think in the past when I was playing in tournaments, I was you know I was there was a point I was I was following Jonathan Little's push shove charts and he recommended like when you get below 20 big blinds but I, I think he's amended that now um, instead of 20 big blinds he's lowered it to 10 um, which I think seems to make more sense because 10 big blinds if you watch um, if you watch a Phil Hellmuth play 10 big blinds the guy can make 10 big blinds last a long time uh, and sometimes he'll make a comeback uh, and he'll he just he's patient and waits and knows what spots to get it in and when to do it. In particular, when he'll limp from the button and then get shoved, shoved and you know, and he's limping with pens or something like that from the button, and then somebody raises him or um, you know, shoves on him and he's getting it all in. And uh, a lot of times, that's how he he will double up. He's very sneaky in that way.
pocket free. Wow, he rivered the ten. Uh, I had a feeling I had him. I didn't think he had it. And, uh, he rivered the ten. We get a walk.
Let's see here. I'm all in. Um. Hold this. Ends with eight king. Another all in. We're on a different table now. We have a short stack here to the left. A medium stack here, here and here, and big stack. Old, full, sold. Four, five, six, seven, eight. That'd be great. Oh, there's another level up. Okay. Awesome. Um, 28. That took me up to... Hmm. Eight fifty, another dollar. No, fifty five point seventy six fifty five. Alright, Ace Jack. Ah, what's this again? Same as both tables. That's happened twice in the last 10 hands. And we do have it all in. Oh man. Wow. This is one of them spots. Pose. Pose. Hold. Let's see what he has, but I don't think we can call a base jack there. I don't think it's wise. I mean, we can call, but.
Hello? Who is it? Oh, how you doing? I thought it was Daisy and Jacob. Screaming. Say hello. Oh wait, hold on. You can see yourself. You're, you're the. You're gonna show up as a head. Hold on. Hey, I made affiliate today. Just now. This is my daughter Angela. Hello. She's the head in the wall. <laughs> yeah. All right. <laughs> Okay. Um, King Queen suited. Going all in. Jack nine is being folded. Let's see how we do with King Queen suited. Do we get any calls? Do we get it through? Hmm. I don't know if I should be opening ace six. Ace six suited. Oh, what happened? What happened there? I put it all in. Oh, did I not hit the button? What the hell? Uh, uh I'm not sure what happened there. Check it back. Ah. Oh. I should get it all in, okay. <laughs> Just viewing that hand. I'm not sure. I guess there was a glitch in the system. Hmm. All right. 
Okay, I think we're just gonna put this, uh, these pocket fours all in. We get called. Hold, yes! Pocket fours held! Wow. How many? Oh, I have uh, two kids, uh, Angela and Luke, uh, boy and girl. Angela is uh, 16 and Luke is 13. And then my my uh, wife has uh, two boys. Um, they're in their uh, they're in their late mid late twenties. Um, six minutes. Okay, the clean ten student gets through. What's for me? Six is verse ace jack and seventy nine. What did I miss on that one? I'm not so quick. All right, pocket sevens. Sevens have not been good to me, or they were once. Maybe I don't know. It's all the same here. Okay. All right. Okay. Um, raise it up. Open, open, raise it. Open it up. Yeah. Terminology. Uh, hold there. Um, yeah, the donk. Okay, let's try it with the eight. That one. Uh, 
Um. Yeah. Wow. Oh. Calling. Yep, it's all, I think, and hopefully not. I don't know. I don't, want to, I don't know. Maybe I should have shoved it? I'm not sure. Shove the eight? Maybe that was the uh, thing to do there? I'm not sure. And yeah, that's a good plot for us. Yeah, one check, but. Hmm. I think that's good for us to get away. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Huh. Speculative hand, so we do have 66 big blinds. Okay, that's not great at that shot. Yeah, I'm done with it. Oh, we have the ladder up over here in the thousand guarantee. Maybe another dollar. Fold. Oh. All right, so it looks like we're going to be on break. Um, I'm in seven, 16th place out of 18 on this one, and the break is guarded. Okay, back to the stage. So, let's see. I think I... Uh, another dollar. Uh, 10.50. No, that jump. I'm not sure how much that jump by, but... So you can see, yeah, we were at a uh, dollar, went up a dollar, but well, I think it jumped uh, quite a bit there. I'll just tack on another couple bucks there. That should be a good estimate. Um, let's see here. So like 78.55. So we'll change that. 78.55. So that's what we're looking at right now. Is uh, 78.55. 55 approximately uh, Not too bad. Not too bad. I, I made some mistakes here um, Throughout the night and um, it, uh, I think if I would have there were a couple spots that I shouldn't have called a couple spots where uh, I should have called maybe um, But for the most part, um, you know, it's not too bad. It's not too bad, especially when you, you know um, Are playing a lot there's, there's a lot going on and the fact that I made affiliate, so um, I think that uh, overall this is uh, this is a win-win right here, um, and I still have a chance to cash uh, ladder up in the, in the other two tournaments that I'm in. I'm gonna take a break right now, guys. Uh, we'll see you in a little bit, and uh, Shazam.
right. Eight seconds. Eight seconds. Let's get back at it. Wow, we're uh Oh shoot, no, I need to be the, I need to be at the two two uh board scene. Okay. Um Yeah, so uh you can uh you can punch me now. Just like this. Oh jeez. All you gotta do is put explanation point punch in the chat. So if you see a spot where maybe I should have done something different. And I'll be adding new features to the chat so that uh, you guys will be able to interact more and uh, have some fun changing my scenes. One of the things we'll have is the lights on, which is going to go to, let me see, uh, I can't go anywhere with the two board scene, I'm stuck, but it's not as effective here, but the lights on kind of brightens up the board and uh, actually it's kind of neat when that happens. Um, but I'll be putting that in the chat as well, <clears throat> and a, a number of other things. Uh, so I don't, I never, I don't know if I ever. I'm pretty tired right now, guys. So if I if I mumble or stumble or whatever, I've been awake all night. Uh, let's see, when did I wake up? Oh man, yeah, I think, I think uh, I've been awake 24 hours. Uh, oh. Um, yeah, so I never f finished the story because I, I, I started out on OBS. I don't know if anybody remembers what I was saying, but I, I started out on OBS. Then I, I switched to Stream, uh, o Streamlabs OBS. And then I was in the Imagine Cast. If you know Imagine Cast, he's a Poker Stars pro, uh, that streams. He has one of the most creative, uh, poker streams there is. Uh, if you haven't seen his, uh, uh, seen his uh, show or his uh, stream check him out M-A-J-I-N uh, one of the most creative uh, poker streamers on Twitch um, and does all kinds of cool things and I was chatting with him in the chat and talking about OBS and Streamlabs and he said that uh, if you're going to do this long term you're definitely going to want to be on um, OBS because it's, uh, you know, it just allows you to be more creative and flexible. And so that day I made the decision to uh, switch back from Streamlabs. Streamlabs is easy to set up. Uh, they may, they simplify OBS. OBS can tend to be a little bit more complicated because there's a lot more things you can add to it. A lot more. It's just they, they simplified OBS and made it easier for beginner streamers to get up and running. Uh, so if you're looking to stream simple and easy Streamlabs, but Streamlabs as you go forward becomes a little bit limiting because for one thing, um, they don't have a lot of the open source plugins that OBS has. And there's another streamer, not a poker streamer, but the Sushi Dragon. Um, who uses OBS and he does like some amazing effects that are just, just blow your mind. Um, and so, <laughs> oh. <laughs> and so, um, <laughs> uh, he, uh, he does some amazing effects on his stream. So he, he suggested that if I'm going to do this long term, that I should switch back to OBS. So I, I made the process of switching back to OBS, which wasn't easy because I had transitioned over to Streamlabs and moved everything back and imported everything. I had to figure out how to import Streamlabs to OBS. And anyway, I made the switch back and I'm glad I did because OBS has all these open source plugins that people in the community develop and they just put it out there. So you just like peruse through the plugins and go, oh, that's cool. I could use that to do something and one of them in there was uh, a plug-in uh, or an app that plugs into OBS which allows you to, which allows us you just set it up so that people oh okay kings we got kings I, I think I can go back to the 
No, I can't even go. I, I'm stuck. Uh, once I'm on the two board setup, I can't leave it. I can't go to the one board, nothing. Um, so this plugin application allows to give the, the users in the chat control of scenes and anything you want inside of your stream. So uh, eventually, uh, you know, I'm going to set it up so like a uh, certain number of like, I guess, you know, they, you, know, you know, those points you get in the stream for like listening and things like that, you're in points. So I'm going to be setting up so if a certain different tiered one, so you'll be able to, using those points, you'll be able to like purchase a punch or whatever, listener points or whatever it is. I haven't completely set it up yet. And things with, wow, this is, uh, I'm going to have to, that was, um, we're gonna go a little heavier um but if a jack is out there i'm in trouble um so so uh <clears throat> pretty dry though if they don't have the jack then okay good we take it down but uh anyway so uh i'll be able to add more uh stuff it's so it's gonna allow me to grow and be more creative um because of the plugins the open source community that's there which open source is how i've made a lot of my living um the chess website that i started was started from an open source program that so there was an open source chess program and then a professor in brazil took it and modified it and created another uh, version released that as uh open source and i found that downloaded it and started my chess website with that and then of course made modifications and and uh, we shared as a community for quite some time. Um, and uh, yeah, it worked out really well. It was originally, a, uh, we called it, called it Comp Webcast, I think. He had added like leaderboards and rankings and stuff like that, which made the original open source uh, release. Uh, it added some different features to it, which was cool. But uh, yeah, so anyway. If you're thinking of streaming, um, you definitely are, I would say, get on open source uh, OBS. And I mean, if you just want to stream and be up quick, Streamlabs, and you're not intending on becoming really super crazy, like a lot of different features and stuff, and you just want to be up streaming, you get some free, uh, free overlays from Streamlabs, and you can be up and running and go for it. Um, but if you want to get creative and start adding new features and things like that to uh, your stream, you're going to probably want to stick with OBS um, because it's a lot more flexible for creativity. Anyway, uh, if you haven't checked out, check out Magincast. Uh, excellent, excellent stream he has. Uh, I like, I love watching him play and he has all kinds of cool sound effects, uh, some visual effects as well. And, uh, yeah, so I'm rambling. But yeah, I'm 16 of 18 out of 18. So, I mean, we are getting closer here um, to a possible a final table uh, on on this uh, 1,000 guarantee. It would be very cool. Um, that would be the first final table of the night. So the last session I streamed, I made a final table as well. Uh, and so this would be this would be pretty cool if I could hit a final table um, tonight. And I almost did it. And I'm not going to go back to that one. I probably shouldn't have called there with the ace queen, but um, but now I have another chance. Another chance. I have nine big blinds. Uh, it's going to be tight. It's going to be hard. Not sure I'll make it, but it's possible. It is possible. Okay. Boy, I'm having a hard time keeping my eyes open. Okay. 
Okay, they're in last place over there. So we're gonna need something to happen soon over here, otherwise, otherwise we're just gonna have to be thankful that we cash and move on. making any more forward progress we seem to be losing ground over here on this table it's unfortunate this is a bigger payout with 27 places going in the money here and we're in the money here but uh seven or eight more to get out before uh there's a final table it's going to be a long haul there's only six big blinds left. I'm going to have to double up here. Really quick, I think, here. Something's going to happen. Otherwise, it's going to be tough. Okay. King eight suited with folds to us, I think, is a definite shove candidate. Hmm. Come on, folks. Alright, so we're putting this all in. One fold. And a call. King Jack. Uh, oh, wow. <laughs> yes. There it is. Double up. That's what we needed. To keep us going. That will keep us going. Very good. Very good. That's one double up. Booyah. Booyah! A little delayed, but there it is. Um, King Jack off. A middle position. Hold.
So we move her to 11th place uh, with that double up. And should be close to another ladder up. Let's see what, see what that is. 17. Yeah, we gotta get to 15. And then we jump to 13. Uh, payout is $13. Hmm. And over here. Min cash is eleven twenty five. So we're twenty three places still in the money there. But yeah, we got a chance here. We got a chance. Well, we might just break even tonight. Possible look at that. Maybe. If we could reach this final table, that would be, that'd be phenomenal. We need to get the Boski's uh, airplane neck pillow here. I'm trying to stay awake, guys. Doing whatever I can. You guys probably didn't hear that, but I hear that America's card room loud beep and somebody's running out of time. Okay. There's a lot of folding. Okay. Big Jack. Oh, man. Uh. Put it all in. Man. Alright, we're going all in. See if we get it through. Use that extra blind. Oh, okay, we got a call. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Oh, Ace King. We ran into Ace King. Come on, Jack. Oh, hey. That's. Oh, we got. We still have a blind. Oh. That's tough. Well. Alright. Well. We're either going to put it in or we're going to be forced to be put in. It. Oh, okay. There's a ladder up. That goes to 13, I think, now. We did ladder up. Um, this is going to go in too. I don't know. The ace jack. Like hesitant. Gosh. Maybe ace jack is just not looking for a shove. I don't know. Ace queen. I'm... We've gotten out with like ace queen and ace jack in, in the tournament. So maybe I'm um, playing too loose. I don't know. Got to figure it out. Over time, I guess I will. Okay, we get called, of course. And let's hope for some spades. Oh. Okay. That's it for us on that tournament. Now, um, so we cash for 13. So I get to add a little bit more to it. We'll close that one. Let me update. I think that was a, like a, a jump on that. Um, 
two more dollars, wasn't it? So nine fifty-five, uh, eighty fifty-five, something like that. Close enough. All right. Um, king queen. Uh, raise that up. Take that down. All right, let me see if I can get us on the full setup. There we go. Um, I wonder if I can get us back to. Yeah, I think I can. Hold on. Get back to the 3D side here. Go. All right, and we will go to two. Okay, this is the last tournament. I'm not going to join anymore. Ooh. Seventeen places until the money. All there. Son of a biscuit eater. What's taking so long? We're twelfth place out of seventy-nine players left. No good.
knew I'd be close to getting my 3D character possible in the next few minutes, uh, providing uh, I don't get out of this tournament here anytime soon. You guys might get the first glimpse, first look at Mini Me. It's a three dimensional character designed for my stream. It'll only have one animation at this time, but over time, I can add more. Um, but it'll be an interaction between me and Mini Me, or my Mini Coat, as I'm going to call him Mini Me, but uh, he's going to act more like a angry coach that comes out and walks across from over there or not behind but over there he's gonna come from that direction and walk towards me and say like you know stuff like why did you make that call that was dumb or whatever it is you shouldn't have made that call and uh, that's the first interaction <coughs> later on uh if that works, I'm going to add more. So it's going to be cool. Just stay tuned. This, we might have this, I might have that file to be able to test it out. Uh, the story behind the username, um, where, so Ghost asked, uh, what is the story behind the username? Um, how did I come up with that? I was just, uh, trying to figure out a creative name to call myself. Um, I, I'm trying to think, um, I just, kind of sat down at the computer and uh, just remember thinking, you know, firing popped into my head, a firing poker pro. I just kind of looked it up on the internet and it was kind of like the meaning was want to be, want to be something. And, you know, you're, you're trying to be something. And so I thought, oh, wow, that's that makes sense, you know. Um, it's not saying I'm a pro, it's saying I'm aspiring. You know, like I'm trying to become a pro. Or would like to become a pro. Um, and so I, I thought it fit, and then I I actually, I bought the domain name too. I have a website, uh, but, but I haven't been working on that. Um, yeah, I gotta fold this. 
So I uh, aspiringpokerpro.com and that was available and yeah, I don't know. Uh, I don't really know how it I can't it just kind of like happened. Um, hard to explain. Kind of sat down and was thinking about what I could do to. Uh, I don't remember if I created the Twitch. I can't. I think I had. I had Twitch. Yeah, I had Twitch. I think what maybe what might have happened is I was thinking about doing Twitch, about streaming on Twitch, and I was thinking what would be cool because I had a Twitch account um, for. May it would have been last May I started a Twitch account May of last year, and I I did one little test stream just to see what it was like and it worked. And I was like, oh wow, that's cool. So, uh, and then I never thought about it again until this year. And then I think I just decided to follow my passion again and try to see what I could what I could do. That's a long story. I don't know. I don't know it's hard to say. Um, can't really remember. I just remember looking up the word. I remember firing happening and popping in my head and then looking it up and going, wow, that kind of fits. That's pretty cool. Uh, let's see here. We'll call with the Jack. Um, and he said, because if you were going to fold after folding over, over flatting, we're going to upset and all the guy had kings, but still. How'd you know he had kings? I, I don't know, I guess that just comes with time, huh? A activate the sound alert? Oh, yeah. Oh, uh, yeah, that's, uh... Oh. Okay. Yeah, uh, I will be activating... You mean to do, to control the, the sound, uh, bite there, the little things that I'm doing. What? Yeah, I can get the sound. The sound, that's going to be easy to do. Um, yeah, that's something I'll be working on over next week. Over this week. Uh, place is still in the money, 11. Wow, I'm, I've been dropping. Dropping fast here. Okay, we get another piece of hand to open up with. But uh, yeah, I can activate the sound easily. That's, that won't be a problem. Oh, it's shoved on. Hmm, I really want to get it in with five. I think we'll wait for a better spot. I think. I think um, There's only eight places still in the money is eight, so I think folding here is going to be the right thing to do as much as possible in that last hand. I think it's the right thing to do as well. Oh, NEK Vapor. That was actually a mistake. I would, I tried to change that. I mean, NEK Vapor, that's my business. I have two. Va I have three vapor stores, two in Vermont, one in New Hampshire. And uh, I wanted to change that, but they won't let me change it. So I'd have to, and I'd already verified my account and everything. So I'd have to go back in and create another account and then mess with that. So I've been thinking about changing it. Um, I've been thinking about just creating another account and then I can just still load money up to the NEK Vapor and then send it over to Inspiring, uh, whatever I pick, Inspiring Poker Pro or whatever. It's something a little bit more. Oh, thanks. Thanks. Oh, you just subscribed. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate it. Um, and, 
And so, uh, yeah, I want to change it to, um, to, um, something different, but I just, they told me I couldn't, so I have to do a roundabout way. Either I have to do another account and then verify everything, or I think I can just create another account and then transfer money over from my existing account. Yeah, I mean, I called him on the phone. I was like, but this is a, my business name. I didn't know it was going to be my actual screen name. Oh, here it is again with this Ace Jack, man. I just... Jack. Oh, I'm under 20 big blinds now. Huh. I mean, shoving 60 big blinds in the middle. Does that make sense? I don't know. I don't know if it makes sense or not. You know? I mean, what if I had kings or aces or something? I've been putting this whole tournament life at stake. Jack. Oh, I think I might have just got that file, 3 to five, 3D file. Okay, not yet. Soon. Hopefully before the stream ends. I feel like in these spots here, it seems tempting to peek at a pop, but it's one big line that you have to call. And 5 6 off is just not that great. I'll let it go. on other skins, but I don't think you can send money to uh, different in between the two. You can't send money in between the skins, right? I mean, at least that's what I heard. So I'd have to re-verify another account. And it's not, my name is actually not Neck. That name is, a lot of people think that are not from here, it's Neck Vapor. But that's not what it stands for. In, we live in the Northeast Kingdom, so it stands for the Northeast Kingdom Vapor. Um, and, it, you know, everybody just refers to this area as NEK. So that's kind of a, uh, a thing up here. But everybody sees it and they're like, Neck Vapor. <laughs> Especially if they're not from here. So it's not Neck Vapor, it's NEK Vapor. <laughs> NEK Vapor, just Northeast Kingdom Vapor, is what it 
Let's do four. Seventeen big blinds, forty two out of seventy one, still eight pieces going the money. Min cash is eleven twenty five. That's picking up to ninety. Not overall, it's not too bad. I mean, I, I didn't plan on streaming tonight. I just kind of jumped into it and then ended up streaming all night long. Good thing I did. Okay, so we got to raise. Uh, Calling the bet. Yeah, and then you know it's that screwed. Ah. Yeah, he gone. Let it go. Six places going the money now. Huh. Another king. Makes it most likely he doesn't have a king. Eight. Okay. Jack. Huh. Five to win the money. Uh, this song goes hand in hand with like, you know, the aspiring poker pro. It should be the, should be the theme. Don't get chased in the dream. Is that what we're all doing? Four places still in the money.
This place is still in the money. I almost want to shove this, but the two, two places still in the money. I'm gonna, I'm gonna let it go. I think if I had already passed the, the money bubble, uh, I probably would have shoved it. But I think at this point, with two players left in the money, that um, I think. The more that I can do these min caches, I think the better off I can um, help affect my bankroll. I don't know if you got any advice about that, but um, I, in the past, I wouldn't have cared. But for now, with everything going on in a stream, and you know, like, I think it's really important to get those. If you're you know, close and you're kind of on the edge, you don't have many lines. Now just sneak it into the min cash and help um, keep the bank all stabilized. Keep doing the money. Okay, we're in hand for hand play. One, one to the money. We're on the bunny stone cold bubble of the money. The money stone cold bubble or whatever it's called. Ah. Okay. Hand for hand play, guys. We're waiting. Usually it stays up there and says hand for hand play. Hmm. We are waiting. We are on the money bubble of this tournament. I hope it didn't, it didn't hiccup here. Oh, there it is. The min cash is uh, against 1125. It doesn't really start to jump up, and it jumps up by once you get to like 27, you jump up by three dollars. Then it jumps to five, five dollar increments around 18, and then um, uh, yeah, again five dollar increments, and then it goes, then it starts going up to 12. And then you start getting asked. So on top is uh, 481. So, ah, uh, long, long ways away. There were 439 players in this room. Right now, I am 50th of four. Four left. 
That's not bad. Um, I'm actually running deeper in tournaments now than I used to. I don't know. I think he was playing a little bit more conservative and holding, holding it. Trying to make better folds. Like the ace queen on that one. That was pretty close to the final table. Hmm, Jack Nine. Okay. Come on. Somebody should be getting out soon. Let me check to see what short stack looks like. Ah, what do we got here? yet. Hand for hand play. Hmm. We were on the stone cold bubble of the money here. Oh, break. All right, we'll be back. Uh, stay tuned because we were on the stone cold bubble and now we are on break. So we'll be back. Uh, you can see the caches above here. Um, 80, 55, and if we make this next, uh, if we make, make it into money on this one, we'll be, uh, you know, close to around 90, I think. Um, so, 90, 90, 95. We can level up or tear up on that. So, this is what we got left, the 2,500 guarantee. So, please stay tuned and uh, stay with me. Uh, I'll try to stay awake <laughs> for this tournament. And uh, thanks for for tuning in.
Here we got about a minute and 30 seconds. If uh, any of you look back, uh, ah, hey, Corform, how are you? Yeah, I almost made a, a, a couple of final tables and, uh, I got, I busted close to him each on, um, but I did cash. Uh, I've been cashing, so it's pretty cool. Um, so, yeah. And I made affiliate, too, Chloroform, today. I got raided by Alex, uh, Alex Optimal. And uh, they pushed me over the edge to affiliate, which is really cool. Everyone was so nice, and uh, it was great. He brought in 80, uh, 80 viewers. Um so yeah, this is the last one I'm in. I'm uh, I've been awake for 24 hours. I'm about ready to fall asleep. <laughs> hmm. Uh, but I'm trying to cash. I'm on the Stone Cold Bubble for the money, uh, and I'm just trying to. I've only got like uh, 10 big blinds or nine big blinds, so I'm trying to cash one more to bring to make it, you know, make it up to about 90, 90, 92 dollars, uh, which. Uh, make me feel better about the session. I could have played better. There was a couple of balls there. I mean, I hit ace queen and I hit a top pair, top kicker, and it ran into king. Um, so, and that I was like, you know, it was like you know, I think two away from the two away from the final table on that one. I would have liked to make a final table, but yeah, I think I played in I don't know how many tournaments tonight. I figured since uh, I had 80 viewers, I was like, I'm just going to keep joining tournaments, guys, as long as you're watching. <laughs> so now you can subscribe and do bits and all that kind of stuff. Oh, um, oh, let me, uh, yeah, hold on. Let me get to the game here. Uh, cause it started. Um, so uh, if you want to try something, Chloroform, do an exclamation point punch in the chat. Oh. Right on, thank you. Thank you for the subscription, Chloroform. Appreciate it. Uh, if you do, uh, so we're like on the Stone Cold Money. If you do uh, explanation point punch in the chat, um, you can uh, uh, you can punch me in the face. I don't know if you saw that the last time I was here, but you can actually do it now from the chat. Uh, and I'm going to be adding some more features like that uh, soon. Uh, a lot more different ones. I also added this. Um, I don't know if it's that great of an effect. I might need to improve it, but I can turn the lights on above the table, or the effect is to look like the lights are being turned on above the table, and it kind of dims out the back, and then turn the lights off. And so it's to signify, like, you know, maybe like the lights are on for cleaning type of thing. Um, and so, yeah, it's cool. Uh, founder badge. See, I don't even know what that stuff is yet. <laughs> What's the founder badge? <laughs> I 
Um, so, um, yeah, so, so if you hit explanation point, fun, uh, give it a try. What's the founder badge? How do I see what the founder badge looks like? <laughs> oh, right there. Okay, I see. It's on next to your name. Founder, one month subscriber. Right on. Cool. Very cool. Cool, cool. That's awesome. It's, uh, I feel like I've actually just gone to the next level now in Twitch. It's like it's it's like another dimension almost. All right, I'm gonna be doing a lot of folding here, trying to preserve and make the money, and then I'll open it up. Open there. Um, But I was I was running pretty bad tonight. It's like I ran into I think two sets of jacks with my kings. Uh, I ran into another set with my queens, and it just was like wow. It was just like I was getting killed out there. It was rough. Stone cold bubble for the money. Oh, oh. <laughs> cool, huh? Worked well. Ah, uh, there we go. We 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 made it into the money. All right, uh, not sure how much he has. I think a min cash. Let me find out. Whew. Uh, min cash 11.25, so I can add 11.25 up there. Oh. We're up to 91.80 now. Um, okay. There we go, 91.80. So it's turning to be, I thought it was going to be a pretty bad session. And uh, it's a turn, um, at least. Uh, not not down as much as I was before. Yeah, it was it was pretty fun uh, when, especially when those 80, 80 uh, people dropped in or were raided uh, and just dropped into the whole stream. It was just everything went crazy. I was just like, "Whoa, what's going on?" <laughs> you know, it's just like follows are going off and and it just just went a little bit nuts. First 10 subs for affiliate and first 25 when you hit founder. I'm not sure what that means. All right, we got Queen Jack suited. Uh, we're going to be getting it all in. Uh, we're going to put that all in. Um, see if we can get this through. There's a short stack up there. Our embargo. I just Get it through. Want to be somebody Come on, hold, hold, hold. Yes, no we got it through. Okay, me. that gives us some breathing room. Oh, so the first ten people who subscribe get founders. Oh, 
yeah, because uh, yeah, ghost, ghost got one. Yeah, he's got a found. Yeah, you're right. Okay, I see how that works. Yeah. Okay. Right on. Um, still learning all this stuff. There's a whole new level to learn now behind in the back end. Um. It's definitely been a grind, a grind of poker wise. Everything else is cool, but poker, the poker tonight has been rough, it's been rough, it's been not running too well. Um, but I, but I, it's, it, sorry, I started getting better uh, the last few tournaments, but man, the beginning was tough. Yeah, I know what you mean. Um, first 25 when you hit pounder. Yeah, gotcha. Nine. Let's see if we can level up again. Nine. Next K jump is uh, when we get down to fifty four.
to fold this, but I, I don't like this limp right here. And that seems fishy to get him to bite for another big blind, milk him. He caught on to it. Wow, I can't believe I've been awake 24 hours. Over 24 hours now. 25 hours. Okay, this one folds around. I'm gonna be putting this all in. And yeah, I think, I think this is a definite shove hand with eight big blinds. Here we go. Good luck. Get through. Thinking, fold. And we get it through. Okay. All right. A little bit more breathing room. One more orbit. Oh, and there's a level up. Right on. Okay, that brings us. Uh, That bring us to twelve fifty, so another dollar twenty-five. Uh, all right, bring that. five slowly creeping it back up there Oh, poor farm. I did, uh, oh, yeah, I did. I have it on a delay. I actually do this time. I did a three minute delay. Um, but I did redesign the multi table, which you won't be able to fully see the effect because we only have, uh, one, uh, table open right now. But, um, I spent a lot of time last night on that. Um, so this is where I'll be sitting in, in when there'll be four boards here. So they'll, you'll see four you know, one, uh, four around here, <laughs> around me, 
and uh <laughs> can't remember the last time you're awake for 24 hours yeah <laughs> yeah I, I, well, I pulled quite a few uh 24 hour sleepless nights working on this stream um uh multiple times uh but uh yeah this is going to be the four board setup um so it, you can't get the full effect unless all four boards are out there but that's what it's going to look like. Okay, another person's out. Right. <laughs> I don't know why, I just decided to put a, a delay on it tonight. I, 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 I debated, I turned it on, then I turned it off, and then I turned it back on. I think it was a pretty good thing that I did because we ended up getting 80 people come in there. So. Okay. Oh, I should have put it all in. Thank you. What was I thinking? This one gets all the way around. All right, going all in. Here we go. Aces versus eights. Hold, hold. Yes. All right, 20 big blinds. Two. Wow, we might be going deep into this one. That was a good double up. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, I did. Uh, you were right, and uh, that's why I did it. And um, uh, because yeah, it, it it did it, it looks way better now. Um, and and I'm okay, you know. I, I I come out of 3D, go to 2D for that. But I've been spending most of the time on the four tables in that sort of scene because it seems to work well. And I like being in the middle. But the only problem with the uh, being in the middle there of the boards is that you can't throw the punch, so I have to modify to figure something out for the punch. Because if you throw the punch while I'm sitting on that multi-table view, uh, the punch comes up here, and I'm sitting down, you know, down uh, down there. Uh, so, but I figured it out. I already know what I'm going to do. Uh, I thought of the idea tonight while I was streaming. Um, uh, so, uh, I think I make it work. It might be a little bit odd but uh it'll like when the punch happens i'll just set it so that it'll switch my photo up my camera up to here in that multi board because there's plenty of room for it up there and then uh, then the punch will happen and then it'll, it'll set me back down so it'll, it'll 
it'll be all right. Wow, you can't even believe that uh, we are running deep. I ran pretty deep in uh, a lot of the tournaments. I did re-enter a couple um, just because of bad beats early on. Um, but I seem to have um, I seem to be running deeper in tournaments. You know, maybe not getting to the final table, but actually getting into at least the min cash has become. A little bit easier than it used to be. I think partly, you know, has something to do with the fact that I'm streaming. Because when I wasn't streaming, um, you know, it was just kind of like you're not accountable. You know, there's nobody watching, and you're just like, I'll, I'll just put it all in, you know, or whatever. And now it, it kind of forces you to think more. Plus, you have other people watching, and then you know they might. Um, fear of criticism as well like what you do that for you know things like that all of a sudden we moved from i think we're in last place in this tournament now we're 27th place at 46. um we might lose 46 left so when's the next pay jump then we might hit another pay jump another level up Yeah, we're close to another level up. Another two dollars and fifty cents. Ooh, like back above a hundred here. Keep going. Oh, I think I drank a gallon of gallon of uh, hydration here okay <sighs> 24 hour swings goes for work or playing or uh, Poker or There we go. There's a level up. That was uh, two dollars and fifty cents more. Okay. Uh, coursework 
Or from are you, are you a, a teacher? Or or uh first coursework um, student? We're thirty one out of forty five. with the next yeah, page one. So, 36. 45, we're getting down to 36. You make 1750, and then make an additional 250. Okay. 25 hours staying awake. Okay, if we keep going deep in this, be another be over 30 hours of staying awake. Hey, you know what I found interesting um, was that the when they made the switch to allowing you to put it in big lines i, I no longer worried about like I, I used to check constantly like what the top players had um for 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 chips and with the big line uh activated the way it is i don't even pay attention i don't even bother with that anymore i'm like hey i got you know 14 big lines or i got 15 big lines or 20 or 10 and be like gonna play my stack really you know and play a 10 big blind stack and not worry about it and not feel the pressure that i need to like double up and try to catch up with them it's like it's almost like taking the, the tortoise route instead of the hare route i think i used to be play like more like a hare it's like yeah i gotta i gotta i gotta double up i gotta double up i gotta get a double up you know i gotta catch up to these guys but it's more like just steady and try to make it get there and keep going and i think that's made a big difference now especially when i get close to being in the money now i'm a little bit more like hey you know i had like eight big lines or whatever and i'm just gonna stick it in there stick it you know stick to it and fold 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 make the money and then you know but like this case i was down i think to like I don't know, like four big lines or something and i was like right there next to the money and then um, hit the money and then doubled up. Ah, that's right. You told me that. Computer science. Wow. Yeah, I don't know if I told you I went to Cal Poly in, in, in California. Change his battery two or three times since I've been streaming.
Yeah, so I'm like below the average tax size. And it doesn't even bother me anymore. I can remember when I was always frustrated when I was below the average tax size. Now it's just like, you know what? Don't even worry about that. You just look at the big blinds and know that I have so many orbits to try and make something happen. And it seems to be working pretty well. Just stay focused on that and not worry about it. Yeah, I can understand being in the computer lab for that long. Being stuck on some kind of complicated logic uh, issue with the program. Down to 40 now. 20 out of 40. Yeah, it does. You're right. It makes it easy to, to figure out the jamming ranges. Um, I don't, it just simplifies everything, I think. The whole way of thinking is totally changed. Plus, you can see whatever, you know, it's easier to tell how many big blinds they have. <laughs> just, uh, just make for me. It, I, I, at first, it was a little weird. I was like, "What? I don't, I don't understand. I don't know." But I mean, I used to calculate when I played live tournaments. I calculate how many big blinds I got. But it was always difficult to look around the table and try to figure out how many big blinds everybody else approximately has. And uh, I wasn't used to it in live poker tournaments because I hadn't seen it before. I hadn't seen, you know, because I. America's card room didn't have it at the time. So 28 out of 39 is close to another page jump. I hope I don't fall asleep on you guys. I should have a, 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 there must be a way that I can put like how long I've been streaming on the stream that because I, I started streaming, wait, I think I can see how long I've been streaming in my, in my, uh, in settings or something here. Um, I thought it did say, yeah. I don't see it. Hmm. I thought it was in there. I thought I could see. Oh, wait. I can see on the page. Oh, nine hours and 35 minutes.
taking so long? Okay. Fuck it, nines. Alright, I think this is a good. Uh, the question is. Um, I think this is a shove. And I'm doing it. Ace King. Hold. Yes. Oh, split. Shit. Ah. Ah. Damn. Twenty six out of thirty seven. Oh, there's a level up. Right on. So I think it's another two dollars and fifty cents. Hey Jacob. Oh hey, I'm uh, I'm live broadcasting. So just go ahead and start. Okay. Hmm. Oh yeah. Yeah, 250 for my bank, bro. If you can't shut this door, I'd appreciate it. Uh, you can, uh, keep her in here, I think it's best. Yeah. So, let me add the 250. We take it down. All right, get some more breathing room. Okay, well, um, yeah, maybe we'll see you when you get back. Um, hopefully, because it, 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 if I do see you when you get back, that means I'm running deep or I went deeper. 
Um, yeah, this is a tough spot here. Huh. These two big lines. I either have to put it all in or fold it. I think that's the only the only thing to do with this. I mean just my personal opinion. Um to put it all in or fold it. Uh and I think he's got an ace. I think his ace is possibly bigger than mine. But it would be just kind of a letdown if I hold it the best hand. I think Goldmaker has an ace. I think he's repping he has one. Yeah, I'm pretty sure he has the ace. Pretty decent ace. Got it through, whatever it was. open for a minute there. Kind of funny. Oh. Oh. Thirteen minutes. Five out of thirty three. Okay, well, here's a hand that uh, we're gonna get all in right here. Okay, this is it? This is, uh, see if Ace King will bring us another double up. Oh wow! Okay, wow. Interesting. So we got. I I I. I think we just gotta go for it. Here. We're gonna go. Let's go, man. Let's do battle. Here we go. 
Come on. Ace Jack, Ace King. Oh, and there's the Jack. Whoa. What the? Wow. What a trip. That was a trip. Hey, jump. Uh, I don't think we can. Fold. Okay. Yeah, twenty-seven out of uh, thirty. Twenty-seventh place out of thirty-two players. Wow, we are running deep. Um, I've been kind of on fumes pretty much like most of this uh, last half of the turn. I mean, gotta, I like I'll get up and drop back down, but I seem to be hanging in there. I can't even believe I've come this far. Give me a spade. Yes! Yes! I just figured it was two, 2.3 big blinds more. I'm like, okay, might as well just call. Yeah, right on. Um, yeah, this one's going all in. Um, them. I think I just gotta put it in. All right, take it down. Look at that. We're coming back with 15 big blinds, and then we got King Queen. King Queen. I mean, we're down to seven. Um, that's the way it's been. This tournament has been like this: up, down, up, down, up, down. But I keep. Going deeper and deeper, and just up, down, up, down, just anywhere between 20 blinds, 30 blinds down to seven blinds back up and then down. No real big stacks. 
just uh, just just milking whatever you know, like a 10, 20 big line stack the whole time. I'm gonna put this all in again. A king queen, uh, 13. There's a four, five big line here. If I can push through this guy here and get to him, if he calls me, that's fine. I'm risking five big lines, so I mean. And, and it's a good enough hand, and we get it through again. And, and yeah, wow. Interesting, interesting. Wow, wow, wow. We're going to hit another E jump here, I think. Uh, 29. Uh, now, this is another one. Uh, um yeah i think this time i'm gonna let it go i, I just I, maybe mathematically speaking i should do this but for some reason i don't feel like it's the right the right thing to do right now and i don't know what it is but my gut is telling me do not shove this i don't know why i could be totally wrong but i'm gonna list okay let's see what happens i'm gonna listen to my gut because this, this guy's probably gonna get called there's the five. Five, five. No, wow, I would have won. Ah, <laughs> uh, shoot. Oh well, I, I didn't feel it. So it was probably mathematically speaking, I should have shoved that a five there. Um, but I don't know for some reason I didn't feel it. I, I, I guess because I had just shoved twice, and I was kind of like, I don't, am I gonna get another one through? And Ace Five off just isn't that strong, but oh well. Seventeenth place out of twenty-nine. Uh, we should be getting another page pay jump right now. Um. Oh, there it is. There it is. Ah, uh, twenty-nine. 29. Let's be down to 27. Yeah, 27 now. So we just got another $2.50. So we bring that up. I can change. Let's see. Uh, 98. Uh, okay. Can't think straight here. Okay, we're in break. Okay, so we are up over 100 now. All right. Okay. Yeah, we almost uh, break even point here for the, the long 10 hours of uh, playing poker. Okay, so uh, I'm going to take a break. Um, and uh, we I will uh, be right back. So um, you guys make sure you stay tuned because uh, we're, we might make the final table. Or at least I'm going to try.
Almost missed that. Okay. We got 15 big blinds here. Wow. We're running deep again. I haven't made a final table yet, but we've run pretty deep every single time. Just getting close to the final table and not quite making it. And maybe it, it, this will change. We shall see. Uh, what did I study at Cal Poly? I just saw that. Sorry, I, I missed that. Uh, I studied mathematics. Uh, uh, I have uh, a math degree, a science degree, uh, a general, um, uh, and then a liberal studies degree with a minor in anthropology, cultural anthropology. Sorry, I didn't, I didn't see that. Ah, clean, clean jack off. Um, hmm. Clean jack off. 17th place out of 27. I'm thinking that uh, I'm going to fold this. Yeah. I'm gonna fold, fold, fold here. Um, again, I would like to try to get... I've been here three or four times tonight and not quite make the final table. Um... And I keep saying I'm going to be really tight. I'm going to fold, 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 and then I'll get a hand and I'm getting it all in and write it on the, you know, close to the bubble of the final table and then out. So it looks like I laddered up again. Okay. <clears throat> uh, okay, here's a, here we go. Oh, same hand. <clears throat> okay. Um, I ladder up again. All right. Um, I think this one needs to go all in. Um, I, I guess I could just raise that, but it seems like, I don't know, it seems like I could put it all in. I mean, here here we go again, you know, I mean, it's like one of those things. I mean, you know, it's a good hand, and, it, and, and I got 15 big blinds. I could have just raised it up. So I could have just raised it up, or I put it all in. Um, max pressure, putting it all in, um, but also tournament life at risk. Uh, it's one of the bigger stacks, 26 line or 24 stacks. If the, one of the two smaller stacks call me, calls me, I'll still have chips, but uh, if I lose, one of the bigger stacks calls my tournament life is at risk. Okay, all right, we made it. We got it through. Okay, excellent. I am definitely folding 10 9 suited. Um, <clears throat> okay, so wow, this is it's pretty amazing. Um, and I've been in this position multiple times tonight out of the nine hours or eight hours I've been streaming. Um, I don't know how many tournaments I entered six, seven, eight. I don't know what it was. Quite a few. And then I re entered a few times in, in some of them. Um, so, yeah, it's just interesting that uh, I've been here. Okay. All right. That's an easy decision there. 16 out of 26. Quite a few below me here. Um, hmm. 
Okay. Resting twenty. Yeah, no, we didn't ladder up yet again, but uh, we're close to another ladder up there. Oh no, twenty-five, twenty-five. So, oh, but the next jump is five dollars, so that's, that's cool. Um, so it starts jumping five dollars at a time, and then uh, five dollars, and then it goes up to six dollars, and then when you're on the final table, yeah. Then with um, there's a, if, if I make the final table, I could uh, they could actually end up positive pressure. Uh, before miss. Wow, that'd be incredible. We end up positive for the, for the after it was it was a tough night. Like constantly getting. I mean, I ran into two sets of Jack. Crazy, crazy stuff with that thing. earlier on. Early in the session, just getting sucked out on left and right, and getting. You know, big hands in, in that. I'm holding this. And another fold. Oh wow, I've been awake 26 hours now, I think. 25, 26 hours. Okay, Ace King suited. All right. This uh, gonna be going, going in. See what happens. Uh, we'll uh, raise it up, or maybe we should just shove it. Uh, I think we'll just shove it. Well, if he calls uh, and we lose, we'll at least have chips left. So, regardless, I think we're getting... Okay, we take it down. All right. We keep going. Keep uh, chipping away a little bit at a time. And, um, you know, we just keep, keep progressing forward. It's uh, 17th place out of 24. There's only 24 players left. There was a total of... 439 players in this tournament, and there's 24 left. The $5 entry fee, it's a $2,500 guarantee, $5.50 entry fee. It is a $2,500 guarantee. There's 481 at the top.
Uh, I think I'm too I'm too early to, to shove this one. One, two, three, four, five, six. That's borderline. That's a borderline shove right there. Small stack, small stack, big, big, small stack. You know what? I'm gonna, I'm gonna fold. I'm gonna fold. I don't know. I, I considered it because if he called, I still have chips. If he called, I still have chips. If he called, I still have chips. If anybody else called, tournament life at risk. But um, I'm, maybe that was. Uh, uh, I'm not sure. I might have. Maybe I needed to put that in. I'm not. Queen. Oh, there's a king. Oh, and an ace. Ace six. Man. Twice I decided to fold and didn't, didn't capitalize on that. Wow. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe I'm playing too tight. But I got killed. When I got it in on the base jack. The last time, right before the final table, and the guy had ace queen. Ace king. I think it happened twice. So I'm not sure. Kind of a uh, gun shy, I guess. Uh, at, uh, at it because I, I lost like two or three times tonight, right before the final table. With ace queen, ace, ace jack. So we're getting close to another uh, level up. Can have them with 
right here at this table. So, um, good. Okay, and this won't be me. Aces for face clean and king 10. Freeway all in. King. Aces take it down. Two out. We are like probably on another A jump. Nope, not quite. Nice little double up right now with, with the V, the key to, to um, possibly having a shot to make in the final table. If you don't double up, then it's going to get more difficult. Yeah, oh, you're back, Chloroform. Yeah, sitting there falling asleep, I'm trying to stay awake. This is a deep run. Um, if I can double up, like I was saying, if I can double up, uh, I might have a shot at the final table. But if I don't double up soon, it's going to be tough. Stay awake. Ooh. All weird. Huh. 
not sure what happened there. I, mean, I don't think I fell asleep and then timed out. No, I kind of went freaky. Check the stream after I'm done. See what that looks like. I must be nodding off though. Feeling it. Ah. Uh... Have a speed jump. Okay. Boom. Thirteen of nineteen. Fifteen of nineteen now. Okay. Here we go. We have uh Uh, wow, so there's a raise over here. Uh, this is tough. With this raise here, I, I don't think I'm good. Oh, uh, it makes it hard. Uh, I'm gonna let it go. Uh, wow, I know it seems kind of nitty, but it only has six big blinds, but uh, this guy raised from under the gun. If it folded to me, I would have I would have done it. Um, I think I'm gonna hold out for the next pay level and uh, um, then get it in. Then um, the next pay level should be coming up. Yeah, we should hit the next pay level. It's another five dollars. Ace King versus Queen Nine. There's the King. Okay, oh, but we didn't get anybody out. All right. Oh, there we go. Somebody got out. Okay, that's the next. That is the next pay jump. So we made it to the next pay jump. Good. Wow. That's pretty cool. I didn't think we were going to get back to uh, almost breaking even. After the bad start they had. With the bad beats I ran into in the set. Okay. Yeah, this guy's all in. So when's the next pay jump here? If we make another pay jump, that would be good. Uh, so it's 16. So yeah, yeah, we're gonna. There's another pay jump coming right up. Another another five. We just need to hold out.
Yeah, it does. It does seem shallow. Uh, 13 to 19 with 6.5 big blinds. Really shallow field. It, yeah, it is odd. Okay, there's another one in this one. That's another level up. Right on. Alright, well this is this one here is uh this one's going all in. I think I think, I think it's five big blinds and then ace ace eight is good enough. I'm hoping that maybe it holds around here. So we gotta put this up to one ten. And what we got and I don't know. Now he's raising up, and uh, I'm wondering. I'm wondering. I should hold. Well, let's see. If somebody shoves, uh, then then I'll I'll know. But I think uh, it's a tough one. I think I just gotta go with it. Um, I'm gonna put it all in. Hope he doesn't have a bigger ace. Okay. All right. Good. We got the ace. Hold. Yes. All right. All right. There we go. Double up. Okay. Excellent. Right, there's 14 players left. Um. We got next pay jump. Is. Yeah, we're gonna be near an another pay jump here. Uh, two more players get out. We'll, get, we'll hit another pay jump. And man, the final table is close. It's really close, but we are very low stack. Uh, hopefully, a couple others get out soon. But um, I don't know. That was a nice double up. We needed that. That gives us a little breathing room. can't believe I'm this deep and this is like like I said the third or fourth time tonight where I've been this close to the final table and can't quite make it King Ace Jack. Okay, all right, nobody's out. Uh, Ace five. Hmm. Put it all in. Um, I think, I think we have to here. Hope two folds here. One more fold. Come on, fold. Yes, get it through. All right. Um, ace three. We're gonna hold off on this one, let it go. Place out of 14. Uh. 
Um, definitely not gonna. I mean, I have to shove it or I have to fold it. I'm gonna fold it. And a fourteen. Ninth is uh, 13. Nine out of 13. Nice place out of 13 players left. Okay, there's an all in. Off. Collision pack to take effect. Come on. I don't think I want to call him. Nope. I'm holding. I'll let the collision go. Jack, this ace Jack. That's the ace and Jack on the river. Wow, okay, there's one more out and a level up. Okay. Alright, so we do level up. Um six dollars and twenty-five cents more. Sixteen eighty now. Wow, cannot believe that I have uh, pretty much broke even for this session. It started out so bad. Incredible. And we're close to the final table. I gotta let my dog in Give me one second here.
Oh, uh, there's a slot for me. Alright, here's a collision up here. Tens versus aces. And the aces take it down, another one out. Holy crap. Now we're in hand for hand play. For final table? Oh my god. Wow. I'm like on the bubble of the final table. I can't even believe it. I cannot even believe it. Not even believe it. Wow. Huh. Crazy. This is insane. If the very last tournament I'm in, I make the final table. And I have eight big blinds. If I can hold out, I might just make the final table. I just that's crazy. Okay. Holding. Wait, it still says there's eleven. Why was it hand for hand fight? Maybe the final table is ten? No. Ten. Nine, right? Whoa. Why it says hand for hand unless that's just not updated yet. Oh yeah, there's ten remaining. Okay, so that hasn't updated. There's ten remaining. If I look on the tournament page, that will soon update. Sometimes it takes a little bit, but ten remaining. We are on the bubble of the final table. I, I'm gonna I'm gonna make the final table, guys. Oh, okay. Ace four. Okay. Alright, I was hoping there would be a collision factor, uh, and I wouldn't be the one, uh, in the collision here. Um, yeah, um, I would like to make the final table, even if I get out, first one to get out of the final table, I, I, I just want to make the final table. Um, I, again, okay, uh, yeah, I'm folding, okay. Let's see what I, I mean, this guy has to, he's got to put it in. Okay, ace 10. There it is. Final table. Made the final table. Right? What's going on? Yes, I made the final table. Okay, uh, final table. Um, here we go. You're on the final table. Wow, exciting. Haha, <laughs> very cool. Finally made a final table. on fire this is my final table fire uh so when i'm at a final table we put the fire on incredible incredible made the final table huh wow didn't think i was gonna do it wow this is, this is insane it's insane because I, i've been like floating between six seven eight nine ten to twenty big blinds like pretty much the entire tournament i think maybe at one point i had 30 big blinds that was the max and i've just been up and down up and down in that little range all this time and i'm at the final table and that was a, a ladder up too i think uh yeah let me check that i get to i get i think wow uh let's see i believe that um right one we have um yeah we laddered up i mean again yeah that's a big jump there um 
decent sized jump. Twelve dollars and fifty cent jump. So add twelve fifty. So one hundred and twenty nine. Uh, is what we're up to now. We actually are ahead now. Incredible. Uh, yeah, let's hold this. Um, yeah, we are 129.30 and I think I am the smallest. No, this is a five. Yeah, I, I, hang in and maybe get another another pay jump here the next pay jump goes up about 20 bucks or 11 11 12 dollars so i'll take it because right now i'm at 129 i'm actually ahead right now that's that's crazy i did not think i was going to make it ahead today at all but final table it is thanks for form appreciate it uh, I didn't think I'd make it, but I'm, I'm definitely surprised that I'm even here. <laughs> Final table. Ooh. It's a 420 at the top, so if I can somehow double up, double up, double up, who knows? Never know. I don't know which looks looks better with the lights on or the lights off. This one with the flames on or off. So you guys let me know which one looks better. Okay. Alright. Ace nine. Ace nine. Ace nine with three point five big blinds. If it folds to us, we are going in. Um, okay, we're all in. We are all in. Wow, They're, it's not going to get through, is it? That'd be crazy if 3.5 big blinds gets through. I can't see that. He's going to call. He can call with anything. There's the ace. Yes. Yes. Oh, my God. Wow, we are surviving. We're like a cockroach, man. <laughs> I can get another pay jump if that four big blind stack gets out. One to the right of me. This guy. This guy over 
there, down there. Hmm. Change the title. Uh, okay. Change it to like final table. Final table 2500 guarantee. Oh, there's a level up. Um, Changed or not? Okay. I can post on Twitter too. This is just fishing me in. Yeah, yeah. Well, I'm not gonna play the game. I gotta, I gotta. Yeah, just fishing me in. Okay, I just uh, put a tweet, and I did change the stream title, um, but if you can check and see if it's changed. It didn't seem... I wasn't sure if it changed or not. Let me see. Um, hmm. Okay, uh, well, we're going to put this in and hope for the best. Oh yeah, final table 2500. It did change. Let's see if this gets through. it run into jacks all right wow wow that was quite the day of streaming 
10 hours of streaming. Incredible. Um, let's go over to the stage here um, and just sit and relax and reflect about the streaming. So uh, I need to update the cash uh, because I cashed for 61 and I can't remember what the jump was on that. Let's see. Uh, I'll keep, I'll leave that, uh, keep watching if you want to, um, actually we could watch, we continue to watch this final table. Let me go back over there. So, uh, yeah, we can continue to watch the final table. Uh, pretty, pretty incredible, uh, day. Um, so let's see here. Uh, we are at 3625, then we we're at 4875, then we went up to 6125. So that was a difference of 61. 25 uh, minus 48.75. So another 12.50 we went up. So if I add the 20, 129. So we actually finished at 141. Uh, and 80 cents for the uh, session. Uh, wow. That worked out pretty well. That worked out pretty well. So, uh, yeah. Wow. Um, yeah, it turned out to be a profitable day, which is crazy. Uh, um, yeah. Um, so anyway, uh, I don't know if you guys want to watch the final table or not but um I'm, I'm thinking i'm pretty tired um and you can catch it on america's card room um but we are out we did uh make it to I forget what place um find out so we finished in uh eighth place you can see right here eighth place oh you can't see all right, let me, let me take us over to the stage here. Um, main stage, and I think I can show it to you there. So, oh, maybe I can't. Let me show it to you there, okay. Um, so, we did make eighth place. Uh, we ended up being positive for the day, which I totally did not expect that at all. Um, and uh, we had a, we made it, okay, so the accomplishments were that um, uh, it, it, uh, publishers were, we made affiliate, uh, Alex optimal rated the channel, rated, uh, our channel. And, uh, because we had so many viewers, we got, that's all we were missing was an average of three viewers. That's all we had to do. And, uh, average of three viewers. And so we, um, Hey, what's up? Yeah, yeah, 11 hour stream. Yeah, um, what's up, uh, Dag Dad Poker? Uh, so we, uh, Alice Optimal rated the stream, and we, we only needed an average of three viewers to make affiliate. Boom, put us out to affiliate, and and then we got subs, every, and 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 it was great. It was a great, it was a great 10 hour stream. Probably the, it was the best stream I've ever had here. It was incredible and i made a final table after being you know having a rough start at the beginning um hey thanks thanks Dak, Dak dad poker i appreciate it so uh we're just kind of reviewing what happened and then again i kind of close it out um but we made the final table uh one final table out of i don't know i think maybe seven or eight tournaments i played in i'd get to the final table in like two or three four of them and every time i'd get there i'd get out and this time i made it the very last tournament i made it to the final table and, and ended up getting out eighth place but uh, unfortunately um but i did end up positive for the day and i didn't think that was going to happen so and and like i said we got we got subs we got primes we even got bid donations we got we became an affiliate in this in this 10 hours of streaming and uh it was it was a great success and i want to thank all of you out there in the chat for for doing it for making it happen and, and appreciating what i've created and what i continue to add and i look forward to uh streaming and and hanging out with you again in the near future
I will be working uh, working on it uh, once I get some sleep because I've been up for over 25 hours now. So I'm going to go get some sleep and then come back and work on a few of the things. I want to get that punch, the chat, that, that, that poker, you can actually punch me. I don't know if you can do it from here. Hold on. Oh, doesn't work here. I might have to get it to work here. I, I don't think it'll work here, but but from from when I'm when we're at the table, Jack Dad Poker, you can punch me in the face now just by typing in uh, explanation point punch. Um, yeah, yeah, 480 up top would have been nice, wouldn't it? Yeah, <clears throat> yeah, you saw it, but I didn't know if Jack Dad Poker had seen it. Uh, uh, yeah, so. Um, and, 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 uh, you know, I, I, yeah, anyway, I just want to thank everybody for being here and, and I enjoyed it and thanks everyone so much. Thanks for the chloroform. Thanks for the, the sub sub, uh, um, and, uh, everybody else who sub it was, uh, uh, uncle slacker and, uh, ghost. Thank you so much for being here and everybody else who watched the stream. Thank you so much. Um, Everybody, uh, you know, have have a great uh, day, and we'll see you. Uh, we'll see you the next time.